Playing as a trillionaire is the best. With so much money, it's impossible to count. So I put together a movie featuring the greatest adventures I've had. And we did things only trillionaires can afford and enjoyed life to the fullest. But this movie isn't just about us. There's other trillionaires too. And we took some pretty amazing things from them. From the fastest car to the most expensive boat, we did it all. Whatever I wanted, we got. Whatever I touched, upgraded. Millionaires, billionaires live nothing like trillionaires. So grab your popcorn and your soda. Sit back, relax, and if you want to become a trillionaire, smash like and punch that subscribe button. Enjoy the movie. Franklin is broke. He's got no money. And if we don't do anything about it, he's going to starve to death on the streets. I've got a plan. I've pinpointed the top five locations where the most money is stored. One of those locations is in a plane. An actual plane. And another one is on a train. But there's a problem. Even with all of the money in the world, we won't make a trillion dollars. Which is why I'm investing this as we go throughout the episode. I gotta buy businesses. Bars, clubs, you name it, we gotta buy it. And hopefully, with enough luck on my side, we'll make a trillion dollars. If not, I think we'll have to, uh, yeah, cause a bit of destruction for the competitors. <laughs> and hopefully, when we become a trillionaire, I'll be able to get shot back and buy the biggest mansion in GTA 5. Franklin, you see that dream just over the screen? That could be yours. Right, here's my plan, guys. Everywhere in Los Santos is an opportunity. You see these mystery houses with dollar signs? They're businesses to invest in. And you see these blue things with dollar signs? They're ATMs we can rob from. You see this green thing with a dollar sign? That's one of the big locations we're gonna heist today. Yep, it's gonna be a busy day. But to kick things off, I'm gonna need a gun. If I'm lucky, Simeon might just have one job for me. You know, something to pay me a little bit of money so I can finally buy some guns and, uh, you know, actually do some of these crazy heists. <laughs> Alright, Franklin, let's see if Simeon's got a job. I got a job for you. Pays a little bit. Can you get a car for me? It's just round the block. Sure thing, Simeon. Send me the location. Alright, nice. I got myself a job. And it's not too far away. Why couldn't Simeon do it? I mean, it's only around the block. Uh-oh. Well, I've got the car, but the owner is standing right next to it, guys. We could get a wanted level and go to jail, Franklin. Whatever we do, we gotta be extra careful. And we need to make sure he never calls the police. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. All right, here we go. I'm just gonna run. Run, Franklin. Run, 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 run. <laughs> yeah. Excuse me. I need your car. Is he down? Yes. All right, guys. He won't be moving. Okay, Franklin, jump inside. <laughs> yeah. And that was the easiest robbery ever. Oh my day. Simeon is gonna be so happy with this. It's a pretty nice car as well. It's the Divesti 8, guys. Check it out. I love the exhaust around the back. Hey, Simeon, look what I got for you. The Divesti 8. <laughs> now pay up, buddy. I'm gonna need some money today. Voila. Check it out, guys. What a beautiful car. And I just got 50,000 big ones. Oh my days. Thanks, Simeon. We can finally buy some food and some actual guns to do these heists with. Afternoon, good sir. What can I buy for 50,000 dollars. Let's see. Okay, we've got pistols. Yes, carbine rifle 1500 And this, a thousand dollars? Right, I'm gonna get the carbine rifle and fully stock up the ammo, guys. So we ain't messing around here. And let's get a shotgun, but I wanna get this one. No, wait, do they have the heavy shotgun? Where is... Oh, ten thousand dollars? That's kind of a lot of money. No, I think we'll go with uh, this one. <laughs> stock up on that. I need something to use in a car, so we may as well get one of those. Guys, a minigun is eleven thousand dollars. I'm tempted. Let's go for a minigun. And I could do with an RPG, to be honest. That will come in very handy when I do these crazy heists. So now the only thing left to do is to target the five heist locations. And as we do, invest the money wisely. And by the time we're done, we should be a trillionaire and own half of Los Santos. How crazy is that gonna be? Well, here goes nothing. We gotta get a trillion dollars without dying. <laughs> Alright, Franklin, here we go. My first ever heist. One of five. Take out the guards. Where's the guards? Okay, just one guard. Ooh, get him. Get him. Get him, Franklin. Alright, guard down. Guard down. Guard down. I'll be taking that pistol. Oh, thank you. All right, I gotta hack the vault shutter. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Please, nobody call the police. They've already been called. I've got five stars, guys. Oh my days. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. Hack the vault. Give me one second. This is really difficult to do, but I'm gonna try my best, guys. I gotta get the right fingerprint. Uh, so that's the top. No, that's the. I don't know. Oh, this is so tough, dude. Uh, yes, yes, I've done it. I've done it. <laughs> that took so long to do. All right, I'm in, guys. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. How much money are we gonna get with this take? Oh my days. I can see gold. I can see cash. Guys, I'm getting $100 million for every stack of gold I get. That's insane. Okay, now we just got the final bit, guys. One more stack of cash and one more pile of gold. You know the drill, Franklin. Grab it all. 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 Come on, buddy. Come on. I don't want to speak too soon, but I think I've just grabbed $10 billion from this take, guys. We're already 
1% of the way to being a trillionaire. All right, where are the police at? I think we're okay. Guys, they haven't caught up yet. They haven't caught up. Go, Franklin. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, guys. They're coming over the bridge. All right, Franklin. Don't worry. I've got a plan. I've got an idea. I need to find a way down into those sewers, guys. If I can do that, then I can find a tunnel and lose the wanted level. Here we go. I'm in the sewers. <laughs> now, I need to find a tunnel to hide inside. Oh, yes. There's one right here. All right, quickly, quickly, quickly. Get inside. No, Franklin. Get inside the tunnel. There's a helicopter above you, my friend. Nice. Nice. This is perfect, guys. They'll never come down here. This is where the trams go. The trams. Uh-oh. They can still see me, though. I think I'll just drive down into one of those tunnels. They'll never catch me in there. Guys, this was the easiest heist ever. I wonder how much money I actually took. Yes! I've lost the wonder level. Oh, my days. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money, guys. $15 billion? <laughs> Franklin, we better celebrate. We already made $15 billion, and there's still plenty other places to make money from. You're about to see how investing works, guys. I've got the Arcadius Business Center here. It's for sale. If we get this, I'm gonna own the entire business center in Los Santos. So I gotta walk inside, cool up Global Invest, and just basically let them know, like, hey, I wanna buy this place. And boom, just like that, I've already purchased it. Did cost me a billion dollars, mind you, but that will make a trillion dollars, believe me. And there's a few more ways I wanna make some money, guys. You see this? This is every single stock in GTA 5. And I'm gonna put all of my money on Fly US. Because trust me, I've got a plan. <laughs> Before we do the next heist, if we simply just put, like, I don't know, a few billion dollars on this. I've just purchased 24 million shares in Fly US. You may as well call me the owner of an airline right now. In order to make this even more money, I'm gonna do a little trip to the airport first, and then we'll do another heist. This is called taking out the competitors. If there's no other airlines around in GTA 5, then how on earth are they gonna compete? <laughs> Fly US is going to soar. So let's just take out the Adios Airlines. No one likes them. Which one's this one? Air Emu? Yeah, yeah, Air Emu. You can get out of here as well. Oh, there's another one here. Guys, I gotta get all of them. So this one is from the airline Kapira. All right, we don't like that one either, guys. You know, we ain't invested in that one. I'm Fly US side. We're all Fly US, basically, guys. This one as well. Take out that jet. Looks like this one does quite a long distance as well, guys. It's double story. And Air Hurlia. Who's even heard of those? No, get out of here. I don't care if you're a postal plane. You don't belong in the airport. Another Adios airline? Are you kidding me? Come on, guys. Get out of here. <laughs> you're too much competition for me. Fly US is really having a bad time. I'm not seeing any Fly US planes around here. Well, that's all about to change because three, two, one, boom! <laughs> and just like that, the planes are destroyed. There could only be one airline in Los Santos, and believe me, it's gonna be Fly US. But you see that plane in the distance, guys? That's a plane carrying money to another country. Yeah, it's gonna be wild. <laughs> and I'm heisting it right now. All right, hide behind this big box of money. All right, get him. Get him. Nice. How much money do you think's in there, guys? Oh my days, they got a bike as well. Okay, we gotta get this money before the plane takes off. It's gonna get dangerous otherwise. Oh no, it's one of these. I gotta hack it. Top one goes with bottom one, and this one goes with that one. I'm in. I'm in, guys. Success. That took too long. Oh, no. The plane's taking off, guys. It's taking off. I can hear the plane. Okay, looks like it's just me and you, buddy. Easy peasy. You didn't even see me. Okay, get moving. Get moving. Get moving. There's another one. There's another one. There's another guy. There's another guy. There's two of them. Oh, my days, dude. They got missiles in here. This is insane. All right, head to the loop room, Franklin. We got one more to hack. Okay, let's just connect them all to the top. Okay, nice. That goes there. Goes there. Maybe that one goes there. And this one goes there, right? Oh, my days. I got it right. That was so quick, guys. The luck is on my side right now. That's a juggernaut. That's a juggernaut, dude. Franklin, use the minigun. Use the minigun, buddy. He's already shooting me, but I got him. Yes, get down. All right, let's grab the cash. Yes, there's three stacks of gold here. I'm gonna make billions on this, guys. Billions! <laughs> I actually think we might become a trillionaire today. It really depends how the investments are gonna go. Perfect. I've grabbed everything we need. Oh my days, there it goes. Okay, chase it down, Franklin. Chase it down. Quick, get on the bike. Get out of here, buddy. Get out of here. Go, go, go. I don't want to lose the cash. I've already lost it. I've already lost it, dude. I've already lost the cash. There's literally a box of money. Oh my days, Franklin. We are so dead. We're so dead, buddy. We gotta land this. We gotta land this well. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Land it. Oh. How do we survive that, dude? Okay, I gotta find the cash. It's on my radar. That green dollar sign. That's where I need to go to. Okay, Franklin, hop off the bike. You know the drill. Grab the cash. There's a lot of money in this box, and it's all mine. Oh my days. <laughs> That was a lot of money. I just got one and a half billion dollars from that box. From this heist alone, I've made almost 10 billion. I've already lost the wanted level. They didn't even see me. Guys, that was insane. <laughs> I lost the wonder level. No one caught on. That was the best heist ever. I'm kind of tempted. I want to rob an ATM. How much money do you reckon we'll get from one of these? I haven't robbed one yet, so uh, maybe this could be like a trick to earning billions in my spare time. Let's access my computer. Put the little hack inside. There we go. External device. I got to get the red letters. That's how we're going to hack this. It's Vespucci. I already know it, guys. Vespucci, I'm in. The alarm's going off. I got two stars. That's okay. Wait, how much was that? Two, $2.9 million? $2.9 million. And the police still didn't even catch me. Me. <laughs> 
I got $2.9 million from robbing an ATM and no one cares. Are you kidding me? That's amazing. Okay, I'm gonna buy some more businesses. In fact, there's one coming up just around this corner. Oh, we're buying a chicken shop, I think. Yeah, it is. We're buying a chicken shop. All right, guys, this is gonna be my next business. <laughs> yeah, we're actually buying a chicken shop. Are you kidding me? Ba -ba -ba, ba -ba 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 -ba. All right, stand inside, Franklin. Cool up Global Invest. I wanna buy this place, thank you. Property poor. Nice, for $670,000. That won't make me much, but I've got a chicken shop now, guys. So if you want free chicken, subscribe to the channel, and I might just serve you. You gotta subscribe, though. If you don't subscribe, no chicken for you. I can buy the casino, are you kidding me? <laughs> guys, I'm buying the diamond resort. Let's go. Hey, guys, I'm buying the prison. Yeah, yeah, it's over now. We ain't going to jail. <laughs> How did I buy the prison? That's not even fair. Well, I'll take it anyway. No one's locking me up now. I am the new owner of the prison. So, conveniently, in Sandy Shores is the train heist. I've been waiting for this, because once every single day, a train will go through Sandy Shores, carrying a ton of money. Some of you guys may have seen it. Well, I am gonna break into that train and take the money. Oh yeah, it's a good heist. I've done it before, and believe me, there's a lot of money to be made. Just gotta watch out for those pesky police. Well, we've arrived. Ladies and gentlemen, this is where the heist begins. Park your car here, Franklin, and get ready to rumble, my friend. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming, it's coming! So I gotta break the train cylinders. Oh my days. Dude, okay, we don't have long. Okay, the cylinders. The red things, we gotta break them. Right, that one's broken. I'm gonna try and jump over the train. Is it possible? Y yes, I'm on. Uh-oh, they got Meriwether security on their way, guys. They were following just shortly behind. Don't lose the cylinders, Franklin. Come on, shoot them. Have I got them? I think I've got them. I've got them. Wait for the train to stop. I actually shot them. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, run, Franklin. Run, 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 run. They're still shooting us. This isn't even the police. This is Meriwether. They will actually kill me if I'm not careful. Right, the train stopped. Yes, this is one of the places I can make some money. Right, open it up. Bring out the drill. Cut through. Come on. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Open them up. Open them up, Franklin. Beautiful. Look at all that cash. <laughs> even more cash for me. Put it in the bag. 120 million. 240 million. We're gonna make a couple more billion in this, guys. I reckon with Heist alone, we're gonna make a hundred billion dollars. And once that's invested into every single business, just like we've done by tomorrow, that will easily be a trillion. Well, I'm getting out of here now. It was a pleasure doing business with all of you guys. Uh oh, they're not very happy. What are you doing now? Where are you guys? You're hiding behind the bushes? Well, I'll see you later. <laughs> I'm busy becoming a trillionaire, so have a good day, Meriwether. $80 billion? Are you kidding me? That's the most money I've made today so far. All right, Franklin, you know the drill. Put it all into Fly US. Guys, by the end of this video, when I sell every single share I have in Fly US, we're gonna make so much money. <laughs> we should, in fact, be a trillionaire and get that mega mansion on the hill. Since I own the prison, I think we can do the Pacific Standard heist now. Do you reckon the police will actually try and stop me? I mean, think about it. Think about it, guys. If I own the prison, where are they gonna send me? I'm pretty sure we might be able to do this without anybody catching us. <laughs> Let's try it out. I'm so interested. Yes, the person who owns the prison is also holding up the biggest bank in Los Santos. <laughs> da -da -da. Oh, hello, sir. Oh, you're running? No, 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 no. Get him, get him. Make sure he doesn't run away. Uh-oh, they called the police. Oh, no, what's going to happen? Right, I'm getting the guy who called the police. Whoop, 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 whoop. Whoop, whoop, who's terrified? Put your hand up. <laughs> All right, put the thermal charge on the gate. There we go, set, cover your eyes, watch out for the sparks. If anyone tries to escape, you're going down. I gotta make sure these align with the red line going through the center. If I miss, then we fall back. I'm in, I'm in, first try, let's go. Didn't even fail. <laughs> Franklin, we're gonna be the richest person in Los Santos by the end of this day, I promise you. 30, 60, 90, 120. Franklin, grab it quicker, 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 buddy, quicker. Wait, no, doesn't matter, take your time. The police are gonna do anything. <laughs> Honestly, not the best, guys. Only 1.7 billion down in this vault. I mean, let's think about it. That's not even 1%. That's just over 0.1% of a trillion. I shouldn't have done this, Franklin. This was just a mistake. A waste of time. If we want to become a trillionaire, we're gonna make a bit more money than this. Oh, afternoon, officers. Yeah, yeah, usual day. Just took a billion dollars. Yeah, 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 usual day, you know. <laughs> it's been good. It's been a good day, thank you. Me? No, I didn't do anything. Well, even if I did, you couldn't do anything about it. Okay, Franklin, put all of that money back into Fly US. And let's do the final heist. Hey, taxi, I'm gonna need to go somewhere far. Can you give me a ride? Thank you, my friend. It's been a pleasure. We're taking a holiday elsewhere. I've robbed every single location on the mainland, which is why we're going to North Yankton. <laughs> Let's go! This is it, guys. Oh my days, I've actually arrived. I don't believe it. So where's the door? How do I get in? There's a yellow marker. I'm gonna follow to the yellow marker. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Hello! <laughs> yeah. Oh, around here! Okay. Um, who's this guy? Are you my partner today? I don't need someone to help me out, buddy. I'm a solo heister, didn't you know? Okay, I've got a friend. I don't really know who he is. Um, he's just gonna be chilling here. Afternoon, my friend. How are you doing? Okay, let's do this heist, shall we? Hey, you! <laughs> yeah. Open the door! Trust me, things are gonna get messy otherwise. All right, Franklin, put the charge on the door. We're opening this up. Detonate the... 
Don't do it right next to you. Are you crazy? Do you have a death wish, Franklin? <laughs> All right, I'm in. Oh, we can loot the storage room. Oh my days, they got diamonds in here, guys. From the casino. Are you kidding me? This is mine, basically. I'm just taking back my own property. I grab the diamonds. Grab the diamonds. Grab the diamonds. This is cheap. This is so cheap, dude. Sixty thousand dollars. Why are we bothering? I, I want to become a trillionaire, dude. I, I want to make money. This is not money. I'm gonna go to the vault and get the actual money. You know where the big cash is. Oh, oh, hot feet, hot feet, hot feet. Oh, God, God, get him! <laughs> Whoa, he came out of nowhere. Jeez, I'm glad I got him, guys. All right, let's open the door. Whoa, that's huge! Whoa, that's eight stickies stuck into one. Oh my days. Okay, I'm gonna get into cover. Well, there it is. There it is, guys. Exploded. <laughs> yeah. Go, go, go. Oh, my days. Cash, cash, and so much cash. Done. Delete the camera footage. Good idea, actually. I wouldn't want anyone knowing that it was me. All right, bear with me. Bear with me. I'm here. Where's the camera? Delete the footage. All right, Franklin, press the green button, and uh, footage deleted. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Franklin, we shouldn't have even done that. We would have made more from just robbing an ATM, my friend. Anyway, I'm going back to Los Santos because I want to see how my Fly US shares are finally doing, guys. They have been growing throughout the day. And with all their competitors gone, I have a feeling it's going to be good news. It's got to be. Oh, my days. I've done it, guys. Zero dollars to a trillionaire. We've actually done it. <laughs> Look at that. Return percentage. That is wild. Profits. More than a trillion dollars. Just looking at a trillion, that's so much money. All right, sell it all. Sell it all, Franklin. <laughs> so now I'm a trillionaire in GTA 5. We can actually uh, buy some things. Well, we could have done that before, but I was waiting to become a trillionaire. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Franklin's trillion dollar Hollywood Hills mansion. <laughs> this is 2000 Vinewood Hills. In my garage, I've got a pretty nice car collection. Ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the Neros. <laughs> I have so many of these cars, all of them worth millions of dollars each. Open plan area, there's my kitchen over there. And moving along outside, this is my garden. It might look basic. I know, it's just a swimming pool, but I ain't got the deck chairs out yet. Or Chops Kennel. Well, Franklin, we've done pretty well for ourselves. I've got supercars, my mega mansion, and more than a trillion dollars in GTA 5. Considering we started with no money on the verge of starving to death, we've done pretty well. Anything I touch in GTA 5 will automatically upgrade. You see this amazing car behind me? You know, Franklin's car. It's a nice one, isn't it? It's a standard buffalo, but if I just... Whoop! <laughs> Oh my days. It's a monster truck buffalo. Dude, I had no idea this could even happen. <laughs> this is insane. Limousine windows. Yo, Franklin, this is actually insane, dude. Wait, what happens if I touch my motorbike? What is that gonna upgrade into? Dude, that's pure gold. And it's even got like saddlebags on the side. Dude, this is amazing. <laughs> Look at that exhaust pipe. Yo, Franklin, this is gonna be such an amazing day. Literally anything I touch will automatically upgrade. I've never upgraded a tank before. I mean, we turn them gold, diamond, and into piles of money, but I've never upgraded one. Dude, this is good. Whoa! <laughs> this is a nice car, dude. Hey, I'm gonna have so much fun. I'm gonna, like, upgrade tanks. I'm gonna get out of this car first. This thing is a death trap. Hey, guys, I'm gonna ask you one question. If you could touch anything and upgrade it automatically, what would you touch? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> I can do wheelies in this thing. Afternoon, guys. Hey, don't worry. You don't need to be angry with me. Oh, my days. He's walking over to me. Hey, do you mind? Can you just give me a hand? <laughs> he wants to fight me. Are you kidding me? I'm in trouble. I've literally flipped my car. Just give me one second. I got a one to level as well. Franklin, cruel out. <laughs> I'm gonna try and make it up to this guy. No, seriously. Don't touch me. I don't know what happens if I touch somebody. Can I really upgrade them? <laughs> I dare you. Come on, buddy. Come on. Touch me. Touch me. Are you kidding me? He just turned into a gold bar. Oh my days. Hey, Franklin, we better be careful. The police are chasing us. Hey, what are you gonna do, huh? You gonna shoot me? You gonna- Wait, hold up. I've got a really good idea. What happens if I touch a police car? Guys, I gotta give it a go. But first, I'm just leaving the police officers for a second. Stop chasing me. <laughs> Seriously. Oh my days, they're shooting me now. Fine, you guys have asked for this. Okay, well, now they're down. I'm gonna go and touch one of these police cars. How about this one? Are you kidding me? Are you... <laughs> Guys, I just upgraded the police car into a Lamborghini. Dude, this is still from Los Santos. Oh my days. This is the best video ever. This is literally the best video ever, dude. <laughs> we gotta touch more things. I mean, if we turn a police car into a Lamborghini and Franklin's car into a monster truck, what else can we possibly do today? Now, I kind of want to have some fun with this and just upgrade every single car on the road. So everyone, stop. This is the police. Yeah, ignore the siren. It's a bit broken. <laughs> stop right there, ma'am. I'm turning your car into an upgrade. 
upgraded machine. Hey, guys, you can thank me later, huh? <laughs> you can thank me later. These cars are nice. Hey, look at this guy. He's even got an engine just sticking out the front. Hey, come on. Don't destroy it. Oh, my days, dude. It's a buffalo. Yes, you're gonna love this. When I upgrade this car, you're never gonna want to get another one again. <laughs> yeah. Bam! Well, hey, at least you got a golden car. I tried my best, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Go, scram, get out of here. Thank you. <laughs> anyway, I've had enough fun upgrading random people's cars. I don't think they deserve an upgraded car, to be honest. The way they're treating Franklin. No, 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 no. I want to upgrade some fun vehicles, like a tank. I've never upgraded a tank before. And what happens if we do? So, Franklin, you know the job. We'll go into the military base. Luckily for me, because I'm in a police car, we can drive right in. Oh, no. No, I was wrong. Oh, boy. Okay, my cover's been blown. There's a tank. There's a tank. Whoa. <laughs> All right, Franklin. We gotta grab this tank before it kills us. Ow. Seriously. Oh, my day. Stop it. You just literally set your tank on fire. Stupid. Stupid. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> All of these tanks keep exploding themselves by the time we even get a chance to get inside. Now, the interesting thing is I can't upgrade the tank by simply touching the outside. I think I gotta get inside the tank in order to upgrade it, which I didn't realize we had to do. All right, there's another one over here, and I will upgrade this tank. Come here. Come here. Come here. Let me inside. Ow. <laughs> Seriously? Stop it. Seriously. I gotta get inside this thing. Yes. I'm on and I'm getting in. Whether you like it or not, buddy, get out of the tank. This thing is mine. Oh my days. Dude, I have upgraded a rhino tank into literally a camouflage tank. What? Boom. You guys are going down. Boom. <laughs> I love this, dude. This is the best power ever. Screw gold. Screw diamond. I just want to upgrade things. Hey, buddy. Check it out. My tank's better than yours. <laughs> <laughs> Way better than yours, dude. Your one can be destroyed. My one is camouflaged. I've got an idea. I've made it to the docks, and I want to upgrade one of these boats. All right, ditch the tank, Franklin. It's been a fun ride. <laughs> and let's upgrade this boat. Dude, I literally have no idea what is going to happen to this thing. I mean, surely something's going to happen. It's a boat. Three, two, one, and touch. Dude, I have literally turned this into an actual luxury yacht. <laughs> Yo, this thing has, like, an interior. This is way better than just my normal yacht. <laughs> this is so nice. I wonder how fast it goes. Oh, pretty fast. Acceleration is actually pretty good. <laughs> hey, who wants a boat upgrading? Da -da -da -da, da -da 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 I can upgrade anything I want to. Wait, I've got an even crazier idea. You know that luxury super yacht which we can all buy in GTA 5? What happens if I upgrade that? I mean, surely it will upgrade. Anything I touch will upgrade. Let's find out. <laughs> Come on, Franklin. Take me over to the yacht. Three, two, one, and jump. Come on. Okay. I mean, it looks quite cool. We got like a staircase. I'm very skeptical. Is this thing even like worth it? Have I just ditched a load of money? Like, what have I done? Okay. I'm gonna take a look around this thing. Um, not gonna lie. This thing is really kitted out, guys. <laughs> we got a bedroom and there's even a balcony. Oh my days. Yo, this is nice. This is so nice, dude. I got a balcony looking over the sea. Around this way, next to the big window, is a gym. Is this seriously what I think it is? There's literally nothing stopping me from jumping off the boat. Literally nothing. <laughs> what? Oh, my days. All right, Franklin, let's take another look around this place. There's another balcony. There's some beanbags down here. A nice, like, bookshelf area thingy. Is this thing bigger or smaller than my previous one? I mean, I really don't know. <laughs> was this worth it? I have no idea. But hey, I'm just gonna say it was because the game clearly knew that this was an upgrade. <laughs> anyway, what else do we want to upgrade, Franklin? There's still so many amazing vehicles out there which we haven't even touched yet. So let's go back to Los Santos and check out what else we can do. Hmm. A limousine. What happens if we touch this vehicle? I mean, surely this will upgrade into something. Maybe a golden one. Who knows? <laughs> Alright, Franklin, let's find out. Hey, it's gold. Nice. Whoa. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? Dude, this thing is huge. How many windows has it got? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16 windows on one side. Dude, this thing is 30 two windows. I literally gotta get inside. Hey, who wants to be picked up in my limousine? Yo, this is a limousine. This is so cool. I actually want to pick somebody up. Ma'am, do you want to get in? Hey, how you doing back there, ma'am? You comfortable? You cozy? I think there's some champagne in the back. Just feel free to reach over. I gotta shout down this thing, guys. It's it's literally impossible to talk. How do I even drive this out of here, dude? What? Imagine if this was in GTA Online. I would love to see this happen. <laughs> it's like a super long limousine. Hey, can I drive this into the Los Santos car? Customs. I mean, I'm not sure why I would want to do that since it's already been upgraded, but I just want to see if we can. Hey, excuse me, buddy. Can you let me in? <laughs> 
Oh, no, he won't let me in. Uh, uh, that's a big surprise. We wouldn't even fit if we got inside. Oh, boy. I've already scratched, like, the whole side of this thing, dude. Imagine the repair costs. How is this running with, like, two tires at the front and two at the back? I seriously do not understand how this vehicle is even working right now. Hey, guys, just going on my normal commute, you know? Hey, watch where you're going. <laughs> big limousine here. Dude, this is such a cool car. I got Franklin's ability as well. You guys are underestimating my driving capabilities. With Franklin's ability, I can literally do anything I want to, including skirt. <laughs> A nice little cheeky drift around the corner. How's she doing back there? Is she okay? Oh, she's fine. She's jamming to some music. Look, she's bobbing her head, enjoying life. Whoa! <laughs> no, don't bail! Why are we bailing? Hey, this is the police station. Oh, yes. He's leaving his parking spot. Fantastic. It means I have somewhere to park. Hold up. I'm in the double white lines. All right, nice. There we go. Perfect parking. Uh, if you ask me, I think that's fantastic. There's nothing wrong with that. Ooh, guys, a riot van has just spawned in. Okay. What happens if we upgrade the riot van? Let's find out. Franklin? Just, uh, da, 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 anyone about? Anybody? There's, oh, she's here. Hello. <laughs> How was your ride in the limousine? Watch this. Hey, whoop. Bam. <laughs> this is even better. I made it even more reinforced, and it's even got a water cannon. Okay, okay, right. They're definitely not having this. Hey, come in. I upgraded your riot van. It's mine now. It's even got sirens, dude. This thing was literally the riot van before, and now it's it's like a riot truck. Dude, I don't think anyone's gonna stop this barging through. Look at this car. I got a plow. Bam. <laughs> I can even plow trucks, dude. Look at this traffic jam. Yeah, not a problem for me. Move it, guys. Move it or lose it. I got a water cannon. <laughs> if I was a random person, I'd be very annoyed at me right now. I could literally upgrade any one of their cars. I could turn this taxi into a golden taxi. But guess what? I don't want to do that, guys, because I'm mean. <laughs> I don't want to upgrade your stinking car. I only want to upgrade mine. I wonder if there's any nice cars in this car park. All right, I think I'll leave this thing over here. I've had enough fun with the riot van. What is inside this car park? Let's see. I want to get the best vehicle there is. Cool. There's an adder in here. All right. Don't mind if I do. I think I'll just... Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba 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 yes, we turn it into a monster truck. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's getting in. Nice one. Like a boss. Dude, this is an adder, and I've just monster trucked it. This is a monster truck supercar. It's even got a monster truck horn. How cool is that? I wonder if I can drive over cars. I mean, surely the small ones I can, right? I'm going to drive over this one. <laughs> I can. Yo, this is awesome, dude. I can drive over for any car I want to. Oh, what's going on? What's ha Whoa, okay. This is weird. Dude, did you see that? The screen just glitched. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore that thing. It happened before and it turned my powers weird, but maybe this time it won't. Let's upgrade this person's car. Wait, nothing happened. What about this person's car? Come on, come on. Really? Seriously? No, no, no. You can't have gotten rid of my power already. I was having so much fun. Oh my days. No, no. Guys, this power was only temporary. I can't do it anymore. Oh no, 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 guys. The power's gone. <laughs> oh, come on. I was having so much fun. There were so many more things I could have upgraded. You know the name of the game. Don't get caught. Is it there? Is it there? Is it? Oh, yes, it's there, guys. This is gonna be insane. <laughs> guys, I got my disguise on. Franklin's got his helmet on. It's gonna be a good day. Afternoon, ma'am. You enjoy your dog walk. What do you think, guys? Do you reckon we're looking suspicious? Nobody can know about this. There it is. The Los Santos Police Department. Right, park this up. There's a lot of police cars out here, guys. A lot of police cars. Franklin, just act casually. Everything's gonna be fine. Keep the disguise on. Yeah, act like you own the place. This could go so terribly wrong, dude. Three, two, one. There's no going back. <laughs> there's no going back, guys. Another one, another one, another one. Anybody else? Oh, my days. Guys, the alarms are going off. They know there's an intruder. Quick, Franklin. Quick, 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 quick. There isn't much time. There it is. <laughs> it's still there. Quick, 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 Franklin. Quickly, get it, get it, get it. Yes, we collected them. Bring them to the drop-off location. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. We got three stars and that lady's calling the police. We got police outside. Quick, Franklin. Don't let them get you. Okay, run, run. Get in the car. Get in the car. <laughs> Guys, don't worry. We can shake off the police. Now we got the rap car. <laughs> right, drop off the item. Take them back to the ammunition and lose the wanted level. Out the way, Laurie. It was difficult, but we lost the wanted level. You got my money for me? There we go. There's it. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much. That's a lot of money, Franklin. That's, that's, that's. <laughs> How much money is that? <laughs> that's a lot of money. I don't know what we got, guys, but it's worth a lot of money. I'm kind of nervous now, but eh, I've done my job. Let's go back home. I want to play some video games. Ugh, we're good. We lost them, and I'm gonna watch some good old videos. This is a good one. This is a good... <laughs> uh, this is the... Is someone at my door? Who's at my door? We better go check that out, dude. What if it's... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. We definitely lost them, Franklin. Come on. Guys, they're not leaving me alone. They're adamant. I have a really bad feeling they might be outside. They might be trying to find Franklin. Franklin, what are you doing? <laughs> 
quit crouching around the house, dude. They keep ringing the doorbell. Stop. There's no one in. I gotta check out who this is. Have we been made? Careful now, Franklin. Careful. Careful, dude. Don't make a noise. Someone's car has pulled up. That looks like an undercover police car as well. Guys, we're done. We're, I, I may as well run. We're running. We're getting out of here. Wait. Simeon? Why is Simeon outside? <laughs> He's telling me to open up. I'm not gonna text you back. Wow. Guys, it's... Oh my days. It's Simeon. Just in case, I'm holding this up. Simeon, why? Today of all days. Did, I was meant to lie low today. Simeon! <laughs> If only he knew I was right behind him. If only he knew, guys. He just texted me. Simeon. <laughs> I'm behind you. I'm behind you, Simeon. Oh, no, and I was giving up. <laughs> Simeon. Oh, I think I scared him. Simeon, Simeon, Simeon. I'm here. I'll put it away if you want. <laughs> Fine, I'll put it down. I thought you were gonna run away from me for a second. Yeah, he thought so too. Oh, um, yeah, don't look behind you, Simeon. Oh my days, guys. <laughs> if he sees this, he's got leverage on me. Simeon, what would you like from me today? Okay, you want me to collect some boats? I can do that. Just come away from the garage quickly. Just, yeah, a little bit further away. There we go. There we go. Nice. You want me to collect some boats? It was only last month I was collecting boats for you, Simeon. Yeah, good point. They were billionaire boats. And you're telling me these ones are trillionaire boats? <laughs> I didn't realize that was possible. We literally collected super yachts in the last episode, Simeon. I'm in. Count me in, Simeon. How much am I gonna get paid for this, though? You gotta pay me. Ten million dollars, guys. Looks like we're collecting some trillionaire boats in GTA 5. Franklin, let's get ready for the day. And whatever you do, Simeon, I know what you're like. Don't use my DJ kit over there, okay? That's exclusively mine. I've got some pretty good records on there, and I know you're gonna mess everything up. You're gonna screw up the settings, so don't touch the DJ booth over there, okay, Simeon? It's the only thing I ask from you today. Deal. Thank you. <laughs> Send me on my way. I'll get the first boat. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. I, I, yeah, I slipped there, see me on. <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be so much fun. No way. No, this is too much. This is... <laughs> Guys, Simeon wants me to collect this. It's a cargo boat. Inside each container is gonna be like supercars. It's gonna be iPhones. Day-to-day -day objects, which you've just ordered overseas. This boat itself is gonna be worth a lot of money, but the cargo on board... <sighs> Oh, yo, this is made at trillions of dollars. Okay, give me one second. I'll just be boarding on top of this. How on earth am I supposed to drive this thing? Maybe up those stairs? Get one there. Yeah, up the stairs. Guys, I think I found where the captain... Yep, this is where... <gasps> oh, my days. And there's no one even in here, dude. Simeon, this is fantastic. So this is where we captain the boat. Guys, come on. Come on. This is insane. <laughs> What's the horn like, do you think? That's deep. That's deep. I'm imagining seagulls flying around just vibrating in the air like... <laughs> oh, Simeon! Guess who's got the boat? <laughs> I have no idea where he is, but I can't go too close to land. We're gonna ground this thing, and then we really are screwed. Simeon, I'm putting the anchor down. Send me to the next boat. <sighs> I tell you something, swimming back to shore was quite a challenge, guys. <laughs> That's at least a mile, Franklin. Hey, Simeon, what's this boat for? What's the next one? Simeon, no, 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 no. Simeon, I'm not doing that. I'm not taking the aircraft carrier. That's literally Fort San Kutos. Wow, he's not gonna pay me unless I do. Fine. You know what, guys? Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds crazy enough for a video. We're taking the aircraft carrier. Are you kidding me? Are you... Simeon, Simeon, this isn't fair. This is... Look, I know this is a trillionaire boat, but this is the aircraft carrier, Simeon. I didn't sign up for this. Jeez, come on. We're taking the aircraft carrier. Fantastic. I didn't even realize this moves. I thought it's just stationary. Right, how do we drive in? They've got jets and everything. Oh, my days. Right, that's where we go inside. Shh. Afternoon, officer. I totally meant to be here. This is totally my carrier. Afternoon, officer. Just act casual, Franklin. Act very casual. <laughs> There's so many people on board. Simeon, this is such a bad idea. Hang on a minute. Is this guy? He's by himself. He's by himself, dude. Okay, three, two, one. Night, night. I'll be taking that outfit. Thank you very much. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Afternoon, Sergeant. <laughs> Afternoons, good sir. I'm just saying afternoon to everybody. It, it, wait, what? This needs an image. Hey, it needs an image, buddy. <laughs> I've got three stars. Guys, I've got three stars. I've got three stars. No one has found me. Nobody knows that I've got three stars, but I, it's flashing. It's in the corner. <laughs> Quickly get into the aircraft carrier. Drive this away. Da, 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 da. You guys are all doing such a great job. I'm proud of all of you. Every single one of you. Oh my days, they got snipers. They've actually got snipers. 
Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Everyone, chill out. It's fine. Don't worry. No one is that. Uh, oh, jeez. <laughs> Nice! Pleasure in business with all of you guys. Now, I'll be taking this away and bringing it back to Simeon. Okay, guys. We got quite a few tanks pointing at me. <laughs> I have a feeling everybody knows. Yeah, we'll just shake off those planes. Get them off. Get them off. <laughs> Get them all off. Get them off. We don't need those planes anymore. I've just kicked off all of the planes. There's one left. This is different. We're driving the aircraft carrier, guys. Never thought I'd be doing this in GTA 5. Not gonna lie. Simeon, what are we doing today? I still made some enemies of those tanks. So, by the time we arrive over at Simeon. I have a feeling they're still gonna be there. I gotta shake him off or else this is not gonna go to plan, guys. Let's see. What if we break? Yeah, break backwards. Oh, yes. That's the spirit. Get the planes off the front. <laughs> Almost, almost. Oh, yay, we got them off, guys. Simeon, please don't be angry with me. I shook off all the vehicles. There's no planes, there's no tanks, there's no APCs, there's no nothing. Hey, Simeon, this is quite a collection we got. Check it out, dude. We got the aircraft carrier, we got a cargo boat over there. Are you sure no one's gonna, like, you know, notice and, you know, get a bit suspicious? Nah, he seems pretty cool with that, guys. He's got Lester on his side, of course. Good old Lester. <laughs> Send me on the next one, see me on. Well, isn't that magnificent? An entire cruise boat, guys. This is a cruise liner going to Los Santos. That's good news. That's actually really good news. It's probably like either full of people or maybe it's about to pick people up. I really hope it's the second one. Come on, Franklin, go get it. <laughs> We're getting a cruise liner. Guys, what do you think it's called? Like, which cruise liner do you think this is? Look at the amount of rooms on this, guys. Every single one of those yellow lights is an individual room. That's got to be two, three hundred rooms on this side. On the other side, double that, guys. In the middle, triple that. It's the Queen Mary 2. Can you guys see that? The Queen Mary 2. And we've got to find a way to get on this thing. Suddenly, I feel very scared. We're swimming right next to a cruise liner. <laughs> Come on, come on, Franklin. Don't get crushed, please. Oh my goodness, what are we doing? What? See me on the stuff we do. Oh, it's. it's <laughs> the currents are too strong. See me on, this is too much. It's, Franklin, control yourself. You got this. Finally, we're on the Queen Mary suit. Now we've got to find a way to control this thing. Look at all the balconies and everything, dude. I can't believe this. We're actually on a cruise liner. We're on a cruise liner, guys. <laughs> hey, you, stop driving the boat. Stop. <laughs> This thing shakes too much. Off the boat. This is mine. This is my boat, dude. It's got swimming pools and everything. This is magnificent. Simeon, you are gonna love this one. We've got a cruise liner. The Queen Mary 2. Oh, no, he's okay. He's okay. Don't worry, guys. He'll be fine. One second. <laughs> Yeah, you don't need to see this. All right, I'm gonna leave this right next to the... Oh, jeez. I think we're hitting some rock or something. <laughs> I'll leave this one right over here, guys. All right, put the anchor down. Anchor down! Non-existent team. Captain, if you can hear me, put the anchor down, please. <laughs> And we're good. There we go. Hey, what's going on over here, guys? This looks pretty serious. Do not cross. Whoa, guys, a plane's crashed in the water. Hey, can someone please tell me what's going on? There's, <laughs> There's so much happening here. Simeon, I'm not taking the plane. Where's the boat? Why have I been sent over here? Excuse me, sir. What's happened over here? Everyone's okay, but they sent a boat out to collect them. Where's the... Where's... Oh, my days. Wait, where's the boat? Where's the boat, guys? Where's the boat? Thank you. Thank you, good sir. <laughs> Oh, guys, there's the boat. Is that the Titanic? That's the Titanic, guys. How is the Titanic over there? Oh, my days. Okay, you know what? Let's just get it. Let's get it, guys. <laughs> Simeon has sent me to get the Titanic. Now, this is definitely worth trillions of dollars. Yep, this is definitely the Titanic. <laughs> this is insane. Oh, my days. Right, find a ladder, Franklin, and stay away from the boat. We don't want to get sucked under. There's the name, guys. Titanic. Is this where we go to drive and sail this thing? Oh, my days. It's gorgeous. It's so decorated. There's a piano over there. There's a massive glass ceiling over there, dude. And it's completely empty. Just think they're about to pick people up as well. Guys, this is the Titanic. You know, Simeon needs this. He needs this, guys. There's corridors down there. You can even go further down. There's artwork inside. I wonder how much that is, guys. It's got to be worth a lot of money. No way. We're on B deck now. Yo, there's... Okay, you can go down that corridor. You can go down even further. And there's rooms on both sides. Look at that, guys. One corridor down there. <laughs> Wait, what's down here? What's down here? What's down here? Another corridor? Another corridor. Hey, guys, how crazy is this? <laughs> Simeon has taken the aircraft carrier, a cargo boat, and a cruise liner, and the Titanic. Uh, uh, never in a million years would I have thought we'd be doing this for Simeon. But Simeon, here's your boats. Enjoy them. I know I definitely would. Hang on a minute. What's that noise coming from my house? Oh, no. Simeon, you better not have done this. Oh, my days. I'm so angry at him. I know exactly what he's doing. Simeon, stop that now. You're messing with all my settings. Simeon, stop. No. 
get off, get off, because it's mine. Get off. That's what we're talking about. See me on. I told you one thing, not to DJ. Don't go telling me that you just wanted to have a little go. Don't go telling me that you thought you were allowed to and you didn't hear me. See me on. I told you one thing. Don't use my DJ kit. <laughs> Come on. Oh, my days. He just, he can't listen to anyone, guys. See me on. Pay me the money. Thank you very much. $10 million. I'll be taking that. Now we can finally relax, Franklin. <laughs> You know what? We've done enough for today. I think it's about time we sit back down on our sofa, put on the TV, and watch some more videos, guys. Anything I draw comes to life in GTA 5. Currently, I got nothing on me. And there's not a car. There's not anything around. I got to literally draw it for it to exist. I got this little paint document here. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this, dude. And it's connected to my GTA 5. So anything I create here will uh, hopefully come to life in this game. Okay, we could do with a car first. So let's just... Oh, my days. What am I doing? Okay, I'm going to try and do a car. Let's get the back. Dude, I don't even know what a car looks like. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's just go forward. And okay. That's my kind of car. All right, let's just put a wheel on there. Oh, we got to get the windows as well. Okay, let's find find out if this... <laughs> What are we gonna get? It went bam! Oh, wow, it actually worked on my days. <laughs> I got my first car. Okay, you know what, guys? This is paying off. I got my first car, so whatever I draw will actually come to life in GTA 5. Dude, this is gonna be such a good video. I mean, I could draw anything. I could do with a better car, though. I mean, if we can draw anything, then surely we may as well draw, like, you know, a Lamborghini. One second, I'm gonna try something out. Let's see. What can we draw next, Franklin? Let's go for a really nice car this time. So we're gonna have it curve up, and then we're gonna get a Lovely windscreen. All right, nice. I'm gonna have to really work up on my drawings. <laughs> Seriously. Dude, what have I just drawn? Okay, I'm just gonna write Lamborghini on it and like maybe the game will understand. Lambo. This is a Lambo. <laughs> Please, give me a Lambo. Wait, hold on a second. It actually gave me a Lamborghini. <laughs> Are you kidding me, dude? That looks nothing like what I drew. Okay, you know what, guys? I am complaining. I got my Lamborghini. Let's go, Franklin. Check it out. I have literally just drawn myself in a Lamborghini. I gotta get a new respray on this thing, guys. Let's take it to the customs. I don't know, sir. <laughs> what do you think of my lovely Lamborghini? It doesn't even have a name. It just says supercar because this is a supercar. Let's just whack on all the upgrades. You know, everything you possibly need. Respray. Now we're talking. This is my kind of garage. All right, we could go for a full-on chrome. Now, that looks so sick. Sick. Or we could go for like solid gold. Yeah, solid gold. Come on. Come on, dude. <laughs> for 900 bucks, solid gold it is. Speaking of gold, we could become mega rich, Franklin. Why don't we just draw ourselves in money? One gold bar, two gold bars, three gold bars, and let's do four. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Mate, it worked. And I got a bit more gold than I drew out. <laughs> and check it out, dude. Four amazing stacks of gold. <laughs> All right, how are we going to get this back? I've got an idea. Home sweet home. Now, where do we put this gold? Hmm. I mean, I am pretty bored of this house. Do you reckon we can draw another one? Oh, hold on a second. My art skills aren't that good, Franklin. You sure you want to do this? <laughs> I'm going full on luxury with this. Don't care what you guys think. This is going to be the most amazing place you've ever seen. All right, full on luxury. Let's go. This is going to be a swimming pool. Oh, yeah. And then this is going to be like boarding area. Boarding, boarding over there. Pool. Okay, let's get some nice waves in so they know it's definitely water. Dude, I'm designing my own house. <laughs> I am so interested to see how this comes out, dude. Oh, boy. <laughs> Why am I in the sky? <laughs> oh, my days. There's my house. Hang on a second. This is... Is the tennis court. Dude, it just put me somewhere else. All right, so Franklin, I don't think we demolished your house, buddy. <laughs> I thought we were going to. What? Dude, the house is somewhere else. <gasps> and check it out, guys. This is the boarding area. We got some chairs. They even furnished the place. How considerate of them. I love this house already. Look at that, guys. Oh, my days. And the view. Look at that view. That is the craziest view ever. So check out the inside. I got this amazing yellow feature piece. I think it looks fantastic. The kitchen over here. This is my fireplace. Massive TV. Oh my days. This is so cool. Sliding doors. Dude, I didn't even design any of this. They just gave me this stuff. I love it. This is the driveway and they gave me my car. The golden Lamborghini. How nice of them. All right. I like this place a lot. I've got a golden supercar. I've got a mega mansion, my own tennis court, my own infinity pool, and a ton of gold. I don't even need any more money. We're sorted. So, Franklin, what do you want to do now? Hang on. I've got some fun ideas. Guys, I'm going to have some fun with this. Guys, I want you to guess what I'm drawing, okay? All right. There's one. 
There's number two. Okay. That's so not accurate. And then there's three. What am I drawing, guys? Make a guess now. All right. And just to show these things bend, let's have a little crease mark there. Let's just do a little height chart here so people know how big this is. I'm thinking like five meters. So let's do five M. Oh my days. It actually worked. <laughs> I drew myself my own robot. All right, Franklin, jump inside this beast. You shall not pass. <laughs> Dude, no one can stop me. Literally nobody. I gave him wings as well. You know, this robot can fly. It's not the best robot until you can actually fly. Check me out, guys. Look at me go. Oh, no, we're going down. Let's go back up. Let's go. This is the best thing I've drawn for sure. Better than gold, better than houses, better than supercars. Since we can draw anything, I want to go for like, let's do that. All right. Nice. Okay. Cool. And then, okay. 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 <laughs> That's actually a pretty good drawing. And then if we get some feathers in, nice. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> Quack. <laughs> I think that's pretty accurate. What's up with that guy? Yeah, beats me. I'm a duck. That's all I care about. I'm a giant duck, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, you know what else I need? I need giant duck friends. I'm lonely right now. I don't have anyone to hang with. Come on, let's get some more duck friends in. Congratulations, Mr. Ducky. You are now a superstar and very famous. Every single duck now is gonna be just like you. All right, there we go. Four different ducks. Save them. That is so cool. Come on, ducks. Let's go take over the world. <laughs> We're gonna do this by storm. All right, let's find some um, a fire truck. Fantastic. We could all fit in there, right? You just gotta repeat after me. Quack, 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 quack. Come on, let's get in the truck. Quackity, quack, quack, quack. Quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe this. I have just spawned in a bunch. I could do with one more duck, couldn't I? All right, bear with me. I'm getting one more duck. We need another one. Come on, friends. Welcome to the party. We're a squad on now. Everyone's here. Guys, this is the best squad in the universe. I got lights. This is the fire. Fire ducks. Fire ducks. <laughs> I'm a fire duck. Let's go. We arrived at the first spot. This is going to be your fight training. All right. I'm going to need everyone to listen carefully. Very carefully. We're a duck. We're at the bottom. Well, we're not at the bottom of the food chain, but we're pretty low down. We're lower than humans. So I think it's about time we show humans exactly who's boss. We're going to target this guy first. He might be a hiker, but you never know. Later on tonight, he might have duck prepared. I don't know. I don't care. But he ain't eating me or any of my brothers. We're attacking. <laughs> Come on, ducks attack! No, no, you meant it, guys. We're, we need to show them who's boss. What if I give them all like things, I, I, like uh? <laughs> What? You better help me. Hey, buddy. You're not supposed to be drinking on the streets. What do you think you're doing, huh? <laughs> what are you doing? Let's sort them out. <laughs> oh, my day's got a knife. He's stabbing me. Ducks, could do some help here. Could really do some help. Yes, sit on him. Yes. <laughs> That's what we're on about. Oh, my day's a dog. I don't like dogs. Uh, hey, hey, stop punching me. Okay, flick the dog with your flipper and let's keep whacking them with the beaks. With the beaks again. <laughs> No, not my friend. Dude, this beak is so uncontrollable. Okay, this dog now has like three giant ducks attacking him now. Oh, my days. <laughs> this is so messy. Charge, charge. Go get him. Go get him. He's got a gun. Oh, my days. This is actually mental, dude. <laughs> we are all just savages right now. All right, this guy's definitely going to kill one of us if we're not careful. Come on, attack. Charge, charge. Let's get him. Okay, let's have some like creative fun with this. So what if I design? That's the wrong one. What if I design like a giant hamburger? Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you like what I'm thinking already? I know I'm loving this too. I think that's pretty nice. Maybe get some seeds on top. All right. I'm not going to give too much context into this burger because I know everyone loves burgers. <laughs> so there we go. That's my burger. But this burger, it flies. All right. It's a bit special. Oh, yeah. Okay. Now you like what I'm saying? Now, now I'm sure you like what I'm saying. This thing flies. It's got a flamethrower underneath. That's my sesame seed bun. Save. And I bet you weren't expecting this. I definitely wasn't. This is actually a pretty good drawing. <laughs> Check it out, guys. Flying hamburger. Flamethrower underneath. I gotta set fire to some things. All right. Oh, my days. There's a lot of traffic down there. Wait, am I blowing things up? I'm actually blowing things up from up here. Dude, I'm not even close to the ground. This is so cool. Lower it down a bit more. All right. Bringing it down. Bringing it down. Everyone, come on. <laughs> come on. Let's share the love here. Who wants to be scorched next? <laughs> this is amazing, dude. I'm setting fire to everything. Okay, this is the coolest vehicle ever. Why don't you add this in, Rockstar Games? I mean, if I can draw it, you can definitely design it. Wow, this is so destructive. I could literally destroy people all day, dude. This is the best design ever. So I love gaming. What if I design myself a 
Okay, hear me out here. Hear me out. Okay, I'm designing myself a chair. Now, how do I do a chair? I'm gonna be like chilling in this chair. So that's my chair. I've got my PlayStation controller in one hand because I love playing PlayStation. And it moves. This chair actually moves. No way. I actually got it to move. And I'm on fire. I think that was to do with the hamburger thing. <laughs> Dude, I got it to work. And I'm Jimmy DeSanta. The game knows this is Jimmy's kind of vehicle. I can drive and game. Hey guys, one second. One second. Just get in final circle. Just get in final circle, all right? Let's look at first person. All right, this is first person perspective. Still gaming. Oh yeah, let's just weave through the traffic. Get in final circle here. Got to speak to my mates. Hey guys, I think we should push in. Let's circle hug and then push in. Just got to speak to my guys, you know? Making sure the tactic's down. I present to you the gaming sofa. Revolutionary stuff, this. Here we go. Let's put that shade in just so people know it's definitely a sofa. Here's me. I'm chilling. Enjoying life. All right. Lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. I like it. This is looking good. Hey, we're bam. Just when you thought it was over, it wasn't. I got my own sofa now. We can now chill out, lie down, and drive. Hey, coming through, coming through. We're bam. <laughs> Seriously, you survived? I want to run some people over, dude. I'm in a gaming sofa. I mean, how much damage could this really do? It's a gaming sofa, guys. Come on. Scoop. <laughs> whoopsie, whoopsie daisy. Oh no, this guy's running. Hey, come here, come here, come here. I'm trying to get final zone. Can you just get out of my way? All right, listen to me, Franklin. We're gonna turn this into the best man cave ever. What I'm thinking is we get one TV over there, put some artwork on that wall as well, the little white patch. Throw away the shelf unit. We're gonna keep that shelf unit, paint the walls blue. I'm gonna go inside, grab a chainsaw, some paintbrushes. Whoa, Trevor, what are you doing here? You never arrive at my house. Oh my days. Wait, say that again. Say that again. He's recovered a piece of paper, which Ron found this morning, which has the whole enchantment recipe. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay, Trevor, show me this piece of paper. Right, so you're telling me with an eye of an eagle, a uranium motor part, that sounds dangerous, a varium, extremely explosive and sensitive, a bar of gold, and a humpback whale fin? We need to get these items and we can enchant a car. Guys, if you're really lost, enchanting a car will literally make it do anything you can imagine. It goes so many different colors. It can fly if you wanted to. It can go invisible. It could shape shift into a bin. Wait, Trevor, I think I can help you with the first item, actually. I have a bar of gold in my house. Oh, yeah, it's still there. Okay, that's one thing off the list. We got the bar of gold. Hey, Trevor, I got the bar of gold. Now, why do I have to cut it in half? Because half's for you? Oh, oh come on. That's why we needed the gold. <laughs> The other half is needed in the recipe. Okay, fair enough. I think he added that in just to mess around with us. Okay, so we need half a bar of gold to enchant. What's the easiest thing? He sent me the locations. I'm gonna get the eye of the eagle first. Let's go and get that. We gotta go to the swamp. I have recently enabled a brand new feature on the videos. You can press thanks below this episode and donate whatever you want to, and it highlights your comments so I can see exactly what you're saying. So if you wanna be seen, then get thanking now, guys. <laughs> All right, let's go. Da -da 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 the swamp is just around the corner. <gasps> Oh, that was close. Let's not die on the way, Franklin. We do want to enchant this thingy. All right, here we go. The swamp. So we're looking for an eagle. And then I take it we just got to shoot it and get the eye. So I got to wait for one of them to fly directly above me. And then it falls next to me. I'm going to go with that. Got it. Let's go, guys. We got the eagle's eye. Okay, that's two items. I'm going to go to uh, Amiga and get the uh, get the uranium motor part. Not looking forward to carrying that around, to be honest. <laughs> But hey, we gotta do it to enchant Franklin's car. I think this is where Amiga lives. I'm really not sure, to be honest. I don't often go near his house, but I think it's in the trailer park. Is this the right place? Uh, let me double check. It's meant to be through there, actually. It doesn't look like we can go inside. I'm gonna give it a go anyway. Amiga, are you in? <gasps> Oh, yes, we're in the right place. <laughs> All right, uranium motor parts. We're surrounded by them. Dude, we could enchant so many cars with these. Okay, let's just grab uh, this one. We need the humpback whale fin and the bavarium, which is extremely flammable and explosive and sensitive, etc., etc. I might go for the humpback whale fin first. There is one of them, and it swims somewhere around there. I rarely see it, but there is one humpback whale, guys. Have you seen it before? It's a little easter egg. I wonder how big the fin is. I mean, it's a humpback whale. They're like the biggest sea creatures around. So we're looking for a humpback whale. I know it exists and it's meant to be around here. Let me take a look at where we are. If we drive out there, we'll have a good chance at seeing one. Now it's got to be deep in the ocean, so let's not go too close to shore. It is a big animal and I think we can hear it when we get close. <gasps> There it is. There it is. There it is, guys. I got it. I got it. I got Oh, no. I'm going to feel so bad. I got to get the fin. I got to get the fin of this thing in order to enchant a... Oh, come on. <laughs> I didn't think this through. I didn't think this through at all. Oh, no. No. There's a little fin at the top. Maybe we could 
take that. Do you reckon that? No, I don't want to risk it. I don't want to come back, guys. Oh, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. We need to get the fin. <laughs> Oh, no. No, 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 no. All right, Franklin, let's get it. You'll be pleased to know that I've... I've got the fin. I've got the fin, guys. I did not like that job. Let's not enchant any more cars, shall we, Franklin? We'll just stick with the one, yeah? That was awful. <laughs> do not want to do that again. All right, let's get out of here, guys. There is only one thing left to find, and that's the Bavari Bavarium thingy, my Bobby. I don't even know how it's pronounced. How do you say it? Bavarium. Bav we got to get the Bavarium, guys. It's at the Humane Lab, so we're breaking in, and we're finding a very, very classified tube of something, and we can't afford to knock the tube. We we can't afford to make contact with it. We can't afford to do anything. So basically, we're going to be tiptoeing home once we have this in our bag because it can cause like nuclear explosions if handled badly. Those just sound very good. Franklin, you look professional. No one's going to question your entry to the humane labs. We got a bag. We got a hard hat. We got a suit on. We got work pants as well. Like we're prepared to go in the humane labs. It is a government facility after all, and they're not going to let anyone in unless you have like a reasonable excuse. So uh, we'll just give it a second. Hey, we're in. Fantastic. All right, let's go. So the entrance, I think it's around there. That's where the blueprints are telling me to go to. Laboratory one, decontamination, cold room. The cold room, that's where we want to go to. Let's see, cold room, cold room. We're following the signs to the cold room. That's analysis. Oh yeah, here we go. Cold room this way. Oh, here we go. I think I found it, guys. Decontamination two. There's some stairs, sample story. No, this is all cold room. That's decontamination. This is the cold room. Yes, we got it. All right, let's look for this vial. I reckon whatever it is, it's got to be in, I think it's in there. I think is in this lab. Let's take a look. Can we see Bavarium, B -b -b Bavarium, whatever it's called. I should not be the person for this job. Bavarium, Bavarium, any of these bottles? I got it, guys. I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> we got a bottle. I was expecting to find a vial. I got a bottle of Bavarium. That is more than I anticipated. I don't think we need to use all of that, to be honest. Maybe Trevor can figure something else out with the rest. <laughs> all right, let's go. Go, 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 go. There's literally no one in. I don't understand where everyone's gone. This was the easiest take ever. No one saw me do that. Trevor, 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 I've got the materials. <laughs> oh, he's ready, guys. Look at that. Oh, my days. He's got the cauldron ready. Okay, let me just park the bike out here. How do we do this then, Trevor? I've got all the materials. I spent all day doing this. All right, let's give him the materials, Franklin. He's put the materials in. I got a minute to drive the car I want to enchant in. And then all of us need to clear the room because it's going to enchant, like, you know, anything in that room as well. And I don't think Franklin wants to be enchanted. This is so weird. Oh, my day. Hey, Trevor, can you move, please? Can you just move? Okay, nice. Nice. All right, everything's in. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna just hide. No, we'll just stand here. That door will withstand it. Dun, dun, dun. So, how long's left on the clock? 15 seconds. Okay, this is so weird. Guys, <laughs> we're enchanting Franklin. Did you hear that? Is my car still okay? <laughs> Is it safe to go in? Whoa! My entire garage is on fire! Trevor, this was stupid! All this did was create an explosion! My car's okay, and it says Enchant 2. This is the second car ever enchanted! We did it! We did it, guys! We're okay, I gotta put out this fire. Fire extinguisher, let's go! Oh, fantastic. All right, nice. Well, that was interesting. Let's go and get in my car. <laughs> Enchant 2. So how is this... Oh my days. It's doing the exact same thing it did in the supercar. Guys, <laughs> we've enchanted Franklin's car. Red, and then it goes to orange, and then it goes to yellow, and then it goes to green. What's going to come next? I'm going to say blue. Is it going to be blue? It's blue. Get in. Purple, of course. Yellow next. No, we go back to pink. Red. Oh my days, dude. This is awesome. <laughs> Yo! Okay, guys, I gotta test out what else we can do with this. It's an enchanted car, so literally whatever you can say, whatever you can think of, it can do! Are you impressed? He's impressed. That his impressed face doesn't look good. <laughs> But it's still impressed. Okay, Trevor, where do you want to go to first? We can teleport wherever we want to. Just be careful of what you say. You know, if you say Trevor's house, for example, I don't want to go there because your house is uh, not nice. <laughs> I want to go somewhere nice. Wait, no, no, don't say that. Don't. Oh, my days. No. Oh, come on, Trevor. You had to go and do this. We're in the bank vault now. Oh, my days. Dude, there's gold. Okay, Trevor, you know what? Let's just grab the gold. Okay, we're grabbing the gold and we'll go. <laughs> no one's going to know. There's no cameras. No alarms. Fantastic. All right, I'm getting all the gold. This is like billions of dollars here. All right, Trevor, let's get back in. Let's put some music on, shall we? Oh, my favorite tunes. All right, where do you want to go to now, Trevor? Now we're billionaires. Where do you want to go to now? <laughs> Actually, before you say, I'm gonna pick the next location. Hey, we made it. We're, oh, we're upside down, though. We are upside down. <laughs> but we're here. And we got a car full of gold in Michael's driveway, and it's an enchanted car. How have we done this? You know, come on. I know you're enchanted, but you could have done better. Okay, I want to really, really confuse Michael. Uh, 
Man, his garage door doesn't open for us. That's okay. I've got a better idea. We can just drive straight through because we're an enchanted car. <laughs> we can drive through. <laughs> hey, Michael, checkmate, buddy. Can't block us out forever, dude. Okay, I'm staying here and we're gonna go invisible. Oh, beautiful. Wait, Trevor? Trevor, where have you gone? <laughs> Trevor? <laughs> He's still there. It's made him invisible too. Is he not telling me something? Oh my days. Trevor's a ghost now. Okay, okay. I'm a bit nervous now. Trevor is here. But he's invisible next to me. Okay, now I want Michael to arrive. Hey, Michael! Excuse me, I'm here. <laughs> Michael! Oh, there he is! <laughs> Screw you, Michael! <laughs> he's terrified. He's like, what am I doing? This is great! <laughs> <laughs> Michael, listen, I would tell you how I'm doing this, but I... <laughs> we're jamming. <laughs> I would tell you how we're doing this, Michael, but I can't. You know, it's, it's my secret. Let's just say it took a little bit of effort. All right, see you, Michael. Time to go. <laughs> Now, is Trevor next to me? Is that like... Oh, he, yeah, he was there the entire time. That is confusing. <laughs> I don't know how he did that, but hey, it is what it is. Let's carry on moving. I want the car to fly now. Let's fly. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. Now we're talking, guys. Let's do some roly polies. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Dude, no one is reacting. Is anyone even looking at this? Man, these days, they probably think it's, it's some sort of magic trick. Well, technically, it is. You know, it's all magic. It's all magic. <laughs> There's no strings, no ropes. We're literally floating in the sky. Now, if I want to propel forwards, we can do that as well. Just give me a second. It's a lineup. I don't want to go into a tree. You know, this is an enchanted car, but after all, we can still go into trees. Whoa. This is... Oh. <laughs> Not nice to look at. Trevor, how are you doing? One more, one more round and he's going to have to get out. <laughs> Would not recommend that, Trevor. <laughs> all right, let's get ready. Go! <laughs> oh! oh, that was so close. That was so close. Oh, my days. <laughs> Trevor must be terrified. <gasps> oh, that was amazing. I actually can't believe we didn't crash there. I can't believe that. Hey, we're higher than the planes now. But let's go down to that plane. I want to go and say hello. This is going to be close, you know. No, 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 no. We're just going to dodge. We're just going to dodge the plane. Okay, I don't really want to go in the water. So let's try and turn this back around, shall we? Yeah. Spin around and let's go to the airport. I want to go to the airport. Let's go! <laughs> this is amazing! Now, there is one more thing I would like to do. I would like to shape shift this car. I've never done it before. We didn't do it with the other supercar. So let's see if we can shape shift this into. Let's do something small at first. A bin bag! Oh my days. Oh my days. Dude, we're a bin bag! <laughs> Franklin, we're in a bin bag. Yo, no way, no way, no way, no way. I actually don't believe this. We are a driving bin bag now. Hey guys, out the way, bin bag coming through. <laughs> no, I want to shape shift into something else now. What are we thinking? What are we thinking, Franklin? Uh, let's do something funny. Hey guys, check out my brand new whip. Yeah, I know, came straight from the 1800s. <laughs> This thing has no tires, no engine, no motor, no nothing. And it still drives pretty fast. Hey, guys, coming through. Straight past all of your beauties. And I still got Franklin's ability. Man, this is awesome. This is the life. Oh, my days. Okay, you know what? I'm going back to Franklin's house. I'm putting an end to this. And we're going to end the episode. Well, you know what, Trevor? That was a really fun day. I can't believe we managed to enchant Franklin's car in GTA 5. Today in GTA 5, we are about to steal every single land. Lamborghini from Mosley's dealership. Why are we doing this? Well, a few days ago, Franklin opened his own car store. It went off with a bang. We sold so many supercars apart from one, a Lamborghini. Why didn't we sell that? Well, looks like Mosley is the Lamborghini guy. He's the person who sells every single Lamborghini there is under the sun. So, Mosley, I'm paying you a visit today and we are stealing every single one of his Lamborghinis. If you want to help us out, smash like and remember to subscribe. It's free, and you're missing out on videos like this every single day. All right, Mosley, let's see what this store's all about. Look at all of the Lamborghinis, dude. Afternoon, sir. What can I help you with today? Are you after a Lamborghini? Why, yes, I am, actually. Guys, I'm going to go along with it. I think he's going to show me his cars, and then I need to find a way to steal them. So, which Lamborghini are you after? Aventador? Hurricane? Galado? Let's just take a look, guys. So, we got... I don't even know what that one is, dude. They're all Lamborghinis. This is crazy. There's so... 
so many different versions of them, dude. And a golden Lamborghini. What is this? I've never seen this one. Oh my days. Look at the paint job on that. Hey, Franklin, we need to choose one of these. After all, I'm pretty sure a test drive is allowed. <laughs> right, which one? Oh my goodness. Look at this Lamborghini, guys. No way, Mosley. You sell police Lamborghinis as well? The police Lamborghinis aren't for sale. Only registered police officers can purchase them. Well, well, well. Looks like Mosley's doing deals with the public and the police. Hmm, Mosley seems like a guy who would be protected. Oh, this looks good. Hey, Mosley, you know what, buddy? I think I might get this. But first, I want to take it for a test drive. You know, got to make sure that's all sorted. So Mosley thinks we're taking this for a test drive. Little does he know we're actually stealing our first Lamborghini. Right, Franklin, let's take this over to our safe house where Mosley will not find the Lamborghinis. It's just around this corner and then we take it round here and we hide the Lamborghinis just over here, guys. I don't think Mosley will find them now. And luckily for us, it's just around the corner. Hey, guys, check it out. This is a pretty nice Lamborghini to start off with. The Lamborghini Aventador Custom Paint Job Design. What did you think of the test drive? Oh, Mosley, I loved the car. It's amazing. I just parked it round the back, okay? Can I test drive another one, though? I just want to figure out which one I prefer. Why, sure thing. Take your pick. I will, I will, I will. <laughs> Guys, do we take this one, the solid gold Lamborghini, or do we take this one? I'm gonna go for the solid gold Lamborghini. Let's give this one a drive. Thanks, Mosley. Look at us go. We're speeding through downtown Los Santos. Wouldn't want to miss the little safe house location, guys. Right, Franklin. Let's park this up next to our first Lamborghini and go and take some more. Hey, uh, buddy, I didn't see your Lamborghini around the back. Are you sure you parked it there? Speaking of which, where's the other golden Lamborghini? Oh, boy. He's on to me, guys. What do I do? What do I do? Okay, I'm gonna walk over to the garage and pretend I was completely innocent about all of this. Mosley, I parked the Lamborghinis round the back, you know, in this little area. Oh, no, they're not here. Uh-oh, I think somebody else might have stolen them, Mosley. Uh-oh, guys, I just realized there's a CCTV camera operating. Please tell me you have not checked the cameras, Mosley. I have checked the cameras, and I didn't see you drive any Lamborghini round the back. Uh-oh, guys. Oh. Oh, dear. This is bad news. Uh, okay, Mosley. In that case, what do we do, guys? I don't think I can lie to him any longer. Oh, man. Okay, I'm running away. <laughs> I need to get clever about this, guys. I need to steal all of his Lamborghinis. Hang on a second. I didn't realize this garage door opened. I think I found a secret way in. Okay, I'm gonna find a way to sneak inside. No trespassing allowed. What if we go through this door? Is this one unlocked? Oh, it is. It is unlocked. Oh, hang on a second. There's Mosley right there, guys. I'm gonna try and sneak right past him. Fingers crossed he doesn't spot me. Is this even gonna work? Oh, boy. I don't think it does, guys. This just leaves straight to Mosley's office. Okay, here's the deal. I'm gonna send Mosley to sleep and that should work for a little bit of time. Sorry about this, Mosley. Night, night. Okay, Franklin, you know the drill. Keep grabbing Lamborghinis. Oh my days. This is a really nice interior. A little bit dangerous, guys. If we crash with this, there isn't really much which is gonna protect us. Whoa, whoa. No windscreen, so all the bugs are gonna fly in our face as well. <laughs> all right, Franklin, you know the drill. Spin it round and take it to the safe location. Quick, we haven't got long before he wakes up, guys. I don't know how long he will be out for, so we better use this time wisely. Come on, Franklin, get out the Lamborghini and run back to the store. Hey, Mosley, my apologies, buddy. You'll be awake soon enough. Don't worry. You just might have lost all of your cars. <laughs> the Lamborghini Urus. Let's get this out of here, guys. Hey, this is nice. It's a 4x4. Four four. It's an SUV. A bit different to the other Lamborghinis, I must say, guys, but I like it. It's a nice car. It's even got the Lamborghini Urus number plate, guys. Hey, this is a strong car. I feel confident confident driving this around. And it's got the sunroof skylight. Come on, Franklin, you know the drill. Park it up and let's grab some more cars. I don't see them in there, guys. I think we can still get more Lamborghinis. Let's see. The golden one, this one, that one. I'm gonna go for the pink one, guys. This looks pretty cool. It's a Lamborghini. I don't know what it's called, but I like the design of it, guys. I've never seen this Lamborghini design before. Whoop. <laughs> let's not crash into the other ones, Franklin. It's a proper town Lamborghini. You could get around with this pretty easily, guys. It's very maneuverable, and it's tiny. All right, Franklin, jump out, and let's grab some more. Yes, he's still asleep, guys. I don't see Mosley anywhere. Now, which one do we take next? I'm definitely getting this one, guys. It's expensive, it looks luxurious, and it looks so modern. Yeah, Truffade 2018 Lamborghini.
Lamborghini Turzo Millennio, guys. Yo, it's got a holographic display. The tires light up. This is a beautiful car. And it's now mine. Back to the safe house. Let's keep on wiping out Mosley. Oh, we're gonna be there in no time, guys. <laughs> this is swole. Don't miss the entrance. That came up quickly. Less than 10 seconds that took us, guys. Oh, no. He's called the police on us, guys. Do you reckon they're inside? Oh, man. Mosley woke up. Let's take a look, guys. I need to find out where he is. He's right in there. Can you see him, guys? He's standing around all over the Lamborghinis as well. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good, Franklin. If we step inside, we're toast. <sighs> I need to figure out a plan. Right, here's the deal. I'm sneaking inside and I'm waiting for a distraction or something that we can use to lose the police. Oh, no, they're still there. Let me listen to what they're saying. I'm confident. He was wearing a white vest. He has short black hair and he's really annoying. Please catch him. He's taken almost all of my Lamborghinis and he's not going to stop. Uh-oh. They're speaking about me. Franklin, you know the drill. Hide in the back until they move. Hang on a second. Since I'm at the desk, I think we could probably take all of the keys to the cars anyway. And then Mosley can't move them. Looks like I'm already ahead of the game. So let's see. Where shall we hide? Where does this door go to? Franklin, this will do perfectly. I'm waiting here until we hear the police officers move down the corridor with Mosley. They're moving down the corridor. We're gonna wait until that fades off and the coast seems clear. Come on, Franklin. You know what to do. Let's get moving. <laughs> yes. Okay, quickly, Franklin, grab another Lamborghini before they jump on the cameras. Police Lamborghini. I gotta go for it, guys. I gotta take it. LP774. This has to be one of the fastest cars in the world. Hey, it's gonna be a game and spot the difference to them. But the time they get on the cameras, they're gonna discover that another Lamborghini has, in fact, been taken, dude. I'm literally driving a police Lamborghini. This is such a nice car. Do the sirens work? The sirens work on this, guys. I now have an official police Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I don't believe it. This is a great day. Hey, guys, are you seeing what I'm seeing? I think Mosley is holding a gun. I'm not kidding. Look at this. He is waiting for me. Mosley is not happy about this. I'm just saying. Are the police? Oh, no. I think the police are in there as well. Oh, my days. Okay, I need to get creative here, guys. Seriously, I think he's figured out I've taken all of the keys. I just need to find a way to nab one of those cars. I might just make a run for it, guys. Let's do it. Run, Franklin, run. Quick, get in the car. Get in the car. Get in the car. Get in the car. He hasn't noticed me yet. Oh, no. Guys, Mosley's seen me. Mosley, please don't shoot. No, he's shooting. He's actually shooting me. Mosley, stop. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. <laughs> he was shooting me, dude. Oh, my day. He's still shooting me. I'm still being shot by someone. Okay, let's go, 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 go. Oh, dear. Now I've got a two-star wonder level as well. I gotta lose the police, dude. Don't worry. I'm in a Lamborghini. I think I can outspeed them. Yeah, definitely. We'll zoom around the city and lose the wanted level. Come on, Franklin. <laughs> You know what to do. Would you look at that? One drive around the block and the police have already lost me. So now we know Mosley will actually shoot us if we take a car. This is getting dangerous. I still need to take the rest of his Lamborghinis though. I just need to get a bit more creative, guys. Dude, he's shooting at me again. <laughs> what do we do? Okay, I need to figure something out. I don't want to stop him, guys. I'm not going to kill Mosley. Ow, you shot my ear. <laughs> Jeez, Mosley, let's figure this out. We can sort this. There's no sorting this, buddy. Not after you've taken over $10 million of my Lamborghinis. Oh, guys, I don't think he's very happy with me. Okay, Franklin, looks like there's no way to stop this then. All right, Mosley, I give it up. I'll hand myself in. Please work. Mosley, I hand... Oh, my jeez, <laughs> he's still shooting me. I had no choice. I had to do that. Well, looks like this store is now mine. We've taken out the competition and there's six Lamborghinis left to collect, guys. You know what, Franklin? Let's just zoom them round to the safe house location. I can't believe leave that dude. Mosley, I'm sorry. For my next Lamborghini, the Lamborghini Asturion is the leather seats on the inside. I just love them to bits. And the steering wheel, dude, this is more formal for a Lamborghini. Mosley, I really like this collection. Looks like you spent a lot of time working on it. Shame it didn't quite work out for you, Mosley. The control on this car is fantastic, guys. Best control I've had on all of the cars I've driven. Look at that drift, dude. And I didn't come off the road. Hey, I've done some organizing to make them look a little bit better. Hey, <laughs> this is the easiest video ever, dude. Mosley stood no chance. And look at all those Lamborghini. Mosley? 
How is this possible? Mosley's alive. Is that him? Dude, I didn't realize he called an ambulance. Oh no, guys, he looks okay. And there's even more police officers around him right now. Uh-oh. Okay, this is bad news. I need to sneak inside there and grab another Lamborghini. I'm going through the garage door. I can't believe I'm doing this, dude. Mosley can definitely see me. There's only four left. I'm gonna take this one. The chrome Lamborghini convertible. The Centurio LP7704. Please tell me Mosley doesn't see. Please tell me he doesn't see. Yes, we're good. We're out of the clear. <laughs> go, 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 go. Dude, I can't believe he didn't see that, dude. He was literally looking my way. Oh, man, we got lucky. Look at the design on this, though, guys. I really like the chrome paint job. Now, this might look like we've had a good run, but remember, there's three Lamborghinis left, and we're not quitting until we take all of them, Franklin. Shh. I'm sneaking through the back door. Do you reckon this will work? Careful, Franklin. We don't want to alert them. Dude, there's officers right there, dude. Literally checking the desk. This is so tense, dude. This is so tense. There's three left. Three left to get. Right, which way? That's the restroom. That's to the garage. Where's the... Oh, there's the... Sh <gasps> Dude, the police officers are right inside. Okay, careful now, Franklin. Let's just hide behind this wall. I want to grab the red Lamborghini, but it's right next to an officer and he's holding a gun. Arr, they're definitely going to shoot if we take that. Okay, guys, let's see, Franklin. What have we got? All right, one second. I'm going to lob it into... Whoa, jeez, he's shooting me. Throw the gas. Go, 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 go. Oh, my days. Dude, he's got, like, really good accuracy. Uh oh, the other officers, the team when Mosley jumped. <laughs> go, go, go. Franklin, how are we still alive? He's still shooting. Go, 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 go. This is insane. And I have a two-star one to level, guys. I did nothing there. This is getting trickier and trickier. The police officers, they're covering more ground. Mosley's ready. The police are ready. Everyone's ready to stop me from taking the Lamborghinis. And to think there's only two left now. There's not even many left. Mosley's gone, but the other police officers are there and they spotted me. And they're beginning to shoot. They're shooting through the glass. Oh, my days. He's shooting the Lamborghini. Oh, okay, 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 okay. He's a little bit crazy. Jeez. I really want to throw some gas in there. Let's just lob it under. Oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. Come on, Franklin. Hey, take gas, buddy. Nice. That's got him distracted. He's on the ground. Go, go, go. I'm grabbing the golden. Oh, jeez. Yes, we got him. <laughs> we got him, guys. All right, we send him to sleep. Let's grab the old golden Lamborghini and get out of here, guys. Oh, jeez, the police have arrived. Quick, go, 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 go. I've got three stars as well. It must be because I sent a police officer to sleep. Anyway, put it over here. We've got such an amazing collection. I can't wait to look at it all at the end. Just one car to go, Franklin. And then Mosley is out of business for good. It looks like the officers are still down on the ground. Oh, guys, they're asleep, snoozing away. Right, let's grab the final Lamborghini, guys. We have got the Lamborghini Veneno LP754 Super Duper car. It's got amazing livery design, ultra blue as well, and the vents around the back. It's all for the aerodynamics. But hey, I've got every single Lamborghini now. It's not my fault he became a Lamborghini tradesman. I mean, we had to sell Lamborghinis one way or another. Anyway, Franklin, what an amazing day it's been. Check it out, guys. We've got Lamborghini Veneno, Lamborghini Aventadors, Lamborghini Sean. We have so many different Lamborghinis. This one, the chrome one, the Urus. Now, which one was your favorite Lamborghini? I want to know. Let me know in the comments. And the most popular car will go in the showcase display, the trophy stand in Franklin's brand new Clinton Luxury Auto dealership. Earlier this morning, I was on a walk with shop. Everything was great until we were kidnapped. They split us up and told me if you don't bring me a trillion dollars in 24 hours your dog gets it i was thrown to the curb and left helpless with zero dollars in my bank account they took me for every penny i have and i have to get them a trillion dollars in 24 hours or else chop dies so i did some research and found the richest man in gta 5 he lives over here this place looks way better than the photos and my goal is to sneak inside and steal his money <laughs> i mean his net worth is 10 quintillion one trillion dollars is gonna be changed to him but i do see a couple of guards on top. There's one guy with a sniper right up there. And there's someone cooking on the barbecue down there. If I take out these guards, we'll be able to sneak inside and steal his money. <laughs> All right, here goes nothing, Franklin. Don't screw this up now. Three, two, one. Yes. Oh, oh, no, he heard something. He doesn't see me yet. Yes, he's down too. Okay, let's see. Is there anyone else? There is, guys. Okay, let's get it. Three, two, one. Clean. <laughs> all right, let's sneak inside, Franklin. I think that's all of the guards. Now there's no guards outside. No one will stop me from going in. Whoa, there's so many cars here. Look at them, guys. There's like a hundred supercars. I am so jealous. How can someone have this much money? This is just not fair. I reckon if I sold all of these cars, I would be close to a trillion dollars. Like, so close. Whoa. 
Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Wait a second, guys. It looks like there's a party going on in there. Let's take a look. Hey, guys, mind if I join in for a second? This is the life now. Maybe I'll just steal his money, pay off my debts, and go buy this house. This is awesome. <laughs> hey, guys, love the party. Ladies, I'm sorry. I'll be back for the party later. I gotta find the richest man in GTA 5 and take his money. So let's take a look, Franklin. Where is he? Hello? Is there anyone in here? Wow, this is such a luxury bedroom. Hmm, where would he be? Hey, does anyone know where the richest man is? Oh, man, they can't hear me over this music. Hello? Jeez, I don't want to cause too much of a disturbance right here. Business is business. What do you mean it can't be done? Wait a second. I heard him, guys. He's upstairs. All right, let's go, Franklin. It's time to make my money. Wait, uh -oh. who are you? Um, I think I've been caught. Hello? Oh, no, guys. I didn't get all of the guards, clearly. Hey, what do you want, man? I'm friends with the richest guy. I promise. Oh, I don't believe that. Where's your invitation? My invitation? I don't have an invitation. I'm just really important. Do you have any idea who you're speaking to? Have any idea who you're speaking to? Don't give me that attitude. Without an invitation, you're not welcome. Okay, mister. How do I get an invitation? I'm sure I can get one anyway. An invitation costs one million dollars. Have you got that lying around? One million dollars? Oh, man, I've only got zero dollars. Hey, can we do an IOU? No invitation, no welcome. Leave! Ah, oh, come on, you didn't need to do that. You threw me on top of a car. One million Dollars, come back when you got it. Ah, oh, this guy's so annoying. <sighs> okay, right. I'm sure we can figure this out, Franklin. It's just a million dollars. You know, we could probably steal one of these cars and sell it. Don't think about stealing a car. Oh, seriously, he can read my thoughts. Well, uh, maybe I won't do that then. Don't worry, guys. I'll come back at night time. Wait a second. Well, hi. I got a minute. I'm getting two phone calls at the same time. This has never happened. Michael, Lester, what do you want? Uh, hello. Franklin, meet me now. Hey, Lester, is that you? Yeah. Yeah, what are you doing? I said I would phone him. No, no, I said I would phone him. No, it was me. I, I, I told you. No, no, I, I was gonna hang up then. Hey, uh, hey, guys, uh, can... I'll meet you, okay? Where are we meeting? Michael's house. Oh, that was enough information. Thanks, guys. <laughs> That's so weird. I just got two phone calls from Michael and Lester. I wonder what they want me to do. Uh, guys, I'm here. Hello? Is anyone even here? We're upstairs. Oh, upstairs. All right, let's go upstairs. I'm coming, Lester. I'm coming. Wait, wait a second. Lester and Michael are together? What? This is so strange. Hey, uh, whoa. <laughs> what are you doing? I found a secret vault, and inside is an unimaginable amount of wealth. Whoa. Lester, are you kidding me? A secret vault with tons of money? Does this mean it's the three of us back together again doing crazy heist? Uh, yes. Except it's just gonna be you. We're gonna do the hacking back here. I mean, that makes sense. You're really good with computers. Well, uh, you just give me the details, Lester. I'll go and get this money. Don't worry. I found the secret vault, but there's one problem. The vault is under the police station. Knock out an officer, take their uniform, and go inside. Find the key, open the locked door, and go down the ladder, which takes you to an underground vault. Oh, Great. You didn't tell me I had to go to the police station. Oh, jeez. I just need to make this trillion dollars. And once I do, I can get shop and we're going to be A-OK. -okay. <sighs> All right, let's see. Got to find an officer. Got to get a police uniform. Where are there officers around here? Uh-oh. Okay, we got to be extra careful now. There's three officers here. No way. Yeah, so I was talking to my friend and he was telling me he doesn't like pizza. I mean, who doesn't like pizza, right? I'm talking about pizza. That's really strange. Uh, bah! Uh, nice. Oh, jeez, he dodged. No, get the boat. Get the boat, Franklin. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, both of the officers are down. Oh, my days. I think he saw something. Hey, uh, sorry, buddy. No need to report anything in. I'm just gonna... Uh, oh, jeez. <laughs> These guys are really, really good at dodging punches. But I got him in the end. They'll never suspect a thing, Franklin. Look at us. We're literally a police officer. I got my badge. Oh, hey, paramedic. Yeah, you're gonna want to deal with them. <laughs> da, 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 da. Can I just go inside then? No way. I can just head inside. I am now a police officer. All right, Franklin, you know the drill. Let's walk inside. Okay, there's the secret door. No way. And why is there like a ton of pizza in the storage room? Dude, they got figurines down there. <laughs> this is so crazy. Oh my days. That must be powerful. And check it out, guys. Look at this armory box and like a hundred different pizzas. So I got the keys and all we gotta do is open the door. Let's do this, Franklin. Whoa, that's a big drop. Okay. <laughs> Don't walk too far forward, Franklin. Careful now. I'm going to an underground vault under the police station. Are you ready to see this, guys? We're about to get so much money. Time to make some cash. Wait, where's the gold? Lester said there would be gold down here. I don't see any gold. All I can see is a USB drive and a piece of paper. Okay, maybe the money's on there, but Lester definitely told me there would be gold down here. I know the pass
password to the keypad or get inside and find out what's on that USB drive. Oh, no. No, 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 no. This is his shopping list. Apples, bananas. What? Lester likes Marmite? Get out of here, Lester. Come on. <sighs> right, I've been given the wrong piece of paper, clearly. Lester's got the password at his house. Hey, Lester, you gave me your shopping list. What's the password? Oh, I was wondering where that went. Uh, not to worry. I got the password here somewhere. Just give me a second. Yeah. Uh, oh, yes, the password is dead, too. The phone's dead. The, the phone, no, no, come on. The phone's dead. Oh, man, and just at the worst time. We'll figure this out, Franklin. I'm sure we will. He told me the first number. That's literally all he told me. Let's see. Two, 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 two. Incorrect password. Three attempts remaining. Three attempts? Oh, no, no, guys. I only have three attempts at getting this password right. Okay, right. In that case, Franklin, we're gonna have to wait here until someone else opens up this vault. But I'm sure we'll be okay if we wait right here. There's no way they'll see us when they come through that door. <laughs> yes, <laughs> someone's here. It's really cold down here. I think he's going to open the door. Now, let's see. What's the password? Oh, yes. Here we go. Two, three, four, five. What? Really? It's that simple? Two, three, four, five? Now, let's wait until the door opens, and then we'll get him. <laughs> two, three, four, five, and we're in. All right, let's go. <gasps> that was too easy, dude. Too easy. Sorry, buddy. Oh, my days. He literally let me in here. All right, guys. I've got the USB stick, and this paper says access to every bank account. No way, guys. With this USB drive, we can access every single bank account. Grab the paper. I need those details, and let's get this out of here. Quick, Franklin. Run, run, run. Get up the ladder as fast as you can. We're getting out of here, Franklin. No one can afford to catch us right now. This is gonna be so crazy if we pull this off. Okay, we're gonna be fine. Don't worry. They don't know it's me. They have no idea. Hmm. All right, we're gonna find a way out of here. This is your commander. We are going into lockdown. Every door and exit will lock. Okay, Franklin, we really better get out of here now, dude, before they find out it's us. Run, run, Franklin. Run, 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 run. Wait a minute. No, they've locked the front door. There's gotta be another way out of here. There's gotta be another way. What about through this door. Quick, run, Franklin, run. Whoa, wait a minute, guys. All right, we're getting out of here, guys. I am not hanging around for that lockdown. Franklin, we did really well, buddy. I mean, honestly, I... I wish I could shake your hand. <laughs> now, let's go and return this to Lester and Michael. And since I'm in a super fast police car, I reckon we'll be there in no time. Get moving. Come on, Franklin. Run, 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 run. We haven't got time. Just gotta run a few things and done. No way. Are we actually done, Lester? Seriously? That's a lot of programs on there. I have no idea what he's doing. Wait, the doorbell just went. You're gonna want to see that. Trust me. Seriously? Are we now trillionaires? Can I finally get my dog back? Lester, you're a legend. Oh, and Michael, of course. Thank you very much. Let's take a look outside. What do we have here? Oh, no way. Yo, Lester, this is insane. I can't believe we actually pulled this off. Wait a second. Look at that, guys. Three money trucks full of gold. Yo, that's one for all of us. I mean, think about it, guys. There's got to be at least trillions of dollars in each one of those. Lester, we're going to be so ra- Ow, jeez. Lester. Oh, my days. No, no, no. Oh, come on, guys. I thought we were friends. They just used me. I'm sorry, Franklin. It's got to be this way. Here. Take a million dollars for your trouble. Well, at least I got a million dollars, but my back really hurts. Ah! Lester, you didn't even shoot me again. Come on. That sucks. I'm back at the hospital and Lester and Michael completely screwed me over. But they did do me a favor. I got a million dollars, which means I can finally buy an invitation and get inside the richest man's house. And once I'm in there, I'll be able to steal every single penny he has. At least a trillion dollars. Hey, man, I got the million dollars. Just let me get through this maze of cars first. Anyway, you said you'd give me an invitation for a million dollars. Well, here it is. I got the money. Only one million dollars? Huh. You need at least ten million dollars to get an invitation. Ten million dollars? No, 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 no. Hang on a second. You said one million dollars. I heard you. You guys heard him too. If you ask your fans to subscribe to your channel, I will slash the price to a million dollars. If you subscribe to my channel, he's going to lower the price back down to a million dollars. If you don't, i got to try out some other crazy things to get ten million. <sighs> okay, you can come in. Thanks. I just spent a million dollars on a piece of paper and the party's gone too. That's sucks. I wish I could have joined in on that. Well, at least the richest man's in here and we're gonna rob him of so much money. <laughs> this guy has no idea. All right, let's go and find him, Franklin. He could be anywhere in this house. Where is he? Your money is on the way. 
and we'll land at Los Santos Airport at precisely 2 p.m. Guys, they're talking about the money. It's gonna land at the airport in just how long, Franklin? In less than two hours. Almost one hour. We better get moving. Hey, sorry, mister. Gotta move. <laughs> We gotta get out of here quickly. I hope he doesn't mind me uh, borrowing his helicopter. After all, I am basically a member of his house. That means I can probably use his stuff, right? That plane is landing in literally less than an hour. I can't afford to miss it, and the helicopter is the only way there. All right, Franklin, land the helicopter, and let's get on board. I want to do it before his men arrive. There's gonna be so many people here. And once they're here, I don't want to take my chances against them. All right, let's sneak on board, Franklin, and grab the cash. Okay, Franklin, you know the drill. Let's start shooting them. Bah, bah, bah. Yes, this is working. <laughs> and that God, yes. All right, all his men are down. Let's keep moving. There's got to be more cash in here. He said there would be so much. Wait, I got to do some hacking. Since when have I got to do hacking? All right, that one maybe goes to that one. I got to connect the wires. I don't know where the men to connect to. I'm just making a guess right now. And then that one to there. Ah, oh, none of them works. Which means this one goes down here and bam, I'm in. Oh, wait a second. This is not money. This is something else. Guys, I've just found a bunch of crates. These are weapons. No way. He oh my days, there's people in here. All right, get him, Franklin. Get him, get him. There's another guy as well. Is there anything else? Oh my days, there's another guy. There's a rocket on there, dude. Okay, I'm gonna try the simple route first. If we connect them all, that was easy. First try. There's someone here in an armored suit. This guy really has got a lot of money stored in here. All right, let's do this, Franklin. Go get him. Go get him. Yes. Now, what do we have here? I was told there would be so much more money. A plane full. Unless there's money in the crate too. Come on, let's pick up this gold. And there's a note next to me too. Oh my days. Hang on a second, guys. This is some dense gold. So much money for this. I've got a billion already. No way. All right. Here we go. It's got a lot of writing. What does it say? Offshore bank details. $500 billion. All right, grab the note, Franklin. Let's get the rest of the cash and go and check out that account. There's half a trillion dollars waiting in a bank account offshore. Wait a second, guys. I just heard a jolt. I think the plane is... No. It's flying in the sky. Quick, Franklin, get out of here. Get out of here as fast as you can. We have so much money with us. Okay, I'm going to release that pile of cash. Get out of the plane, Franklin. Go, 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 go. Oh, man. I'm glad to be out of there. I can't believe it, dude. <laughs> I just robbed his plane full of cash. All right, don't worry. We'll find this. <laughs> I can't believe it, dude. That was insane. Who needs Lester and Michael when you can just do it yourself? I made so much money from that. I might have actually made a trillion dollars. All right, land it, frankly. Careful, don't break your legs. There it is, in the middle of the road. How has no one taken this yet, dude? I'm so lucky. There's just a bunch of cash in here. So how much do we get from that? $300 billion. Whoa. All right, now we're rolling in cash. But I'm still $700 billion away. But not to worry, guys. I got the details to his offshore bank account. They're right here. And I'm going to go there right now and withdraw all of the money. I've never been to an offshore bank. I thought banks were only in Los Santos. I'm so excited. This is gonna be such an adventure. Let's go and get that 500 billion bucks. And then I'll just be 200 billion away. And I'm sure after making a visit to Lester and Michael, I'll get the money back easy peasy. Whew, it's really cold here. I was flying for like two hours and now I'm in this like snowstorm. Oh, oh tree, tree. Watch out for the tree. Oh, jeez. I think we're all right. Everything's fine. I've landed. This is a really bad snowstorm. I can't even see anything. The things I do in this world. Ah, oh, my days. Right, the bank is like right over here, according to my calculations. I don't see anything, though. I really need this snowstorm to disappear. So this is the bank where the offshore account is. It is literally abandoned. Bro, there's still, like, tape on the post. Whoa, this is really weird. Um, feels like I've just gone back in time. Why is there a Christmas tree here? Christmas isn't for, like, another three months. This is really strange, dude. There is someone at the till. Um, uh, there he is. A guy working in a suit. Um, hello, excuse me. I need some help here. I got a piece of paper. It's got some details on. Of course. I just need the password. A, B, C, one, two, three. Thanks very much. Wow, there's a lot in here. Yeah, I know, man. I, I you know, I was just saving it for a rainy day. Can, can you please give me the money now? <laughs> yeah. I could do it taking it back home. Just gotta get it out the back. So he's just gone into the back room to get my money. I mean, how much is $500 billion in actual volume? Like, Franklin, are we even gonna be able to take this back with us? Hey, so where's the cash, man? I was promised 500 billion. The cash is right here on this USB drive. Plug it in, you'll know what to do. Another USB drive? Duh, 
Man, these people in the USB drives. Why can't I just get some cash around here? Well, I've got a USB stick. Let's go and see what's on it. I've got a computer in my car. It won't take me a second. I'll just load this up. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, there's the $500 billion, and it is all in cryptocurrency. This guy is insane. I only have 20% left to get this trillion, and I think we can do it. Anyway, let's get out of here. We can't have much time left. I know just where I'm going to next. This is Lester and Michael's house. They bought it together when they screwed me over. I'm gonna go inside and pay them a little visit. I mean, they have so much money. They bought that house. I'm thinking we go up the stairs, head inside, find them both, and take everything they have. Wait, Lamar. One my days. One second. Drop everything. Get here now. Everything? What, what do you mean? L Lamar? L Everything? Okay, well, I suppose these guys can wait. Not exactly going anywhere. What is it, Lamar? What's so important that I have to drop everything? Take a look through these. Trust me. I've been watching them for an hour, and they're taking money out of there. Lots of it. Okay, Lamar. Let's get their money. First of all, I'm gonna take them out. Whoever's guarding isn't gonna be guarding much longer. <laughs> oh, my days. He has no idea who shot him. <laughs> Uh-oh. You're down, too. These guys are so oblivious. Are you sleeping on the job? Well, Lamar, that's them down. Let's go and see what's going on. No way. They built a secret tunnel on the other side of this. That's awesome. Wait, which way are we going this way? It's so confusing down here. All right, let's keep moving. I wonder where this is going to go to. This is way bigger than I thought it was. It's huge. It goes on and on and on. Don't slip over, Franklin. These are very slippy rocks. I'm right underneath Sandy Shores right now, and no one has any idea. I've made it to the end, and I found a bike and also a ladder. I wonder where the ladder goes to. Are you ready to find out? Whoa. Oh, whoa. Oh my goodness, no way. Franklin, we are gonna be so rich after this. They got every single dollar bill from these, put it in the floor, ready to transport. They've done all the hard work for us. And I'm inside a bank vault, I just realized. Okay, this is pretty amazing, guys. I am literally inside a bank vault. They have no idea. Look at this. Well, this is one of the coolest things ever. Lamar, I got great news for you. I got the cash. This is a great job we did. There must be so much money in there. How about we split the money 50-50? I did all the work, you told me about the job, and what you really did was look through binoculars. Just whatever you do, Lamar, don't screw me over, okay? Relax. Of course we can 50-50. Thanks, Lamar. I know I can count on you. Anyway, <laughs> do you want to know something even cheekier? Let's deposit this money at the same bank we robbed it from. This is it. The Fleeker Bank, just around the corner. <laughs> I have no idea, dude. Okay, I'm just gonna go and uh, deposit the money. Let's see how much money we get from this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I am so close. Just a fraction from a trillion dollars. And I haven't got much time left. Okay, well, in that case, I'm taking matters into my own hand. Let's go and pay Michael and Lester a little visit and give them a taste of their own medicine. They would rather have those cars than be fair and square and give me my share of the money. Urgh, that makes me so angry. Hmm. Lester, Michael, is that you? Ah, oh, yes it is. They're having a dance party outside. Just the two of them. Well, that does make sense. They don't exactly have any friends. Hey, guys, I am done with you two. Calm down. We were planning a surprise party for you. We were going to give you your share. I, I promise. I don't remember you saying anything about a surprise party. Shut up. So to make things fair, I think I deserve all of the money you stole from me. All of it? That's not fair. Yeah, you should press like on the video if you think it's fair. <laughs> Lester, I can see a lot of likes. A lot of people are agreeing with me. It's definitely the fair approach. Now, give me your money. Where is it? Oh, whatever. I didn't like it anyway. Can I keep the place, though? And the cars? Let me think about that. Man, this is taking me a while to think about. Ah, oh, no, Lester. I'm sorry. In fact, you're going to go to hospital instead. Just like you did with me. Screw you guys. Back in the house we go. They even have sliding doors. Wow, so luxury. So let's see. If it was gold, which it was, it can't be upstairs. That would be too heavy. It's got to be downstairs. I found it. All of the gold. But now I've made more than a trillion dollars? I need to go and pay Chop a visit. You know, save him and all. Let's go and pay off our debts. You trust me, it's all in there. Now, can I please take Chop home with me? I really want to take him back. Looks like you're just about saved him. You can go with your dog. I am so glad to have saved Chop. Well, I did lose a trillion dollars, but not to worry, guys. I still got all the money from Lester's house, and you didn't even know how much that was. It was a little bit more than a trillion. It was five trillion. So now I have tons of money and a luxury mansion thanks to Lester and Michael. <laughs> There's no way they're coming back in here. I've got security guards, cameras everywhere, and they know to take out Michael and Lester whenever they see them. Guys, welcome back to the episode. Franklin is pacing up and down his house because it's a very important day, guys. Something bad 
something really bad has happened to Los Santos. There was a zombie outbreak last night, and now zombies are roaming across the streets of the city. Guys, I wish I was making this up, but I really am not, and we have to make sure we're on high alert in today's episode, and uh, we need to save Michael and Trevor as well, guys. We need to make sure they're A-OK, -okay because right now, we are inside the biggest house in Los Santos. You're probably thinking to yourself, this isn't Franklin's house. Nope. <laughs> we're a trillionaire in this game, guys. A few weeks ago, we ran into a lot of money, and this was the house we bought. Now, this does come with a few perks. I have said that there's a zombie outbreak outside, and we have to save Michael and Trevor and stuff. We have spent the past 24 hours designing the ultimate zombie vehicles to take on the outbreak. Today is going to be a walk in the park, but I thought I may as well warn you guys just in case, because there are zombies outside. In fact, let's listen to the radio. Is anything happening? Anything on? No, it's just noise, guys. Oh my days, dude. They've taken down the radio stations as well. But luckily, we know where to go to because we're a trillionaire. Everyone tells us everything. There is an outpost on the east part of Los Santos, guys. If we make it over there, then we're gonna be okay. Oh my days, guys. Oh gosh, the doors are open. Franklin, close the doors. Close the doors. Okay, guys, stay away. We're gonna take them out. Okay, one by one. Oh my goodness, guys. We cannot afford to cause too much noise in this episode or else zombies... We cannot afford to cause too much noise, guys. Zombies can hear us and the more noise we make, the more zombies will come after us. Oh my goodness. I thought we locked the doors, Franklin. Come on, what's the point in having this house if we don't even lock the doors? Oh gosh. Okay, we're locking those doors now, guys, and then we're gonna go outside. Okay, nice. You've locked the door, guys. I can't believe we didn't lock the door, Franklin. What are you playing at, man? Guys, look at Franklin's face. He's terrified. He's scared. He's concerned. He's frightened. And I don't blame him, guys. So can we please drop a like on the episode to uh, try and lift Franklin's mood? He's gonna need it, guys. Franklin, honestly, it's gonna be okay. I'm not gonna let anything bad happen to you. And I know you guys aren't gonna let anything bad happen to him as well. Oh, I forgot to mention, guys. Check it out. Because we have, like, a trillion dollars in this game, anything we need, we can get. And, and that includes the best zombie vehicles in this game. Oh gosh, is that a zombie? No, that's just a person. Okay, I'm gonna need to ask you to leave my property. Don't even think about taking any of my vehicles. <laughs> we need to choose a vehicle though, guys. We could go for the police car. We could take the monster truck. I want to take the monster truck, actually. That looks like a beast. <laughs> yes, okay, we're taking the monster truck, guys. Guys, we're taking the monster truck. Oh, wait, no. Okay, no, I don't think we can, guys. We can't really fit anyone else in here. <laughs> we need to save Michael, guys, and his family. They're definitely not gonna fit inside here. That's such a shame. But either way, I want to have some fun with this anyway. So zombies, time to get cleared out, guys. Oh no, I missed a gate. Guys, I barricaded like everything in this house. By the way, I have this, by the way. So, you know, if any zombies get in my way, we can literally just take them down. <laughs> zombies, time to get taken down. Oh my days, they're dodging it. Okay, we've got to just, there we go. Just slice through them like that. <laughs> this is amazing. We can cause so much destruction with this. So yeah, I, I barricaded all of these doors and gates and stuff guys. We must have missed one. That's so annoying. Well, kind of annoying because now we have zombies to run over. <laughs> I'm just, I'm picturing Michael like trapped inside his house, panicking everything else, guys, you know, just scared and worried, looking after his family. Meanwhile, there's me who's meant to save him. <laughs> just roaming around his garden in a monster truck, running over zombies. I mean, to be honest, this is so much fun. Hey, zombies, how are you doing? Bye. <laughs> oh, yes, guys. Like I said, today is a very serious day, but if you're a trillion it doesn't really matter. You know, I don't think the zombies are gonna get me. I, I don't think so, at least. You know, the chances of them getting me are very, very slim. They can't even climb up here, guys. Let's be honest. They're not gonna do that. <laughs> they're just gonna circle around like... <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna get me, guys. Oh, no. no uh, uh. Okay, let's take a look in the garden. Whoa, there's loads of them down there. Oh, my days. Can we get them? Do you think we're able to get them, guys? Let's see. Oh, guys, you're getting so lucky. That must just be skimming your head. Oh, they are so lucky, guys. Okay, well, in that case, I'm gonna have to drive over this. <laughs> and let's go to the garden. Wait, we'll just back up quickly. Watch out, guys, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> well, that was amazing, guys. Oh my days, where did you come from? Excuse me? Excuse me, guys. I thought I took out everybody on the drive. Okay. This is getting quite annoying now. We gotta be very careful. We we gotta be very careful. We uh, don't get out of the vehicle at the wrong time, guys. I was just about to leave and suddenly there's like 20 zombies in my driveway. That would have been a bad idea. Okay, get out of the vehicle, Franklin. We'll just jump out of the vehicle and we'll take out the zombies one by one. And then we'll go into the garage and pick another zombie car. Something a bit more suitable for rescuing our friends. <laughs> Whoa, okay, they're getting quite close, guys. Hey, do you mind? Do you mind? I was just enjoying my time here. You know, I wasn't really doing anything to anybody. You know, I, w I had nothing to do with any of you guys. And all of a sudden, there's loads of you here. Well, that was so much fun. 
<laughs> I could use that all day. But unfortunately, we can't, guys. Come on, Franklin. Let's get another vehicle. Look at this beast, guys. Look at this beast. And we have the Rolls Royce over there and a supercar over there, guys. I mean, we have so much choice. We could even get more vehicles if we wanted to. There's so many in the garage. But we're going to go for the police car, guys. It seems like the best one. I mean, look at the front. It's got shields. It's got spikes. <laughs> it's even got blades on the back. This thing is a beast. Franklin, well done, mate. I, I gotta say, for a trillionaire, you have a great taste in vehicles in a zombie outbreak. <laughs> Look at what's on the bonnet of this vehicle. This is gonna be insane. Okay, well, here we go, guys. Michael, I'm coming to save you. Okay, luckily, he isn't actually that far away. We just have to drive over there, I think. I don't even know where his house is, guys. It's there. Okay, we'll go over there. <laughs> Let's get a move on, guys. Oh, my days. Did you see that? Did you see that? If I press this, just listen out, guys. Oh my days, the entire car shakes. <laughs> if anyone gets in my way, by the time they get spikes, they're going to be taken out by this, guys. You can just about see the impact we're making on that window. <laughs> guys, check this out. I have done some digging in this vehicle, and we can throw those on demand. <laughs> <laughs> we can set fire to anything we want to with this vehicle. Not only, not only can we take out whatever we want. Oh, wait, no. No, I've set fire to my garden. Oh, my days. Okay. Right. I didn't mean to do that. Uh, now the garden's on fire. But at least we can throw these. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. And if I hold this down, and if I hold this down, it just holds them. You know, it's like, okay, we'll give you a break. But at the same time, we're still shooting at that tree, guys. You can see the tree in the top right corner. <laughs> we are tearing it up. Oh, there we go. The zombie's on fire. Okay. Well, on that note, it's time to hit the streets, put the sirens on, and let's go. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> There's even more zombies down there. Hey, what's going on, sir? Uh, just, uh, hey, catch. <laughs> Do you want to play a game of catch? <laughs> hey, I got you. I got you. I, I need to be saving Michael, guys. You know, at this rate, he is not going to make it through this. Okay, zombie, I'll play catch with you. Oh, my days. Where did you guys come from? <laughs> where did they suddenly come from? I don't know where they came from, but they're here, so let's just go. <laughs> I don't want to ask any more questions, guys. Uh, hey, zombies, I'm just leaving my house. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Yeah, have a great day, guys. Wow, okay, there's actual zombies in Los Santos. Oh, my goodness. There's loads of them. Okay, since we're in this, like, beast of a vehicle, <laughs> let's just go straight on into all of them. Oh, this... This was way worse than I thought it was. Oh, wait. Okay. I thought this was going to be so much better in my head, guys. Uh, are we doing something wrong? <laughs> well, we're in a bit of a pickle, guys. There is somebody on top of the vehicle, but that's fine. I have this. <laughs> oh, my days. No, the vehicle's on fire. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Armor, just work, work, please. I did not mean to set the vehicle on fire. <laughs> oh, no. No, please tell me the vehicle is going to be okay. I mean, it does have loads of armor on it, so it should be okay, guys. But I guess we've learned our lesson for playing with fire. We should not be playing with fire in this game, guys. <laughs> oh my days, please, please don't destroy it. Please don't destroy it. Okay, I need this vehicle. We're gonna be taken out otherwise. <laughs> We're just gonna be some we'll just be a person on the street. This vehicle's still on fire, guys. It's it's not it's not going out. It is not going out. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just use this as another feature to take out the zombies. <laughs> Wait, where's Michael's house? I think I've lost it. Oh, no, we are on the right way. Okay, kind of, kind of, guys. We're taking the detour. <laughs> we are taking the detour. Oh, there we go. Yes, the car survived. Oh, my days. I am so happy about that. <laughs> we almost lost the vehicle so early in, guys. Hey, zombies, catch. Oh, my days. We took them both out with that. Gee, gee, Franklin, this is great. <laughs> You're doing an amazing job. Okay, we're almost there. We just have to go down this hill, and Michael's house will be over there, guys. We'll be there in a jiffy. Hey, so it seems like Michael has barricaded his house up as well. And there's actual survivors in there too. Okay, I like this. Uh, hey, can somebody move this vehicle, please? <laughs> I don't appreciate this. I'm not leaving this on, not with those zombies. Oh my goodness. Okay, right, we're just gonna try and ram this through, guys. Uh, yeah, Michael's house is still upgraded. Good to know he kept the extension. <laughs> Let's go. Watch out! Oh, no, that didn't really work. I'm just going to end up destroying this vehicle. Okay, that's fine. I have something else for this, guys. Michael, stay away from the vehicle. <laughs> Wait, hang on. There's zombies behind there. Oh, no. No, there's zombies behind the vehicle. Wait, that means there's zombies in Michael's drive. That means Michael could potentially be a zombie. Okay, we got to try and move this vehicle, guys. One second. I can probably do this myself. Oh, my days. Now there's zombies everywhere, guys. They're not leaving me alone. They're actually shaking the vehicle as well. It probably doesn't help I got the sirens on. Let's take them off, guys. Here we go. Okay, well, clear the area, guys. Three, two, one. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> and that is how you clear the drive, guys. Let's get a move on. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Michael, I'm coming to save you. It looks like all of your staff have turned to zombies as well. Well, at least he's barricaded his house, guys. Okay, we've got to go inside. We've got to go inside quickly. Michael, Michael, we're coming to save you. Oh, my days. Everyone's been turned to zombies here. What's going on? 
Dude, I thought your house was secure. You're, you're equally as rich as me. Look at what you've done to your house. You've got a massive extension. You've got guards. How did you let this happen, Michael? How? I need to know. Come on, Franklin. Let's go inside. Can we go through the door? They barricaded it. Maybe you all my day. Zombie, zombie, zombie. Michael, I'm coming to get you, okay? Please tell me he's all right. I hope he is. Please be okay, Michael. Please be okay. Oh, my goodness. There's zombies everywhere. There's zombies all over the place. Wait, Michael's calling me. One second. Stop! Shooting up my house! Michael, I'm coming to save you! Come on! I would at least appreciate some gratitude! I was coming to- s Oh my days, that's the last time we saved Michael. You know what? I'm tempted to leave your house, Michael. <laughs> I can't believe he had the cheek to tell me to do that! I'm coming inside, alright? Michael, I'm- Oh my days, Franklin, Franklin, zombie, 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 Franklin! Michael, I need some help! I'm stuck outside with these zombies, and all you can do is tell me to not shoot at your house. Well, at least we know he's okay. You know, now we know he's okay, we can actually leave this place. You know, I was coming to save you and your family, Michael. Can we get in, please, Franklin? There we go. Nice. You can climb. Good, good. Good to know you can climb now, at least. Oh, hey, Tracy. How are you doing? Have you heard there's a zombie outbreak outside? No? Okay. Don't worry, me neither. You just carry on with your phone conversation. I'm here to save you. Oh, Jimmy! What's up? How you doing, man? Yeah, Jimmy's here as well. So, Jimmy and Tracy are both okay. Oh, there you guys are. Michael! Amanda! How are you doing? You doing okay? That's so nice. Okay. Well, do you want to be saved, or do you want to stay here? I really couldn't care less after that conversation you had with me, Michael. I can't believe you had the cheek to tell me to not fire at your house. <laughs> I was saving myself and saving all of you. You guys know the drill? There's zombies outside, hundreds if not thousands of them. One bad move and you'll get eaten by the zombies and we don't want anything like that to happen. <laughs> Look at Amanda's face. <laughs> she looks shocked. She looks so shocked by this. Don't worry, guys. It's gonna be fine. All right, Franklin is a trillionaire and trust me, he has all of the vehicles you could possibly need in the zombie outbreak. It's pretty amazing to be honest. Now, we only have three seats. So, uh, Michael, I didn't really tell you this uh, earlier, but yeah, you're walking. I'll, I'll give you the waypoint. You'll know what to do. Just, uh, yeah, it's only across Los Santos and stuff. If you make it there, then great. If you don't, then uh, <laughs> let's just say you shouldn't have phoned me, okay? <laughs> Look at Michael. He's just stranded. Michael, you shouldn't have phoned me, okay? You shouldn't have done that. That was so bad on your behalf. I was here to save you. So, uh, yeah, let me just... I'm going to email him the location, guys. It's only at the other side of Los Santos, so... Michael, let's see. Michael, Michael, Michael. Oh, watch out for the zombies, by the way. <laughs> There's quite a few. <laughs> right, check your emails. You'll get the location. I'll see you over there, Michael. Let's go, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Don't worry. Michael's going to be fine. Oh, no. Someone parked another vehicle here. One second, guys. Hold on. <laughs> Instantly obliterated. Okay, let's get moving, guys. This vehicle seems really fast, by the way. I think they've done something to the engine because look at this. Because look at this, guys. I am just tapping away. Like, I am just tapping the acceleration. And the vehicle is being fired forward. <laughs> okay, so we have to go over to, like, the east, southeast of Los Santos, somewhere over there. I gave Michael the location. He's going to be fine. So let's get a move on, guys. It's time to get all of you to safety. How's it going, Amanda? How's it going, Tracy? <laughs> let's go. I love this vehicle so much. No zombie is going to be able to get us whilst we're inside this vehicle. And since we set this vehicle on fire twice, I'm confident that, you know, no one's going to be able to destroy this vehicle. Hang on. <laughs> Move out the way, guys. Move out the way. <laughs> this is amazing, dude. I could do this all day just playing in a zombie outbreak as a trillionaire. This is so much fun. Oh, this is going to be so much fun. Out the way, zombie. Out the way. <laughs> this car goes so fast, dude. You know, screw supercars, screw trucks and stuff. This one is the best. I'm putting my sirens on, actually, guys. Hey, hey, Jimmy, Tracy, Amanda, how about we have some fun? Oh, my days. What happened to your head? Okay, we'll just ignore that. Uh, all of you guys as well. What happened to you? Was that my driving? I am very sorry if that's the case. But, hey, check this out, guys. This is going to be great. <laughs> Hold on, guys. This is going to be amazing. Okay, sirens on. Let's have some fun. <laughs> he went flying. Oh, my days. We are going so fast. We're going so fast. Watch out. Don't crash. Don't crash. Come on, break. Break. Oh, gosh. Oh, my days. Okay, this might be the end. This might be the end of us. I am very sorry. I'll be more careful this time. I'll be more careful. I promise. Okay, we won't speed. We won't do anything else like that. I am very sorry, Jimmy. Will you forgive me? <laughs> I'm very sorry, guys. They look so disappointed in me. Well, guys, we arrived. We found the base. It's covered in zombies, though, so I hope they're still okay inside there. If they're not, then this was all for nothing, guys. We may as well have stayed inside our house. Let's take a look. This place is huge, though, so I'm guessing somebody must be in. Yes, I see a helicopter in there, guys. Okay, worst case scenario, we'll take off in the helicopter and get away from here. There's so many zombies outside, though. Okay, let's see if they'll open the gate. Hey, guys. Yay! They opened the gate. They know it's me. Thank you so much, everybody. 
everybody. Look at that vehicle, guys. It's got fire shooting from the top. This is crazy, dude. Look at the amount of vehicles they have. But no, no. Oh, my days. Okay, a few of these guys have turned into zombies. I don't like this. Okay, we'll take out him quickly. Oh, no, a few more of them have turned into zombies as well. It's difficult to tell who's a zombie and who isn't, guys. But I see a couple of zombies around here. Please tell me somebody made it. Someone must have made it, guys. Come on. Look, there's even more zombies around here as well. Come on, guys. Come on. No. Guys, I don't think they made it, you know. They set up this entire base. Look at all the effort they put into this. But I don't see a single person here, guys. So you know what this means. We have to clear out the area and we're calling this place place are. So, everybody out, look after yourself. We're taking out the zombies. We're clearing the area. Luckily, because we're a trillionaire, we don't have to bother with this stuff, guys. We can actually use the big... We don't have to bother with the small things, guys. We can go with the big ones. <laughs> Bring it, zombies! Bring it! This feels so bad. These people built up the entire base, and look at them, guys. They're zombies, and we have to take them all out. I mean, look at that monstrosity of a machine. I can't wait to use that. <laughs> oh, oh, that's you, Jimmy. Oh, my days. Don't creep up on me like that, okay? It's dangerous. You're not meant to be doing that. <laughs> there we go. There's most of them. Hey, watch out, guys. Watch out. That vehicle's gonna go. Oh, my days. Another zombie. Another, another few zombies. Watch out, guys. Watch out. I promised Michael I would look after all of you. We're gonna do that, okay? I'm not... I'm making sure no one gets taken out. None of you are gonna get taken out by these zombies, all right? I'm making sure. I made Michael a promise that I would look after all of you guys. So, stick to that word and don't leave me. <laughs> Just don't do anything stupid. Oh, man, there's loads of zombies around here. Come on, Franklin. Come on, dude. You've got this. You've got this. Oh, my days. They're behind us as well. No, I think I know how they got in, guys. This thing is open. The gate, the, the fence has been knocked down. How did this happen? Can they climb in? Is it possible to climb in? I mean, to be honest, no, they can't climb in through there, but still, I don't like this, guys. What are the spots are there. If they've left that open, guys, surely there's gonna be something else around here, like a hole or something. Oh my days, they're trying to jump over as well. Okay, be very careful. I don't see any more zombies. There's a tower up there. Okay, we're gonna go up the tower, guys. Let's go up here. We've gotta clear out the area before Michael arrives. <laughs> we've gotta pretend we knew what we were doing. What's in there as well? The control room. Oh, this looks interesting. The control room. Oh my days, this is great! <laughs> we're in the control room! Check it out, guys! This is the entire base! How did you get taken out? How? Wait, the gate opens. Is Michael here? I think Michael might have arrived, guys. Okay, let's go back outside and uh, take out the rest of the zombies. <laughs> no! How did this happen? Come on! It's not the end of the world. You know, we can still defend ourselves. There's still plenty of room to defend ourselves, guys, and plenty of resources here to carry on this zombie outbreak for the next 20 years. Look, they even have this underneath. Oh, my days. Okay, it looks like you guys have found the armory then. <laughs> You're stuck inside. I'm not gonna let you out, okay? I'll leave you in there. It's probably the safest place for you guys right now. When Michael arrives, he can let you out, guys. But look at this place. They have everything. They actually have everything. This is crazy. Amanda, Tracy, Jimmy, it's okay. Michael arrived. And he's got Trevor as well. That's amazing. <laughs> Yay! Guys, look who arrived. Michael! Let's go and let's go and say hello, guys. <laughs> Come on, Franklin. Michael, I know we had our differences, but I'm sure we can put that behind us. Good to see you again. And uh, you found Trevor. You pretty much did my job for me. <laughs> the richest kid lives in this mansion. His parents are Billy and he's spoiled rotten. I'm better than all of you! <laughs> Don't look at my car! You're poor! Get out of my way, stupid people! Move it! I've been scoping out the house, making sure I know all the securities and the ins and outs, and you know what? Apart from a ton of supercars outside, there's really not a lot going on. So my first prank is a classic one, straight out of the books. This is gonna be a good old knock and run, except that is only half of the prank. <laughs> you just wait until you see what the second half is. Whoa, there's the mom lying down in the cinema. That's crazy. Oh, my days. <laughs> Good job she's sleeping or she would have definitely seen me. Now, careful. Let's just head to the door and get ready for this. We're going to do a good old knock and run. Three, two, one. There we go. There goes the doorbell and run, 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 run. Hello? Hello? Who's at my door? Show yourself. Come on, don't be a coward. Yes, he's outside. And now's my chance. Are you ready for this? We just gotta sneak along here, get past these lovely supercars. Oh my days, there's so many of them. And then sneak in through the garage. I need to do this really quickly before he goes back to his bedroom. Whoa, this place is massive. Oh my days. They have a grand piano in here? That's insane. This entire corridor alone is bigger than my house. That's crazy. That's where he is, right outside, still searching for whoever knocked on the door. I wonder who it was. Now I gotta find his bedroom. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Where's the stairs? 
Man, I'm so lost. This house is too big. He even has a gym in here. Oh my days. But where's the staircase? I'm really lost and confused. I don't even know where to go. I found his bedroom. This is perfect. Whoa, this is a really, really nice room. Hey, I wonder what he was watching last. No way, dude. That's my video. He was watching a prank video. <laughs> oh, well, he knows everything about these then. Because he loves his money so much, I stuck a dollar bill to the floor of his bedroom. And I haven't just laid the dollar on the floor. I've stuck it down with super glue. <laughs> He's gonna be so annoyed when he finds out that he can't actually take this up. And it's only a dollar bill. Oh my days, he's coming in. He just opened the door. We better hide. Yes, go through here. Nobody knocks and runs and gets away with it. I'll get my revenge. <sighs> okay. Wait a second. Do you smell what I smell? Is that what I think it is? <gasps> Money! I must have this. I must have this. Okay, let's look at this thing. Wait, why can't I pick it up? <laughs> this is mine. This is mine. I'm gonna get Oh my days, he's actually trying to dig up his floor. Are you kidding me? Look at this guy. This is a really sticky dollar. <laughs> he's trying to dig it up. That's amazing. But I still have one more prank up my sleeve. No, I'm not going to throw a grenade at him. I am going to throw a snowball at him. Let's see if we can do this without him noticing. All right, three, two, one. Throw it. Now, what was that? <laughs> okay, quick. Hide, hide, hide. <laughs> I threw a snowball at him. Hello? Hello? That was really strange. Back to the dollar we go. All right, let's try this one more time. Is he still there? Where is he? Is he still trying to get that dollar bill? Where have you gone? Hello? Oh my days, he's on the floor. What have we done? I didn't mean to do this. He's alive. He's just sleeping. Oh man, I must have made him faint or something. Well, that was a pretty good prank. And you know what, guys? I don't think he's going to be bothering us anytime soon. Mom, make me a peanut butter sandwich. Okay, okay. Don't do anything. I won't if you make me a sandwich. Wait a second. He's still alive? Oh, man. He just woke up again. Just when I thought the prank worked. Well, it looks like we got to do another prank. I can't believe he talks to his mom like that. Come on. That's so rude. I need to show this guy exactly how to treat people. And since he loves money so much, I have just the right idea. I've written a letter. And this is what it says. I use the neatest handwriting I possibly could. But once I post this through the door, he is going to be blown out of his mind. Mind. He actually thinks he's won a billion dollars. All right, put it through the door. Nice. Now let's get out of here quickly, 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 quickly. I need to set up phase two of the prank. Mom, I've won a billion dollars. Oh, no. No, 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 no. This is my worst nightmare. I've stolen a car on the streets, and we're going to use this to pick him up. After all, the letter did say that's expect a pickup. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. A billion dollars. That's right, kid. That's right. You have won a billion dollars. <laughs> This is amazing. I have just stolen a car, and I am going to give him the prank of his life. Wait a minute. How old are you? How old am I? Uh, I am older than you, buddy. You look like a kid. Can you drive? Well, you're in my car, so you better hope I can. Now I've got the richest kid in GTA 5. I'm taking him somewhere where no one will ever find him again. I can hear you, you know. Oh, whoopsie. Uh... Okay, maybe I ought to just shut my mouth. Oh, you're gonna love this. I'm gonna send you somewhere no one will ever find you. <laughs> you are about to be pranked so good. No, let me out. Let me out. Slow down. Sorry, man. Too late for that. I can't slow down now. <laughs> you are going off the pier. Bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. Have a good time. That was perfect. Oh, my days. Oh, man, he's alive. Well, uh, hopefully he can't swim. Let's get back on the beer. That went so well to plan. I can't believe we pulled that off. But he's still okay. And he doesn't seem to have changed his ways. Look who's back home. <laughs> the richest kid. <laughs> Hmm. Mom, make me a hot chocolate. Mom, Dad, where are my parents? Your parents have left you, Timmy. Shut up, Siri. No, they haven't. His parents have left him, hey? It looks like they've been on holiday. Now's my chance to really prank him good. Okay, here goes nothing. Since his parents aren't in, I reckon I can sneak inside their house. Oh, my days. His mom isn't on the sofa anymore. It's right. His parents aren't in. This is a dream come true. I think he's showering off. I mean, I would do that as well if I was cold and drenched and just thrown in the ocean. <laughs> so let's find a way to really prank him. And I've got the perfect idea. But to do this, we gotta come back at nighttime. The scene is set. It's dark outside. The lights are on. And he's wasting a lot of electricity. He got pranked so good. Now it's my turn to prank him by not subscribing. I don't want him to get the six million by Christmas. Wow. Now I really want to prank this guy. Saying he doesn't want to subscribe to my channel because we're trying to get to six million by Christmas. That's just mean. There's no reason not to. He enjoys
enjoys my videos. Ah, whatever. You know what? He's what he is. I found his power box, and when I switch this off, it's gonna cut the power to the entire house, which is gonna be really scary because his parents aren't even in right now. Okay, this should be pretty simple. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing. Oh no, whatever are we going to do? The power's gone out. And there goes the lights. Oh, there's actually some pretty big sparks coming from that. We better be careful. Now sneak inside and let's go and find him. Do, 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 do. I just want to check that all the lights have been switched off in here. Mom? Dad? Hello? I'm scared of the dark. He's up there, still in his bedroom. This is perfect. Now's my chance to really get him good. I've got his phone number, and I'm going to give him a call and pretend to be someone really scary. It's calling. Shh. This is going to be gold. Um, hello? Mom? Hi, Timmy. Would you like to play a game? A game? What kind of game? Who is this? Oh, it's a fun game, Timmy. You're going to love this one. I don't think I am. Can you stop calling me? No, Timmy. I can't. Oh, Timmy. Someone's at your door. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Run, run, run. <laughs> Doorbell. Let's top this off with a cherry on top. Uh, we'll kick this one. <laughs> Every single alarm's going off. Ah, ah, oh, what's going on? Oh, such a stop it! Stop it! Oh my days! He actually came outside. No way! Show yourself, you coward! Uh, no. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I really need him to turn away. Okay, maybe I can sneak through these cars. I jump to the next one. Sneak away. And sneak away. <laughs> he actually came outside. That's incredible. But I'm not done yet. This guy needs to be spooked out of his mind. So let's do the unthinkable. Now he's outside. I'm gonna set a fire inside his house. This is gonna be a really big fire. He's not gonna be happy with this. And when his parents come back, they are going to ground him. He's still out there. No way. He's trying to find whoever's calling him. Okay, that should be enough. Let's just lob that down. Oh, my days. Big fire. Big fire. Big fire. Run. Run. Oh, oh, my house. My house. No, this is too much. I'm going. Ah, 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 ah. Mom. Dad. Where are you guys? Hello. Ah, ah, ah. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Help. You. Hello. Oh, no. Why is no one here? Stop. He's coming this way. No way. <laughs> help me. Someone. Someone help. No! Oh, I don't think anyone's gonna help you, buddy. No one likes you. You treat them terribly. He is not gonna be coming back here anytime soon. Oh, no. <laughs> I thought we got rid of them for good, but his parents are back, and they've got the police to investigate. Somebody did this to us, Chief. Don't worry. Our best men are on this. You better make sure of that. My son, he's scared out of his skin. Sounds like the infamous prankster's back. This is the first time they've spoken about the infamous prankster, aka me. Luckily, we have hidden our track so well that they will never find me. I mean, let's be honest, guys. I have done some crazy pranks over my time and no one knows it's me. I'm going to sneak inside and find his dad's cell phone and then I'm going to send a text to his son asking him to do a very specific chore. All right, let's sneak in. I don't see the parents anywhere. This is great news. Right, let's see. Where would he leave his phone? If it's going to be anywhere, it's going to be in the office. There's his phone. Now I've got his phone. I'm going to use it to send a text to his son. More specifically, this text to fill up the cars using the fuel tank outside. Message deletes it, put the phone back on there, and let's pretend like nothing ever happened. No way, he's actually doing it. He's filling up the car with fuel. All right, now's my chance to really prank him good. I am just going to leave. Hmm, let's think about this. Oh, here we go, a sticky. Uh, whoopsie. And let's put one more right on there. All right, and then just throw another one in there, and okay, one more in there. And now we wait for his father to come out, asking him, what is he doing? He needs to see this. Hey, Timmy, no, what are you doing? I'm refueling the car, like you said. I didn't tell you to do anything, but the doubt is dangerous. We gotta get out of here now. All right, perfect. Three, two, one, blow them up. Timmy, what do you do? I did nothing. I did nothing, I promise. I'm sorry, Dad. This wasn't my fault. No more video games for a month. Why? Why my cars? Why, Timmy? Are you the prankster? I'm not, Dad. With no video games for a month, this is working. We're actually making his life even more difficult for him. And hopefully, this will humble him down to normal human level. And to being a nice guy once again. <laughs> but I'm not done yet. Just to reinforce how much of a prankster he is, let's pull off the next prank. Hello, pizza this. My name is Timmy. I would like to order 100 pizzas, please. Mamma mia, 100 pizzas. Hey, 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 Mario. We got 100 pizza order. Where are we taking this to? Uh, to 0413. 
three. Name is Timmy uh, Vinewood Hills. Just look out for the house. It's really big. Well, that was fantastic. Uh, they seem very cheerful. And very shortly, they'll be arriving with 100 pizzas. This is going to be so good. I got 100 pizzas for Timmy. Uh, that'll be $2,342, please. Timmy, why did you order these pizzas? I did it. This wasn't me. Oh, yeah? Well, who else did? Now pay the man. Thanks, sir. Enjoy the pizza. It's, uh, who got pineapple on it? Is that okay? Pineapple? Who put pineapple on my pizza? Why would you put pineapple on my pizza? Ah! Oh! Timmy, you're dead! Not bad at all, and I'm glad I added the pineapple on the top, but it's not over yet. I mean, that was just a small one, you know, just ordering 100 pizzas. Yeah, it's $2,000, but these guys are the richest people in GTA 5, and that kid has a lot of money. So now it's time to step this up a notch. I'm calling good old Simeon. Hi, Simeon. I would like $10 million of your finest cars. Bring them to 0413 Vinewood Hills. We'll pay on the door. Oh, it's for Timmy. $10 million of cars? Are you crazy? We have to steal them first. You better pay. Well, if they don't pay, Simeon is going to be really mad. He's going to steal the cars first. I don't think he was meant to say that. Well, I know what Franklin's doing now. <laughs> but since I've ordered $10 million worth of cars, I want to see what their reaction is like this time. Here he is. He's just arrived. Are you ready to see this go down? He's bought a lot of cars. Hello. We blink car to Timmy. Oh, I didn't order any cars. Yes, you did, Timmy. Now pay me $10 million. Oh, these guys, ignore them. They're just my uh, bodyguards, of course. Timmy, did you buy from Simeon? No. I didn't do this. This isn't me. That's enough games, Timmy. Pay the man now. Oh, okay. Here's your 10 million. Duh, I love money and I'm giving it away. Wow, 10 million bucks. Hey, boys, that was the easiest money we ever made. Enjoy your cars. They're totally not stolen. <laughs> well, I guess this makes up for the cars you blew up. I didn't blow anything up, Dad. It wasn't me. That was gold. And I got him to spend $10 million on something he didn't even buy. But that didn't break him still. So I think it's time we cool someone else up. Hey, Trevor, I want to buy $100 million of whatever you got. Bring it to my house now. That ought to do the trick. <laughs> Trevor's gonna bring him a hundred million dollars of the most random things <laughs> And he will have no choice but to buy it if this doesn't break Timmy then I don't know what will Oh no, not another person. Who is it? Oh, oh boy, why are there so many tanks? That'll be a hundred million dollars, please One hundred million dollars? That's all of my money Yeah, well, not my problem But it's my problem. I didn't do this Yeah, you did. Now give me my money Okay, okay, here's your money have a hundred million! It's all yours! Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, what do the tanks smell? I took a poo inside it. Wow, I could do this all day ordering things to his house. But since I wiped out his bank account, we better think of another prank. Because he's still not broken. Somehow, I'm gonna hit him where it hurts. And I'm gonna find their money supply. So not only is the richest kid no longer rich, but this family will not be billionaires for long. Now, let's see. Where are they hiding their money? No, this is the cinema room. Where would they be hiding it? Hmm, money, money. <gasps> Wait a second, I found it. Yes, I found the money pile. Now it's time to burn this down. This shouldn't be too tricky to do. I'll just pour some jerry can liquid here. I mean, this is why you don't keep all of your money in cash. All it takes is me to come inside and burn it all down. But it's going to be even better because once this is burnt down, I'm going to leave a note inside. Sorry, Dad. Accident. <laughs> He's going to blame his son and he might even be kicked out of his family. This is going to be gold. Except they only wish it was gold. All right, buddy. Let's set this on fire. Whoop. <laughs> Whoop. Oh, my days. Oh, no. There goes the fire alarm. Run. Run. <laughs> Run. No. No, my money. My money. Oh, who did this? My money. Jimmy. Where are you? Jimmy! Jimmy! Wow, this is perfect. Oh, dear. Yeah, shame about the tanks. They can't even get inside. This is timed so well. And because they put rocks around their house, they're actually struggling to get up. Looks like the place is gonna burn down. It's gone every single dollar. What does this say? Sorry, Dad. Accident? Don't come back here again. Oh, Dad. I'm sorry, it wasn't me. Just get out of here. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll get out of here, but I'll be back. I promise. No, you won't. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Timmy's been kicked out of his house. Oh, my days. Hey, man, that sucks. Are you ready for the final prank? The final what? Prank? This is a prank? You're pranking me? You did it. 
Get him! I need to run as fast as I can because he's chasing me and I actually think he will kill me. Quick, run, run, run! This is the last part of the prank and if I can pull it off, I am gonna be so happy with myself. Run, run, run. He's still chasing me. He's still chasing me. Yes, this is perfect. Hey, officers. Ow! Oh, he hit me. Oh, officers, did you see that? Oh, dead. You're so dead. How dare you prank me? Hey, officers, I have no idea what he's talking about. Can you please help me out? Put it down, kid. Put it down. Put it down now. <laughs> this guy. He's been pranking me! Well, why have you got the gun? Put it down! But, sir, I didn't do anything! I was pranked, I promise! You tell that to the judge, because from what I saw, it didn't look like you were being pranked! Oh, no! I want my dad! I want my dad! Your dad is not here to save you now! Rich kids like you think you can do anything! Well, guess what? You can't! Now go to jail! Now! No! I didn't do anything! I didn't do anything! And that is my job done. I'm about to take the world's fastest car in GTA 5. It will go faster than planes, jets, helicopters, even space rockets. And I cannot wait to get my hands on it. The only difficulty is that it's located right inside the military base. Franklin has nothing on him. Literally nothing. Where is it, Franklin? What have you done? All of your money empty. We have no money at all. We can't even buy stuff to defend ourselves if we wanted to. So I need to find a way to break into the military base and steal these super duper fast cars. And there's a guard over there, guys. If I try and break in now with nothing on me, then he's gonna take me out before it. Yeah, look at him. He's already walked out of his boot and he's shouting at me, dude. <laughs> Oh, jeez. He's literally aiming at me. I can't go close. Is he still watching me? I bet he's still watching me. Oh, don't worry, buddy. I'm not gonna break in. I don't think I can. I don't wanna die. Where are these fast cars? Where are they? I don't even know what they're called, guys. Like, what do we call them? Space cars? Like, seriously? <gasps> Dude, I can see them, and they look beautiful. Can you see that red car over there? No trespassing beyond this point. Photography is prohibited? Oh, jeez. This is tense. But there they are, guys. Both of the world's fastest cars. There's two of them. A blue blue one and a red one and they look insane right put this away franklin let's figure this out we could try and sneak inside the military base i might give that a go guys let's see if we can break in and sneak our way inside <laughs> hey guys if you want to wish me good luck in collecting these world's fastest cars press like on this video right now if you don't then we're gonna have the worst luck today so now the guard can't quite see me but i can see inside the base i'm gonna try and break in this way guys we're using our brain here. High IQ move. I need to get this fast car. It's amazing. You say world's fastest, I say it's mine. He's right there, guys. I don't think he can spot me, so I'm gonna just quickly walk down this... Whoa, do oh, Franklin, don't fall. <laughs> don't fall over, buddy. We're gonna walk down here. Nice, he still doesn't see me. And then just slide down this cliff. So in order to break in, I need to... Nope, not do that, Franklin. We need to climb on the wall. Come on, buddy. There we go. Thank you. And then we need to very carefully just nudge across here. I know exactly how to break in. Do this, and then do this, and we're in. Now, what we could do is go after him and take his gun. That's probably a good idea. Or we could try and sneak in this way. You know what, guys? I'm gonna go after him and get his gun. Franklin, let's be careful here. This is so tense, dude. Oh, no! No! <laughs> oh, jeez! Oh, my days! Get him! Get him, Franklin! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get on the ground! No! Jeez! Oh, my days! Have we got him? Have we got him? Stay down! Stay down! No, 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 no! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! Stay down! <laughs> yes! We got his gun! We got a few people coming down here. Nice one, Franklin! I actually don't believe we're doing this. They're losing me. They have no idea I'm right here, guys. Look at them try. No, they found me again. They found me again. I am literally steps away from this car. There it is, guys. Oh, jeez. Guards, guards. Okay, nice. Run, run, Franklin. Into the car, into the car, into the car. Oh, my days. Oh, my goodness. I've got it. I've actually got it. I've got the... <laughs> I've got it, guys. Whoa. <laughs> what the heck? This is fast. This is insane. Right, come on. Drive, drive, drive out of here. Whoa. <laughs> this is insanely fast. Go! Oh my goodness. Yo, guys, this is so fast, dude. I've already lost the wanted level. I've, I've lost the wanted level. How have I done that? This is the best car in the world. Right, Franklin, let's take a look at this masterpiece. I could do with getting it repaired. I can't even put my foot on the pedal because it will blast off. Oh, jeez. Don't go into the military crusader car. Please don't do that, Franklin. Oh, no, it's got a fuel tank, guys. We're gonna burn through that. Whoa! <laughs> 
This is crazy. Right, I'm going to take this to the Low Sandos Customs to give it a bit of a repair. After all the damage we've done to this car, we probably ought to do that. Right, let's see. Repair the vehicle for free. Thank you very much. I can't believe we collected it, guys. So the military base have been working on this car for a long, long time. Armor upgrade, brake upgrade. Bumpers. Can we actually add bump? I can add bumpers on, dude. Look at that. Upgrade the engine somehow. Exhaust. Hello, I can change the exhaust. I don't want to do that. Let's go for something cool, like a... A classical horn. I quite like that, guys. Headlights. Yep, make them blue. Neon kit. Front, back, and side. This guy is literally kidding me out for free. I love this guy. He's awesome. Now, we can actually change the respray, guys. I might do that. Considering they know exactly what car we took, probably gonna give it a nice little respray to a blue and give it a pearlescent as well. Let's see. What looks nice with blue? Da -da 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 -da. We could go with red. So, do you have any blue pearlescents? Ooh, I quite like this, guys. An ice white. That looks nice. I'm liking this car now. Roll cage. I love that. You can add a roll cage, but it's not inside the car. It's outside the car. You know what? I'm probably gonna need this, so I might actually add it on. No, 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 no. Screw safety. Let's keep it as is. I've lowered the car, added suspension, more race transmission, turbo as well. Wheels? I could change the tires. Limousine, guys. We could be anyone in here now. Right, Franklin, let's drive this out of the customs very carefully. I'm not even kidding when I say I am nudging the pedals, guys. I'm... Dude, do you mind? Can you just please leave? Oh, hang on. I can begin a robbery. Hold up, guys. Since I'm in the world's fat... <laughs> I keep crashing into it. Since I'm in the world's fastest car, I might give this robbery a go. Let's do it. I've got zero dollars. All right, everybody. So hold up. Let's shoot the cameras quickly. No one's going to catch up with us. Literally nobody. Dude, we're in the fastest car in the world. If I can lose the military base in less than 20 seconds, then we can lose the police. Let's be real here, guys. Right, tell us. One of you is going to open the bank door for me. Who is it going to be? Is it going to be you? Are you going to be the gentleman? Yeah, I think he is. Right, come on. Don't make me shoot you because I will. Right, open the vault door for me please. Dude, if we make more than a million dollars, then this is going to be the best day ever. We will have literally taken the world's fastest car and over a million dollars. Thank you very much. You have served me very well. Now open this door, please. Open this door. Oh, I can see the cash. Thank you. <laughs> All right, let's take the money. $400 million. Guys, I have just taken more than half a billion dollars from this beautiful table right here. And there's still gold bars. I've wiped out Sandy Shores. I apologize. Residents of Sandy Shores, I apologize. But I am wiping out all of the cash. This is insane. I am now officially worth more than uh, than everyone in this game added together. Oh my goodness. Look at all the police outside. Thank you very much. You have served me very well. Let's get in my car and get out of here, guys. Are there any sheriffs around? Dude, I don't see anyone. Right, there's a helicopter. Three. Three, two, one, let's go! <laughs> I'll be getting out of here. Thank you very much. Okay, as long as we don't go over any spike strips, we should be okay. This is so fast, dude. Oh my goodness. Yo, this is even scarier in first person. This is terrifying. Good. Good. It feels like I'm in a racing game. And I'm really bad at racing games. Oi, 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 look at us go. How are the police still catching up? Ah! <laughs> How are they still catching up with me, dude? I don't understand. Whoa, whoa, jeez. Where are we? Are we good? I just realized. I'm running really low on fuel. I need to refuel the car. So I need to find a petrol pump, which is meant. There it is. I can see it. One second, officer. Just got to refuel my car. Thank you. Oh, yes. Maximum fuel. Just what I like to see. I can't get out of this space. Leave me alone. Right. Here we go. I am just going to hold acceleration and escape. Okay. It's probably the best way out of here, dude. And away we go. <laughs> Don't go in the seat. Don't go in the seat. That would be a terrible way to end this video. And we. There we go. Fantastic. Landed. Landed, landed, keep it up, keep on rolling, onto the beach we go, oh jeez, et voila, we have now lost the wanted level, that's how you do it guys, you just shoot off over a mountain and you leave the police behind, so here's the deal, my car is too fast to comfortably drive, there is no like normal button, it's just lights and a steering wheel, you know, there's nothing normal about this, just watch, just watch, okay, uh, guys, can you just, can you, can you let me go through, please? Just watch this. All right, three, two, one. <laughs> and off we go straight down into downtown Los Santos. Let's drive some more. Oh, we're going to take off and fly at this rate. <laughs> Oh, jeez. I'm so glad I'm not him, dude. Ooh, and yeah, voila. Now we crashed into a bank, guys. I mean, you get the idea. We definitely need to find somewhere a little bit easier to drive a car as fast as this. I mean, I can barely turn a corner. I have to brake to turn. We're just going that fast. Oi. 
Oi, 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 yo, yo, yo. Damn, we crashed again, guys. Right, I know exactly the place to go to. We're going to the airport. I'm pretty convinced that if you gave me a ramp long enough, we could actually fling this car into space. Speaking of which, there is actually a ramp around here, and I want to drive the car up it. This is going to be insane. I can't wait to do this. Right, there's the ramp. It does have a Mini Cooper on it, so let's just be careful about that, Franklin. We don't want to crash into that car and right off this one. <laughs> Dude, I can't believe we're doing this. I hope you're ready for this, Franklin. Let's back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. And three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Hold the ability. Hold it. Let's take one little corner and straight up. Yo, guys, I am above the buildings. This is a hotel. And that wasn't even full throttle. We could do way better than that if we were in a different location. Let's do a good old speed test. I want to find out how fast we can go. I've got a runway, one of the longest stretches of land in the entire of this map. How fast can we go? Three. Three, two, one, go! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one thousand. And I'm already skidding out. One thousand three hundred. One thousand five hundred. Uh oh. Oh no, this isn't good. We're going in the sea. This car can definitely exceed more than a thousand miles an hour. Let's try this one more time. We're going down this runway. Five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifty, six, seven. <laughs> what? This is crazy. I love this car. I crashed. I didn't even go up a ramp. And we're already above the clouds. This is crazy. I love this car. Oh, hold up. Am I gonna land on the aircraft carrier? Could you imagine? Hold up. Hold up, guys. I might actually be landing on the aircraft carrier. Please. Come on. Come on, Franklin. Come on. You got this. You can do this. <laughs> stay. Stay. I think we're actually... We're, we're, uh, st okay, guys. Not gonna lie. I was not planning this part. My car is now out of fuel. I crashed at the airport and landed at the aircraft carrier. How is that possible? I don't understand. I, I, I can't even drive this anymore. This is hands down one of the craziest cars have ever driven. This is where the richest man in GTA 5 lives. He's a trillionaire and I'm going to steal every single dollar he has. But getting inside isn't very easy. He's got security guards literally everywhere and they're from the SWAT team. There's some pretty professional security guards. So don't worry guys, I got a plan. <laughs> I'm dressed as a fireman. So if anyone raises their eyebrows at me, I'll just say I'm working with the fire brigade. I gotta test those fire alarms or something official. <laughs> Let's see if this works. If I can pull this off, I will be become a trillionaire and I'll be able to buy literally everything in GTA 5. <laughs> Shh, don't tell anyone about our secret plan. I'm trusting you guys not to say a thing. All right, here goes nothing. Bring up the fire truck. Now let's see if these guards buy it. Hello, I'm here with the fire brigade. Oh my days, they opened the door. Amazing. <laughs> I made it through the gates, but there's two guards in front of me. I need to see some ID. Well, I suppose I am a fire brigade person, so <laughs> I'll just give him my actual ID. Franklin Clinton. If anything goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Don't worry, mister. Absolutely nothing is gonna go wrong. I'm a professional fireman. <laughs> oh my days, there's Oh, jeez, they're shooting us. Quick, Franklin, get inside, get inside, dude, get inside. Oh, my days. Dude, they must have just suspected something wrong about me. What am I gonna do now? They know I'm up to something. Did you guys tell them? Oh, man, I, I knew I couldn't trust you. Okay, well, in that case, Franklin, let's see. There's gotta be something around here we can use. Maybe one of these people is the richest person. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking for the richest guy. He's at the other side of the building. Please, don't shoot. Fantastic. He's at the other side of the building. <laughs> Let's go and find him. He must be through this door and somebody left it open. <laughs> well, isn't that just my luck? Now, where is this guy? Hello? Hello? I'm here for the richest man. <laughs> there you are. Excuse me, mister. I need to get all the money you got. You know what? I'll just take it from you. Now. <laughs> right, grab that, Franklin. Whoa, I got the vault password. Yes. And let's go and open the vault. I walked past it on the way in, guys. I know exactly where it is. There's going to be so much money in there. Bada bing. Bada boom, here's the vault. Let's put the code in. <laughs> I found the vault. There's the gold. And I'm officially a trillionaire. Yes. <laughs> Ow. Oh, come on. That really hurt, dude. You messed with the wrong guy. Oh, no. This is really bad. Oh, man. Come on. Can we just put this behind us? Clearly, it didn't work. What do you think you're doing? What are you going to do with a trillion dollars, huh? I'm sorry, man. I had no idea what I was doing. Can I just go home? I got a dog and I love him so much. We know all about your dog. He's right. Hey, boss, look who we got. I've never 
eaten dog before, but I'm sure it tastes nice. That's kind of weird, man. No, it's not. No, no, you can't be serious. Eat chop? What kind of evil person are you? Listen to me, son. I'm gonna make a deal with you. I don't believe you can spend a trillion bucks in a day, and it's only a penny in my pocket. If you can spend it by the end of the day, you get to keep chop. If you can't, you're gonna die. And so is your lovely dog. What? That's the weirdest request ever. He literally wants me to spend this money. And what happens if I do, huh? Then you get to go and keep everything you bought. But you gotta spend everything to the last cent. You got yourself a deal. I, I mean, that's actually kind of a, a decent scenario where we might actually survive. But I got until the end of the day to spend a trillion dollars. This guy really doesn't like me. They have Chop as a hostage. And unless I spend a trillion dollars, by the end of the day, Chop's going to die. So let's see. I got a ton of gold and a ton of money. A trillion dollars ready to spend. What's the first thing we can buy, which costs a lot of money? We're gonna go for the most expensive stuff. Like, literally, nothing less than the most expensive. Jason? I don't recognize a Jason. Who's Jason? Hello? Sir, how would you like to upgrade your house for 100 million bucks? Upgrade my house? Hey, that sounds like a really cool idea. What do you think, guys? Do you reckon I should do it? Oh, that's an easy yes. Hey, mister, I don't know who you are, Jason guy. Can you upgrade my house, please? Yeah, take 100 billion. <laughs> so I just upgraded my house? That's already 10% of my money gone? I can't believe that was so easy. I better have got a good house upgrade. Let's go and take a look. Whoa, this is amazing. My house has been totally transformed. There is literally another house on top of my house. Hey, let's go and take a look at this place, Franklin. I am gonna take a look in the garden and there's already a staircase. No way. I think I'll just take the staircase up and check out the roof. <laughs> Hot up. Lovely TV with the view of Los Santos. Check this out, guys. I have my own office and a cinema room. Okay, this is a pretty cool upgrade. But this is only 10% of spending my trillion dollars. There's still so much more money to spend. I could do this nine more times. Can you believe that, guys? Nine more house upgrades. Wow, there's even a master bedroom up here. That's incredible. And you know what I love about this? Is that down below, there's a bunch of rocks next to my swimming pool. That's awesome. You know what I could do with now? I could do with filling the garage up with a bunch of nice cars. And I think Simeon's gonna have some pretty nice ones. <laughs> and since I have 900 billion dollars, we're gonna be able to buy any car in this universe. Let's go and buy some cars. Imagine Lamborghinis, Bugattis, Ferraris. <laughs> Lester. Hey, 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 hey. Franklin, Franklin. You sound really out of breath, Lester. What do you want? Nice place. Would you like to buy a business? A business? I haven't thought about that. Franklin Clinton, professional entrepreneur. <laughs> Lester, I'm interested. But first, I could really do it buying some cars. This place is looking bare. Forget the cars. You're gonna wanna hear this. I know where the owner of Life Invader lives. Do you now? And why do you know that, Lester? None of your business. Except there is a problem. He's not willing to exactly talk to us. You're gonna need to get through his security team. Well, that should be simple enough. How big's the security team? Oh, not very big. Uh, you'll be fine. Thanks, Lester. Thank you. So it looks like I get to buy Life Invader. Do you have any idea where that is? Let me just show you right now. Life Invader is the social media website of GTA 5. And Denise Clinton coming in with the roast. Does the new crib mean you've moved out or haven't you moved out? How many homes do you need before you put some food in the fridge? Denise, screw you. Okay, screw you. <laughs> Actually, I want up her because I'm going to buy this company. I got $900 billion. We easily got enough money. <laughs> Let's go and buy the company and kick Denise straight off Life Invader. This is going to be awesome. This is where the owner of Life Invader lives. This is a really nice house. And I gotta sneak inside and find the owner. Lester, you told me there would be no guards. There's so many of them. Right, you know what, guys? I'm just gonna do this in Star Whoa, whoa, don't crash into anyone. <laughs> that was close. Hey, just ignore me, guards. Ignore me. Just, just Fireman Franklin over here. <laughs> Right, let's take them all out. Three, two, one, bam! Oh my days, that car literally just saved them. Get them, Franklin! Come on, what are you waiting for? Now! Ah, nice! <laughs> and that's all the guards dealt with. Sorry, mister. I mean, I, I was naming for you. You just drove in front of the rocket. That was basically your fault. <laughs> uh oh, there's even more guards. There's even more of them, dude. There's so many. Arr, screw you guys. Yes! <laughs> Look at me. I made it inside and not a single guard left. Now, where is the owner? I need to buy this business. Hey, this seems a little bit suspicious, you know? I mean, Lester said he would sell the business to me. <laughs> I just took out his security team. Is he really gonna want to sell the business to me? Well, I guess there's only one way to find out. You! I know you're the owner of Life Invader. Now, I'm here with an offer. <laughs> I would like to buy the business. Give me the business or else your windows are gonna break. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Listen, I'll sell you the business for 700 billion. 700 billion? That's fantastic, actually. I got a trillion dollars to spend. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'll buy the business from you. Thank you. That's all right. You're crazy. Yeah, I know. But since I own the business, I also own this house. Can you leave now, please? <laughs> I just spent $700 billion buying life and data, and now I own the business. This house is mine. The company's mine. Let's go and check out those offices and tweak a few things. <laughs> Guys, you know what that means? I only have $100 billion left to spend until I get to win this challenge. And since I own life and data, that's going to be so much income for the rest of my life. Come on, let's go and check out the headquarters. <laughs> Before I go and check out my amazing new team at Life Invader, let's go and uh, dress up in something nice. <laughs> oh, Franklin, you look good in this. Well, thank you very much, ma'am. Now we're actually looking pretty rich. <laughs> we're going to spend this trillion dollars in no time. I almost spent it in one purchase. This is going all too well. And now let's take a look at Life Invader and meet the team. I have a really good prank I want to play on Michael. You guys are going to love this. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. It's Franklin Clinton. <laughs> <laughs> Your new boss. This is so cool. I literally own the Life Invader building. I got an amazing receptionist team out front. Hey, what's up, guys? Who are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trust me. They, they're gonna, they're gonna, we're gonna get along. We're all gonna get along really, really well. <laughs> and let's go upstairs and play this really good prank on Michael. Wow, this is awesome. These guys literally have no idea that I've just bought the office. I am now your new boss. I am your leader. <laughs> Can you give Michael 100 million followers, please? Michael DeSanta. Yeah, that's the guy. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Just do it. Okay, then. Amazing. Michael DeSanta's gonna get 100 million followers. Now, let's go to his house. <laughs> this is gonna be hilarious if it actually works. No way. It actually worked. <laughs> Michael DeSanta is now the most famous person in the whole of Los Santos. He's gonna hate that. Trust me. Look at all these people. Hey, guys. I'm Michael's best friend. I'm just gonna come through. Michael! <laughs> this is amazing. All because I gave him 100 million followers. Oh, dear. I think Jimmy wants to go out cycling. Hey, Jimmy, I wouldn't recommend that if I were you. You got a couple of fans outside. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Is he gonna be okay? Jimmy, Jimmy, watch out, buddy. <laughs> this is so crazy. His entire family is super famous. Leave me alone. Hey, I don't think Michael likes this one bit. <laughs> hey, Michael, they're not gonna leave you alone, buddy. You're the most famous person in Los Santos. And these guys, they're going crazy for you. <laughs> There's so many photographers. This is hilarious. They've even fenced off part of the street. What? Michael has no privacy now. Like, literally no more privacy. This is hilarious, dude. <laughs> See you, Michael. Have fun with your newfound fame. He did tell me he always wanted to be in movies. Now you can be in so many of them. Oh, man. Lester, what do you want, buddy? I was just about to buy a really, really nice car. Forget the car. I got something better for you. Better? Seriously, Lester, you always got something better for me. And last time I trusted you, I had to go and intimidate the owner of life invader, which was pretty hilarious. Have you seen Michael's house? <laughs> Simeon will sell you his store for 10 billion bucks. What do you say? Have all the cars in the world. Wait a second. Simeon selling his store? I didn't realize he was doing that. Yo, Lester, count me in, buddy. I'll go and buy the store from him. <laughs> if I can just buy Simeon's store, then I can have every single car in the GTA universe. Let's go and buy this store. I get to buy Simeon's for 10 billion dollars. Hey, Simeon, I got the memo from Lester. I heard you're selling up. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, really? Really? Lester told me for 10 billion bucks that I could buy this store. So that's what I'm here for, Simeon, and I would love to get these cars. <laughs> Simeon, give me your store. You're making big mistake. Trust me. Simeon, I haven't trusted you one day in my life. Now give me the store now. Here's the money. Now sell me the store. <laughs> I want to own every car in Los Santos. Fine, fine. Here's the store. Give me the money, okay? There you go, Simeon. There's your 10 billion. Thank you. I would like to buy the store back. No, Simeon, that's not how it works, okay? The store is now worth double. <laughs> All right, this is mine now. This is awesome. Hey, Simeon, we don't need you here anymore. So can you just go? <laughs> I have just bought Simeon's store and inside are some of the rarest cars ever. There's a Ford GT40, a Lamborghini Turzo. This machine, whatever this is, that looks pretty awesome. I think it's hovering. Wow. Next to the machine is this. <laughs> There's a lovely supercar and a Bugatti with golden engravings. And wait a second, guys. Simeon's store is also mine. <laughs> this is amazing. Now I own Simeon's store. I have some real nice cars, and I finally can drive a supercar around GTA 5. I think we'll start with this one for now, but I still have 90 billion dollars to somehow spend. How am I gonna do that? Do you guys hear that? Sounds like a foghorn. Let's go and check that out. <laughs> what could that possibly be? I can hear it really
really loud foghorn coming from over here. Hey, let's go there right now, Franklin. And luckily for us, I'm in a super duper fast car. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport. This is one of the most expensive cars money can buy, and I'm driving it right now. <laughs> hey, maybe we can get like a couple of these for Franklin's brand new house upgrade. I mean, playing as a truly there really isn't that bad. I own Life Invader, I own Simeon Store, I own a house upgrade, and I have one of the coolest cars in the universe. But what is that noise? I still can't put my finger on it. Do you guys have any idea? Let me know in the comments if you know what it is. Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? This is a cruise liner. Wow, the Queen Mary 2. This is the biggest boat I've ever seen in GTA 5. I must buy this. Have you seen how many windows are on there? There's got to be at least a thousand bedrooms. Whoa. All right, let's get this thing. This is the size of a town. All right, there's a little queue over there. Hey, guys, excuse me. Out the way. I, I need to get on. I need to get on. This is mine. This is mine. Excuse me, sir. Uh, could I, could I, uh, could I take a ride on this? <laughs> how much for the boat? $20,000 for a round the world trip. $20,000. No, I don't want it bought as a guest. I want to buy the thing. How much does it cost to buy a cruise liner? You can't be serious. Uh, in that case, it's, uh, uh, $50 billion. $50 billion? Well, uh, I think we got the money. I still have, like, $90 billion after all. <laughs> Count yourself a deal, buddy. This is now mine. This is an announcement from the cruise liner. Everyone is kicked off. Your holiday's canceled. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. I have literally just bought a cruise liner. The doors are tiny, but there's the balconies up there to the bedrooms. And look at all of the lifeboats. There's so many. I am really high up as well. Like, this is as high as some of the towers in Los Santos. But let's sail this thing. I think this is where you move it from. I can't believe it. One little steering wheel for this entire boat? Now it's talking. <laughs> let's go, Franklin. Listen to that horn. That is so loud. So I have just got the Queen Mary 2 for 50 billion bucks. I still have to find a way to spend 40 billion by the end of the day. But I think we got a bit of time. Let's take this for a ride out to the ocean. <laughs> wow, this is so crazy. <laughs> it's so cold out here. I'm really far away from Los Santos, and this has been so much fun. But I don't want to let shop die today, so let's go and spend the rest of my money. Oh boy, how long was I gone for? It's five o'clock already? Wow, it really is getting late. Maybe that was too long, Franklin. Okay, let's see. 40 billion dollars. You know, I could buy some more businesses. We'll find something out. Maybe get some. I can't even get cars anymore. I already own the car store. Prison inmate? Hang on a second. Someone's phoning me from the prison. Franklin, it's me. I need help. I'm stuck in prison. Lester's in prison. Wow, that's the first time I've heard him go to prison. Well, let's go and uh, see what the bail is. Maybe we can spend our money on that. <laughs> Knowing Lester, it's gonna be pretty high. Hey, fancy seeing Lamar in here. Hey, Lamar, what's up? Are you meeting somebody? Oh, well, well, he's meeting someone too. Oh, Lester, there you are. <laughs> How do you get yourself in here, buddy? This is kind of weird. Seeing you on the other side is usually the other way around. Listen, it was a mistake, and you're the only person I know. Can you bail me out? It costs 30 billion bucks. 30 billion just to bail you out, Lester? Well, I do have the money, and you know what? If it was any other day, no, I wouldn't. But since it's today, <laughs> you got yourself a deal, Lester. I'll bail you out of prison. But you owe me. No more betraying me, okay, Lester? I know what you're like. You're a real friend. Thank you. I want to pay you back. Here, take my house. I think I'll pass on that, Lester. You don't have to pay me back. Just call it a really nice favor. But I would love to buy another house. Something bigger and better than Franklin's. Let's see what we can buy in Vinewood Hills. <laughs> now this is what we're talking about. Lake Vinewood Estates. The most expensive place to buy a house in GTA 5. <laughs> and this one is one of the nicest houses on the street. I think I'll buy this house instead. One billion dollars should do the trick. I mean, there's no way it's worth more than that. <laughs> Which leaves me with nine billion dollars. You know what I'm going to do with that money, guys? I'm going to throw the biggest party ever. But I'm going to save a billion just for later. You guys will see. <laughs> I think I'll even invite the richest guy over, you know, and just prank him real good. Right, Lester, help me set up the party. That's what you can do. Oh, that'll be a big favor, actually. Let's go and make the biggest party in GTA 5. <laughs> now this is a party. I got fireworks, I got the whole of Los Santos here, and more people are arriving by the second. <laughs> there are so many things going on, from music video photo shoots to gigantic cars. A running race? <laughs> Wait a second, people are running. They're literally running running, dude. What are you doing? What's the point of this game? Wait a second. There's a ladder. Who put this ladder here? <laughs> this is awesome, but I saved $1 billion to prank the person who thought it was a good idea to dare me to spend a trillion all the way down to zero. Wow, there's people chilling on the roof. I didn't realize you could do this. This is actually so cool. Oh my days. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> I think someone's falling off. No way. Is that really what I think it is? Is someone, someone is, oh jeez. Bro, you're on your own there, buddy. 
<laughs> but wait a second. I can see him already. He's arrived. And it looks like he's got Chop with him too. Hey, Chop, don't worry, boy. I'm gonna save you. So let's just get down from here. I'm sure we'll be... Oh, boy. Oh, that really hurt. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Afternoon, ladies. Right, let's go and get Chop back. Hey, guys, let's go speak on the tennis court. Away from the party. Did you manage to spend it all, son? I did, except for $1 billion. I'm just gonna give that to the police right now. <laughs> yeah. Who have just arrived, actually, Afternoon officers, so since I just bought the police, yeah, I told them to take you away for a very long time just for being evil. What do you mean? I did nothing to you. I gave you a trillion dollars. Yeah, but you were gonna eat chop if I didn't spend it all within a day. That's pretty evil, buddy. Hey, officers, take him away. I don't want to see him again. <laughs> Funny prank. Tell them to stop. Hey, buddy, I'm not pranking, man. This is real. You're going to jail for a very long time for being mean and evil. <laughs> but you're the one who robbed me. Yeah, well, you'd sell that to the police, buddy. Have fun. Chop, I'm so glad to have found you again. <laughs> but I own a bunch of really nice things, from supercars to mansions to house upgrades to even a cruise liner. I think we're gonna go on holiday for a while. <laughs> Come on, Chop, let's go. This is not fair. Get me out of here. Ooh, I don't think he was a fan of that, guys. But now I got zero dollars. I've officially spent a trillion in one day. Every car at Simeon store came from a trillionaire, and they are literally the best cars we've ever seen. From golden limousines to golden Bugattis to even cars from the 1950s and so many more. I mean, look at that one with the American flag all over it. But if you think these are nice, you wait and see what's inside the store. Because these bad boys, this is where the real luxury is. Every single one of them is solid gold. Some of them are super old. And that one doesn't even look like it's been released yet. Whilst every car costs a hundred billion dollars, we have no money, which sucks. I don't know where it's gone, but not to worry. We can fix this because everyone who subscribes to my channel in the next five seconds gives Franklin one one billion dollars. So you guys better find the button. It's somewhere around there, wherever you're watching the video. Just find the subscribe button and press it. Yes, we're getting money. Oh my days, we're getting lots of money. <laughs> if only Simeon knew we were doing this. Am I gonna get a hundred billion? Oh, quick guys, subscribe, subscribe. Yes, we got a hundred billion dollars. Simeon, I would like to buy the best car you have. No chance. You have to buy all of these first. Oh man, so I gotta buy these cars first if I wanna get anywhere near the ones in inside the store. That's so annoying, Simeon, but not to worry. I got a hundred billion dollars. We can buy one of these rides. Which one would you go for first? I mean, there's literally a car which belongs to a kid. This is being shrunk down. Oh my day. To think that that exists? Oh man, I really don't know. I kind of want to go for the American car though, or even this one. The color on this one is changing. Hey, let's go with this one first. Simeon, I would like to buy... All right, we'll get the American one first and whatever. <laughs> oh, I completely forgot there was a golden limousine. I should have got that one first. Well, I I've got my first car, and Lamar is phoning me. Hey, Lamar, what's up? Yo, come quick. Oh, where are we going? Uh, Lamar? Uh, all, all right, doesn't matter. Lamar needs my help right now. Let's go and help him. <laughs> I wonder what he wants to do. Usually when Lamar wants my attention, there's some money involved. Maybe he'll be able to pay me enough to buy another car. I had to drive to the other side of the map just to meet Lamar, who, wait a second, he's on the roof of that building. This is really strange. What has he been up to today? Hey, Lamar. Oh, he's telling me to move my car. All right, okay, I'm moving it. Uh, behind the building, okay, behind the building, behind... Jeez, he's really stressing me out, dude. What are you doing on the roof, Lamar? This is really strange and definitely unlike you. Uh, keep your eye out, all right? I'm keeping my eye out for anything strange. I see a taco van. Do you fancy a burrito, Lamar? <laughs> definitely do. I'm really hungry, actually. Hey, can I have a go on those binoculars? Uh, I'm not seeing much, Lamar. I'm not seeing much at all. Wait a second. Hang on a minute. Guys, I think I can see something in the distance. Franklin, let's take a look. I recognize them a mile away. Lamar must... Lamar, I found a, I found a money truck. Is this what you're going after? Yes, it is. Oh, my days. So it's gonna pull in here to refuel, apparently, and then we just ambush the truck. Lamar's been tracking this van all day, and it's picked up money around the entire world. He's already shooting! No, get the van, get the van, get the van! Stop them from driving away! No, you don't! Yes! I got the driver. Is anyone else in there? What do we think, Lamar? Do you reckon there's someone in there? Oh, no! Lamar! Lamar! Talk to me! Lamar! <laughs> Lamar's dead! Don't worry, Lamar. I'll get the money for you. Don't worry. Complete the job. <laughs> oh, well, more money for me, I suppose. Let's get these doors open. Hey, Lamar, I'm gonna do justice for you. Open sesame on my days. <laughs> 
I have never seen that much gold in a truck before. Hey, excuse me, man. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. How much money do you reckon is in here? Like, that's gotta be enough to buy every single car in Simeon store. It has to be. It's gotta be, dude. This won't be suspicious at all. I mean, after all, it's not like I've got every bar in Los Santos. <laughs> that would be impossible. All right, let's see. Hello, excuse me, mister. I would like to make a deposit. All my gold's outside. Can you just tell me how much is... Whoa, 300 billion. I thought it would be more than that, but hey, that's a lot of money. I can buy three more cars from Simeon. Are you ready to see what we're gonna get? Decisions, decisions. Do I go with the golden Rolls Royce limousine with the trillion number plate? That's just beautiful. Hey, 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 guys, 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 away from the window. These cars are mine. No, not yours. They're mine. They're mine, okay? No one takes these cars from Franklin. So I've got the American car by accident. I actually wanted to get this one. So let's just buy this one. This will be one of my three. I have no idea what ride this is. It keeps changing color, which is strange. And it's got chrome tires. Even the inside is like made of wires. Hey, Simeon, are you sure you haven't ripped me off, bunny? Oof, that is beautiful. Oh my goodness. Hey, you know what? Let's get this one next. What is this? This is a Brabham and it's a supercar. It's really rare. You don't see these on the streets very often. All right, this is what it looks like on the inside. We've got the Brabham display. Oh, everything digital. 70 miles an hour, 75, 83. Let's bring that up to 100. I have smashed 110, 130. Wow, this thing's fast. I capped it at 140 miles an hour. This is a pretty fast ride on my days. We better park this up now before we crash this and die. Which car do we get next? I got $100 billion is left. I'm gonna get this one from the 1950s. It's got like 10 exhaust pipes and leather interior with wood. You don't get cars looking like this these days. All right, this is beautiful. I think we made a good choice. I bought four out of 13 cars from Simeon. I just have to make another 900 billion dollars, which I'm sure we will do. I love how they built a headrest into this. Like, this is just such a work of art. Hey, what does this guy want? Waving his arms. Hey, man, I like your rides. It's not as good as mine, though. No. One race. If I win, I get your car. If you win, you get mine! Ooh, that sounds risky. He wants to race with me, but if I win, I gotta keep his car. That is actually one of the nicest cars you can get in GTA 5. It's a lot of money, too. Maybe Simeon might be interested in a bit of a trade. Hey, you know what, man? Count me in. All right, I love this car. It's my favorite one so far. And if I lose this, I'm gonna be gutted. Three two, one. Go, 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 go. Come on, we can do this. We can do this. I think he tried to crash into me. Yes, we're winning. We're winning. <laughs> I was smoking this guy. Looks like you're the slow coach now. Oh my days. Wait a second. Is he catching up? He's catching up. No, no. <laughs> Come on, go, 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 go. Yes, completely smoked him and we're across the line. Looks like the 1950s. I've got much more on your car, my guy. Now hand it over. You know what? I'll just take the car myself. He doesn't even want to give me the car. Oh, jeez, he's shooting me. What? <laughs> he really didn't want to give me the car. He must have thought I cheated or something when you guys saw I definitely did not. Well, I got this car. Let's see if Simeon's willing to do a trade. Hey, Simeon, are you interested in doing a little trade? I mean, I got the X80 Proto. There's plenty of people who like this car. Sure, what do you want? Well, I would love one of those cars, Simeon. The ones inside the store? No chance. Only cars outside first. Oh, man, he's really not budging on that. Is there anything I can do, Simeon, to get those cars in the store first? Tell your fans to like the video. <sighs> you guys heard the man. Like the video now, and then maybe Simeon will have a change of hearts. Please, like the video. The more likes we get, the more it will please Simeon and let us get one of those cars early. Now, whilst you're liking the video, let's see what he's got here. Hmm, I haven't actually seen what kind of car this is. I think it's a Bugatti. Oh, it's a Truffade. No way, this is a Truffade. Wait a second, this is like a rare Truffade. You can't buy The Truffade is a GTA 5 car brand, but this is like a really rare one. You don't get ones that look like this. Hey, Simeon, can I get a car from inside first? Can, can we, can we please? Pretty please? No, not enough likes. Oh, wow. Simeon is really not budging on that. Right, you know what, Simeon? I'm just gonna trade with, with this golden car, the one I said I love. It's got a sun roof, it's a truffade rare car, and it's exactly what I need right now. How many cars are left outside? One, two, three, four cars. All right, all I gotta do is make $400 billion. I can finally buy the cars inside the store. Lester wants me for some reason. Hey, Lester, what do you want? Frankie boy, can you do a job for me? Pays well. Hey, Lester, I need to know details. What job is this? I can't tell you until you accept. Really? We're we doing James Bond now? Hey, Lester, why do I need a plane for this? Just do as I tell you, okay? It'll make sense. Oh, boy, I don't like the sound of this. I gotta use a plane for whatever we're doing. It's hacked into this plane. Hijack it and 
and land it. Okay, Lester, whatever you say. That's kind of a tricky thing to do, though. Oh, my days. That's a massive plane. Dude, that's crazy. And that looks pretty good to me. All right, jump out, Franklin. Come on, use that parachute of yours. Come on, use the parachute, Franklin. Jeez. All right, easy does it now. Easy does it now. Let's get on this plane. This is a chrome plane. I have never seen anything like this before in GTA. What could possibly be on board? A lot of money. Oh, thanks, Lester. Thanks, man. <laughs> well, I'm on the plane. Now, how are we going to hijack this? Oh, man, this is really tricky. Lester didn't quite explain this part. All right, hijack the plane, Franklin. Oh, there we go. Here's the front. Hey, excuse me. Who's flying this machine? You? I need the plane now. Yes, I got the plane. Hey, Lester, I got the plane. Now what do we do? Land the plane in Sandy Shores now. All right, Lester. Okay, no need to scream at me, dude. What could possibly be inside? I mean, it's chrome. This thing is meant to look invisible in the sky. Almost, almost, yes. Landed successfully. Imagine if we open this up and there's even better cars than what Simeon selling. Like quadrillion air cars. Can you imagine, guys? I definitely can. Open sesame. Whoa, wait a second. Uh, why are there so many people in there? Oh, he could have told me this beforehand. This guard's inside. <sighs> Okay, is everyone dead now? Wait a second, is this full of money? Is this really what I think it is? Oh my days, it is! It goes to the other side! Load him up, boys! Looks like you got the rest covered. The only thing you haven't got covered is my share of the pay. Which I think I deserve a lot of, by the way. I did all the work. Apart from the hacking and locating and everything else like that. Of course! Take this. $400 billion? Thank you so much, Lester. Now, I'm getting out of here before anyone decides to betray me. I know it's happened in the past. Might be a while ago now, but it has happened. I have $400 billion. Oh, my days. I think I might be able to buy some of the best cars Simeon has. I have $400 billion, which means I can buy one, two, three. Oh, no. There's still four cars outside. Four more inside. Simeon, is there nothing we can do now to let me finally buy those nice cars in there? No. Oh. Really, you're a tough cookie. All right, looks like I'll get all four of these. I mean, they're not too bad. I got this uh, Rolls Royce limousine, which, by the way, a lot of people would be envious about. Look at those leather seats around the back. Plenty of space to chill out and spread out and just enjoy life. In the front, we got all these technical things. Yeah, it's Rolls Royce. It doesn't get better than this. But there's three other cars I want to check out. So I'm just going to leave this one outside of Simeon's land and check out the Dodge Viper. Oh, yeah, this is a beauty. I love it. Kind of looks like the Banshee. A little bit disappointed. I mean, look at that spoiler. That's a big spoiler, guys. And the green, it's a beautiful green. Yeah, it's a nice ride, but there's still two more cars out there. I want to buy these two as well. I mean, check it out. This is a kid's car. I, I gotta drive that, but first, let's drive this one. It's got a massive area around the back. Didn't even see that, but, you know, it's nice. It's a buggy. Two-seater, and whoa, whoa, this thing's glitchy as ever. Hey, Simeon, I think you ripped me off, buddy. Can I get a discount? Like, aka, can I get this one for free? No way. This is a Dodge SRT? What? Alright, this is the coolest car we bought so far, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Like, I may have a golden Rolls Royce limousine. I might have a golden car. You know, who cares? Y you know, it, it, it is what it is. But this one is better than all of them. It has no horn, so no one knows when I'm about to crash into them. It's got tiny miniature red tires that are like a quarter of the size of normal ones. And it's pretty slow. But because it's a kid car, I love it. I could drive this through any situation. Down the sewers. I could drive this into tunnels. I bet you can't do this with a normal car. We're going to go straight through the middle. <laughs> oh, yeah. Easy peasy. Now I have this secret location. I have no money left, but there's four incredible cars waiting to be bought inside Simeon's store. From this one, to that one, to that one, to even the one on the end. They look insane. Uh oh. Trevor, this is never good. I'm in trouble. Can you break me out? What kind of trouble are you in, Trevor? I know too many things, like where they keep their money. Get me out of here now. It's much worse than I thought. The military base. Oh, no, 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 no. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, Franklin. We're in. All right, let's go and get Trevor. Trevor, I'm coming to get you, my guy. Okay, why is Trevor in the military base? How did he get here? I have so many questions, but let's just go get him. Hey, guys, get out of my way. Oh, my days. That's a tank. That's a tank. That's a tank. There's tanks in the road. Drive. Franklin drive like you've never driven before. I want to see you do stunts. I want to see you do parkour. I want you to defeat the military and rescue Trevor in a one-seater car. I did not think this through at all. Oh my days. Right, that's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. Trevor's in that tower and we're still alive. Those tanks have missed every single shot. Hey, suckers, come back when you got aim. Screw you, man. Okay, Franklin, here we go. Let's go inside. Oh my days, there's guards in here. What are you doing inside the tower? Come on. Hey, open up. Oh my days, that thing's gonna explode next to me. Get inside. 
inside. Get it inside, Franklin. So Trevor's inside the tower. Let's go and find him before it's too late. This is the best breakout I've ever done. This is way more exciting than the prison. I think there's someone on this level. There is. Oh, no, you don't, my guy. No, uh, uh, not today. Trevor, are you in here? Another guard up there. Are you kidding me? Come on, guys. Out the way. Move it or lose it. Hey, man, you do realize it's rude to take people, especially Trevor. Hey, Trevor, I'm coming to break you out. Come on, get up. There isn't much time. Somebody is shooting me as we speak. Who is doing that? Oh, police helicopters. Give me a second. I'll sort them out now. Hey, suckers, come back another time. Okay, Trevor, with me. Let's get moving. Hey, no, Trevor, don't attack him. Don't what are you doing, Trevor? Come on, get in my car. We don't have much time. I will leave you in here. This guy is crazy. There, oh my days, there is a tank. Trevor, there is a tank shooting us. You need to get in my car now. That wasn't so hard. See, you can shoot them from inside the car now. All right, we're just going to avoid those tanks. Broken a few windows, but everything's fine as long as we avoid the tanks. Oh, no, there's a tank right there. Oh, <laughs> that went up my window screen. Oh, that was a close one. All right, just go around. Yes, really confuse them there, Franklin. <laughs> I saw the rocket on the tank. That was insane. Right, keep moving. Just dodge. Whoa, keep dodging. Keep dodging. Nice, nice. I dodged the tanks. Now we just gotta break out. Easy peasy lemon squeezy straight through the exit. The way we came in. I know a place. Follow my directions. You got it, Trevor. We're following his directions, apparently. So we're going up here. Dirt track. All right, this is working. I don't see any police officers up here. Nice. We might actually lose the wanted level. Hiding in Inside the mine shaft. Wow, Trevor, this is a really good idea. This is where they keep their money. Wait, what? Really? Seriously? The mine shaft? Hey, let's go and find this cash. Trevor's telling me that this is not only the place we lose the ones level, which we have successfully done, but this is where the cash is as well. How much are they keeping down here, Trevor? This isn't some sort of scheme to knock me out or something. Let me just check. No, it's not. He's not behind me. I'm picking something up. Who's this guy? Trevor, what do you know about this guy? I need answers. Check his pocket. His pocket? All right, let's get the pocket. This is his bank account password. Trevor, no way. You just found the bank account of some guy in the mine shaft? I have no idea what his name is, but we got his password, we got his user account. Let's go and give these details to the bank. They're gonna think I'm so suspicious now. I bring all the gold, and now I bring the password to probably the most expensive account they have? Wow, that's one of the biggest accounts we have! That's one of the biggest accounts you have? No way! How much is inside? Oh my days, dude! 600 billion dollars! <laughs> Alright, Trevor, so we split the money. 50-50, I get 300, you get 300. Nice, I never want to see you again. Wow, would you look at these? Finally, the day has come where Simeon can no longer ban me because I bought every single car outside Simeon. Now I got 300 billion, which means I can buy three of these four cars. Which ones do we go for? Okay, you know what, guys? I'm 110% going for this one first. Oh my days, I just broke the roof. Simeon, I want a refund. This is a complete self-driving car. There is no steering wheel or pedals or anything. There's not even a brake. You gotta trust your life with this robot. And it's a Rolls Royce, so it's not exactly a slow car either. You just gotta hope the robot brakes. Oh, this is terrifying. This is <laughs> it's a nice car, but it's scary to drive because I have no control over this machine. But I think it's making the right plans. Kind of following the speed limits. Kind of... <laughs> it's terrifying, dude. I don't like this car at all. Ford are known for their cars, and this is one of the fastest ones they've ever made. It's a work of art, and even the spoiler is automatic. It's beautiful. This is the interior. Pretty basic on the inside. There's not a lot going on. There is a magazine on the side, though, so whoever had this before clearly enjoyed reading, but check me out, dude. <laughs> I'm going so fast. Let's go. All right, you know what? Let's get this one, and I will find a way to make the last hundred billion dollars. Lamar's alive? Wait a second. Lamar's alive? Hey, uh, Lamar. Uh, I'm so glad you're alive. Yeah, yeah, whatever, bro. I need your help. Just come here now. Okay, Lamar, I'm on my way. Now, he wants me to go over to the coast of this map, so there is a decent chance he might actually want to throw me into the water. I did steal his money from him. Is he shouting me? Oh, jeez. Lamar, how am I supposed to get there now? You could have at least given me a boat. Oh, what is he doing out there? Right, you know what, Franklin? Let's just swim. We got no choice. We got to swim this. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hey, Lamar, can you just sail over and pick me up? This is definitely karma for earlier. I should have saved him. Yo, Frank, below us is a ton of money. Are you sure about this? What even is below us, Lamar? Let me just check this out. Uh, whoa, okay. Whoa, there's a sunken cargo boat. No! <laughs> There is an open container there. Oh, yes, there is. Amazing. All right, Franklin, attach the rope. Now it's been attached. We're going to use this boat to drag the container out of the ocean. That is such a good idea. Ooh, boy, okay, that's quite heavy, but I think we got it. Now let's get this back to shore. Oh, yeah. Who's a boss now, guys? Check it out. We got the container. And inside is a ton of gold. And this time, we actually get to split the money, Lamar. This is great. I'm so glad you survived this one. Yeah, bro. Well, I'm taking one 
you owe me. Uh, you could have the rest. Mm, seems reasonable to me. I, I did just make a hundred billion dollars. That's enough. You know what, Lamar? That's enough. You enjoy the rest of the money. I'm gonna buy the final car from Simeon. We've now bought every single trillionaire car in GTA 5. Which one was your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. Mine has to be either this one or the truffade we were driving earlier. That was pretty intense. Trevor's a millionaire, Michael's a billionaire, and Franklin's a trillionaire. And we're taking a look into the life of each one of these characters. What's it like living as a millionaire and then living as a trillionaire? I mean, what's the difference? Trevor, come on, don't blow bogeys on the screen. I know you're the millionaire, but you still got a fair bit of money. I mean, that's a beautiful house behind you. Let's take a look around this. So Trevor is the millionaire. Should I say multi-millionaire? He's made a couple million dollars. He's done some pretty cool things. <laughs> Launched a few businesses, done a few things here and there. Check out the supercar, though. This is a nice car, Trevor. So it's orange. It's the Cyclone. Oh, my days. This is like the fastest electric car there is. Look how big that coil battery is, guys. That's insane. <laughs> so this is our house. Pretty nice. We've got like a, an alarm system in case any of you guys try to break in. Let's take a look inside, though. Why is the grass going through the floor? Hey, Trevor, we got to fix that. <laughs> He's even trying to dress up for the video, dude. So this is the lounge. Pretty nice. I don't know why there's a photo of her in here. Maybe Trevor's now dating her. Who knows? <laughs> we got a TV over here. Pretty cool. I can watch my videos on it. And then moving along, this is his dining room. Oh, my days. Look at that view. That's a nice view. You know, even for a millionaire, I think you're doing pretty well, Trevor. This is beautiful. Hey, just warning you, no littering in Trevor's garden. He will personally find you $25,000, dude. <laughs> He's even got a hot tub as well. Yo, this is a nice place. There's the outdoor seating area. Got a few neighbors. I can hear the traffic outside. So you still got the traffic, but look at that fridge. Oh my days. Yo, Trevor, that's a massive fridge. There's the glasses. There's the drinks. There's all of the items over there. Lovely big windows. That's what I like. Trevor, I know you're a millionaire, but this is actually a beautiful house. I mean, I ain't even seen the billionaire and trillionaire lifestyles yet, but <laughs> I mean, this is pretty nice. I would not complain if I had this house. So moving along down here, what do we have? <gasps> there's another door. And I love how there's just casually a sofa just in the hallway. So there's the back door, which takes you outside again. This door takes you to another lounge. Are you kidding me? How many lounges do you have, Trevor? <laughs> this is awesome. If you're enjoying the video so far and want to become a millionaire, smash like because statistically, one of you guys will become a millionaire as long as you press like though. Moving along through the house. Let's go back through the door. I want to go upstairs because this thing goes up another level. And I think it even has three floors. I don't know. It looked pretty big on the outside. So this is like bedroom number one. Got a nice cozy office here. This is where Trevor must do some of his business. Look at that view. I bet in the evening Trevor can see like dolphins and boats and ferries and trains and trains. <laughs> Why would he see? Okay, moving along. <laughs> ba -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Another bedroom. Okay, we've got bedroom number two with another office. Cool. Guys, if you're chilling in Trevor's house, you can work in here. How cool is that? Got some shoes on the side. Interesting. So we got bedroom number three over here. And this has an ensuite. Okay, this is kind of cool. Got another view from that side of the road. And then on this side of the ensuite, the beautiful view of the sea over there, the beach. Man, this is a lovely house. But I don't think he's got much else to show off. I think he's just got the nice house, the nice car. We've got the cyclone. And we've got the nice view. I mean, what more could you possibly need, guys? This is a pretty good place. Not a single person bothering me. This is a nice life. This is a really nice life. <laughs> anyway, guys, I want to check out Michael's life because he is the billionaire and I want to see what he gets up to. He's going to have a thousand times more money than Trevor currently has. Whoa, we're in North Yankton. Guys, this is not Los Santos. Looks like Michael decided to move out of there. <laughs> hey, Michael, let's go and check out your house. So this is the lane. That must be the house. Nice. Okay, pretty cool. We've got some cameras out here. Oh, I wonder what those things are. That's interesting. Hold on a second. Hey, Michael, who are they up there? <laughs> Why are they chilling in your house, Michael? Who are they? Hmm, I'm really confused. So Michael is now like a multi-billionaire. I can't believe I'm saying that. Michael, you're living the life, buddy. What? Dude, he's even got a basketball court? You're in North Yankton. This may as well be in the Arctic. <laughs> this is like ice skating basketball, dude. This is crazy. All right, we've got like a fire out here. Some sofas. Pretty good. we got the fire, actually. You know, when it gets to nighttime, people get a bit cold. They can warm by the fire and watch Michael pot some basketball hoops. <laughs> Hold on a second. No way have I got a swimming pool. Dude, I'm in the middle of North Yankton. Hey, Michael, I actually love the place. I can't believe you have done this. It's got to be heated. There is no way. This thing would literally freeze over. Okay, let's take a look inside this place. So this must be one of the entrances. Let's take a look around here. So this is where you can chill, make yourself some coffee. And then through this room is... 
What? Michael, you got a tiger rug? What? <laughs> this is insane. So this is Michael's office. He clearly does the business in here. He's got six different trophies. These two and something from Pharaoh's tomb. <laughs> What is that? This is crazy, dude. What does this thing say? Hold on a second. This is the Meltdown movie. Michael has literally bought his own film. And he's got the original reel. That is awesome, Michael. Ooh, there's a gym. Michael never works out. Michael, why do you build yourself a gym? <laughs> Look at the view, though. I just want to go skiing. I wonder if he got... Oh, my days. Hold on a second. This is Home Alone. I'm loving this place already. Toilet. Nice. Shower. We've even got a cinema. And currently, Michael is watching Elf. This isn't even a projector. This is a TV. All right, Michael. I won't hold you up because clearly you want to watch Elf. Not even Christmas. You know, we got a long time till Christmas, but I'm not going to complain. This looks kind of interesting. There's meant to be a room here, but it doesn't really suggest there is. Can I... I can just go through all my days. I have found Michael's security room and you can just go through this thing. Guys, you wouldn't think that. This is like a cloth, but it looks like a wall. <laughs> so we got all the cameras here. This is the police station. Why are you watching the police station, Michael? This is live. They got a meeting in one room. There's the outside. There's some dude just chilling at the desk. He's even got the prisons on my days and he's got tons of cash. Dude, these are $20 bills. I need answers. I need answers, dude. Serious answers. <laughs> this is crazy, Michael. Yo, that's... That's a nice poster. Hold on a second. It's a family photo. Oh, look at them all. We got Michael, Tracy, Jimmy. How's Jimmy doing, Michael? Is Jimmy coping with this well? Is he a millionaire? There's Amanda. I wonder what she was thinking at that moment. Yeah, we'll never know. Oh, this must be Jimmy's room then. So we've got a PlayStation 5, watching some cartoons. He's even got some insane graphics cards. Look at that. Michael's bought Jimmy everything, dude. Look at this bed. This is an upgrade, Jimmy. You've actually got light in your room. Playing some Red Dead Redemption 2. Jimmy DeSanto's Facebook page. Looking good, Jimmy. <laughs> He's moved on from Life Invader. He's now on Facebook. I want to see Michael's room now. I've seen Jimmy. I've seen Tracy's. So we got a walk-in wardrobe. Pretty nice. Pretty good. And then on this side, I suppose, is Michael's room. Yeah, we got a lovely ensuite. Lovely shower, bath, everything. Two showers. That's crazy. And this is... Oh, hey, guys. Hey, what's up? <laughs> This might be the guest room, to be honest. Another giant... Why is Home Alone still playing? <laughs> okay, so this is the guest room. Amazing view as well. I want to find Michael's room. Where's Michael's room? How, how do the guests have a walk-in wardrobe, dude? Is it down this way? Is this where Michael's room is? So we've got a Christmas tree, another bathroom, and a kitchen up here. Hey, Michael, I'm really confused. I haven't found your room yet. <laughs> where does Michael sleep? Oh, hold on a second. Michael's got bodyguards. Uh, okay. I'm not complaining. We're a billionaire. We could do a bodyguard. So you never know what could happen. Come on, guys. We're going for a ride. <laughs> I want to see what else Michael has. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of like Trevor's house more than Michael's. I know he's meant to be a billionaire, but if that's all he's got, then Trevor is definitely up there above Michael right now. But I want to see what else Michael can offer as a billionaire. Oh, we're going this way. All right, Michael, where's your plane or whatever it is? <laughs> we're getting out of here, right? Oh, here it is. Luxury gold jet. Okay, let's get inside and check out what else Michael has. Dude, this is a lovely place, though. I mean, I would live here as well. <laughs> Come on, buddy, get in the jet. You're gonna co-pilot this thing with me. Hold on a second. Michael, we're... <laughs> Who's gonna fly the jet? Michael, you gotta fly this thing. Come on. Are you kidding me? You can't just go in the passenger seat. You gotta fly this. And get in and... No. No, Michael. Come on. You gotta fly the jet, dude. Oh, hold on a second. We're coming into landing. This isn't Los Santos. This is an island. No way. Michael has his own private airport. That's really cool. And we've landed. Okay. Nice. N nice, 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 nice. Ah! <laughs> What is wrong with the pilot, dude? Hey, Michael, you should have flown this. You would have done so much better. Well, I've landed on this private island. I think we're refueling. Yeah, North Yankton must be too far away or something. Interesting. One of you is a terrible pilot. Seriously. I love how they're still getting off. Look at that guy. <laughs> I reckon he's had too much to drink, you know? This is pretty cool, to be honest. I think I can see Mount Chiliad over there. There's a caravan over here. Man, this is tiny. There's a helicopter. Who is that guy? Who is that? You look terrifying. <laughs> Guys, I think that might be that camouflage. He looks like a toy soul. I want to get down. That guy is freaking me out, dude. There's even a hot dog stand. I can get dinner over here or just fly to Los Santos. You know what? I kind of just want to go straight to Los Santos. Is the refueling done? We have arrived. Los Santos International Airport. Bring out the wheels. Let's do this landing perfectly. And land it. All right. Nice. We're in Los Santos. Check it out, guys. So we've seen Michael's North Yankton Mansion. We've seen his private airport. He gets luxury access. I kind of want to see how far the bodyguards will take things. <laughs> hey, guys. Let's go and take on the streets. Could do it. 
the car. Hey, that blue car, I don't like the color of it. Go shoot the car. <laughs> Dude, we just took out the driver. Oh, my days. All right, well, that red car as well. He saw too much. We got to sort out the red car. Go on, guys. No, 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 no. Come on, don't let him get away. I'm going to try and drive as quick as I can. <laughs> Go get the red car. He's driving away, guys. What are you doing? We got to stop him. And he's still alive. He's still alive. He's still alive. Now he's dead. Congratulate. Oh, my days. I just blew up the car. <laughs> This is the best, dude. No one cares. I'm not getting a one to level. Dude, this is the best. This is insane. No one can- Uh-oh. Okay, I have just got a one to level. So billionaires can get one to levels in GTA. <laughs> They're still shooting things. Hey, Michael, I might just leave you to it, buddy. You go cause havoc in Los Santos. I'm gonna go and check out what Franklin's up to. You know, living that trillionaire lifestyle. And finally, the trillionaire lifestyle. Franklin, how we doing? Can we crack a smile? Yeah, that'll do. Thank you, Franklin. <laughs> so I got this guy right behind me. What's your name, huh? Alfred. All right, I got a guy called Alfred. Pretty cool. He will fetch me a Paragon helicopter limousine. Don't think I need one of those, Alfred, because right now, I got my own Lamborghini. <laughs> Check it out, dude. Oh, my day. Franklin, this is a nice car. Hey, Alfred, how about we go for a ride and you explain to me what Franklin can do? I can't wait to check out his house. I can't wait to see his powers. I can't wait to see his vehicles. I can't wait to see what he owns and what he does. He's a trillionaire. Franklin has more money than the whole of Los Santos combined. Hold on a second. Alfred's doing some 360s right now. I don't know what he's up to, but uh, <laughs> I can do stuff. I can set that car as stolen. Hold on. What happens if I do that? So I've just... Alfred, please, stop spinning around. What? <laughs> This ain't no Call of Duty map. I can hack the people in the subway down below. That is so crazy, dude. I'll be taking that money. This is how we're a trillionaire. I can just steal money from like anybody around me. I can do engine overheating. Yes, please. Uh-oh, looks like your car broke. Oh, my days, it's on fire. It's on fire. It's on fire. Dude, I just blew up their engine. <laughs> Let's blow up that one. Dude, I can set cars on fire. Hold up. I got airstrike services as well. That's even better, dude. Let's go for some lasers from the military base. I'm just going to call them in on me. Uh-oh, okay. I have called them in on me. Franklin, get any Lamborghini. I can hear them. Okay, Franklin, I think we better move. We better move. <laughs> we better get out of here, Franklin. Oh, my days. That was awesome, guys. You are crazy. <laughs> I can call in airstrikes wherever I want them. I haven't even seen Franklin's house yet, dude. I, I gotta check out his house soon. Wow, there it is. Franklin's trillion dollar mega mansion. Franklin, this is beautiful. You have the best spot in Vinewood Hills. So we got a thousand mega mansion street. I don't know what to call this. It's not even a street. What is that, Franklin? What is... <laughs> Is that dude? Oh my days, this is awesome. He's got a giant robot. Car is parking in the garage. We got the Lamborghini safe and sound. So he hasn't got too many cars in here, but you know what? I don't mind. I have this giant robot. Dude, I gotta take that out. I wanna check out his actual house. So let's just walk through here, shall we? Moving up here, we got a drive, which takes you up to... Oh, hold on. There's like another garage. Cool. I could have driven my Lamborghini up here. So that's a really, really nice poster. Franklin and Lamar. That's a nighttime view of his mansion. Amazing. So this must be the entrance. Dude, this house is insane. Grand piano behind actual barriers. That's his kitchen slash bar. So this must be his laundry. That's a random guest bathroom. And then through here is all of his awards for stuff he definitely hasn't done. This is his lounge. Yeah, boss man Franklin chilling on his buffalo. Look at this view. Dude, this is a view of dreams, serious dreams and money. I got like several different ladies just chilling in the back garden. Hey, what's up, girls? How we doing? Dude, look at this swimming pool. That's awesome. I got so many swimming pools. There's the upstairs. I'm loving this place already. I got a swimming pool wrapping around the entire place. There's even a downstairs. So this is the kitchen area where Franklin cooks or where our personal chef does. We are a trillionaire. Another amazing view. <laughs> this is insane, dude. So let's go upstairs first and then we'll go downstairs. So I love, I love this landing area. Just the wood, the solid wood on the floor. Cheeky sofa. All right. This is just a viewpoint. A little mezzanine area to look down at Franklin's crazy office. Hold on. For the purpose of this, I'm changing the time. I want to see this house at nighttime. Oh yeah, dude. Okay, this house is way better at nighttime. Let's just keep it nighttime for now. <laughs> Guys, I'm a trillionaire. Of course I can change the time. So this is how we get down to the bottom floor. I found the staircase. I'm expecting a full-on man cave. Franklin, what have we got hiding down here, dude? Some soda, some photos of people Franklin loves. All right, that's pretty cool. Uh, okay, we got our first room. Let's go in here first. This is the garage. Cinema over here with a full-on capacity guest room. I don't know any of these people. And this way is Franklin's gym. Nice, pretty cool gym. And then down this corridor takes us to the helipad. Cool. All right, this is where Franklin's golden helicopter is. So Franklin's house is clearly the best. But let's see what he gets up to in his spare time. And what a better way to see what he does by riding around in his giant robot. <laughs> 
Oh my days, I can fire rockets with this. It's not every day you get to drive around in a robot. Look at this guy. Bang, didn't stand a chance. Look at this guy over here. <laughs> oh, bam, didn't stand a chance. I am tearing up the road with this. So this is what it looks like in first person. Just chilling on the robot. Pretty cool. It's very smooth on the road, to be fair. Accuracy is top notch when you're driving this. Anyway, let's see what else Franklin gets up to, shall we? No way. Franklin's got his own island as well? This is amazing. I can see his mansion down there. All right, let's go and check out his mansion. So this is Franklin's holiday tropical island. What do we think? I think it looks pretty nice. I really do. <laughs> I want this life, dude. This is crazy. Okay, yeah, that was so high risk, Franklin. Wait, go, 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 go. We don't want to flood this. I don't think there's a boat or a helicopter to get us back out of here, Franklin. All right, this is the upstairs. Look at that beautiful view. Got some trees currently flooded. Lovely sand dune beaches at the other side. The list just goes on and on and on, dude. Look at this. There's even underfloor glass. So this is his TV. Currently not a lot of furniture. We've only got teapots, TVs. What do you reckon through here? Through here is one of the bathrooms, I think. I don't know. It's just got clocks in. This is there literally is nothing in. What do you reckon is on the other side then? <laughs> we got a snooker table, lovely bar. Yo, this is what we want. Franklin has left a bar in here. There is nothing else except for a bar. Today in GTA 5, I'm building the biggest base you're ever going to see. I've been studying these blueprints for several months now. And trust me when I say this, it's gonna be insane. It costs a trillion dollars to do, and it's gonna be in Franklin's house. It's gonna be underneath Franklin's house, and it's gonna cover the entire area around Franklin's house. It's gonna go miles on end underground. I think everything is perfect and ready to go, so let's go and pay them the money. There you go, have a trillion dollars. That's a lot of money, dude. All right, go ham, build the blueprints, and make sure this is the biggest base we've all seen. What do we do now, Franklin? It's not like we can go back to our house today. We gotta wait until, like, later on. Wait, Simeon's giving me a call. Hey, Simeon, what do you want? Hey, Franklin, I need your help. Come by the store now. Well, looks like we're going to Simeon's store. Wonder what's going on there. Hey, somebody stole my car. I need it back. Can you get it? If you do, I'll give you your car back. Oh, my day. Simeon, you stole my car. So you want me to steal somebody's car for you when you stole my car? That is not cool, Simeon. Not cool. I was wondering where that was this morning. Oh, man, what am I gonna do? Yeah, yeah, okay. We got a deal, Simeon. We got a deal, okay? I'll get the car for you. But please don't do that again. <laughs> I want my car back. I found Simeon's car, and the people who have taken it don't exactly look too welcoming. That guy's got a pistol. If you want to stay alive, back off, kid. Oh, wow, he really does sound mean. I would back off, but I kind of want my car back. So I hope you don't mind. I'm just gonna grab my car. Thank you. Uh oh, they do mind. Frankly, they're gonna shoot us. I'm taking shots because Simeon stole my car. Quick, drive, 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 drive. Go, go, go. Dude, I'm building a trillion dollar base. I can't die before it's built. Jeez. Oh, my days. That was close. Simeon, you better give me my car back, buddy. That is so not cool. Look what happened to the windshield. All because of Simeon. Ah, man, they really were not happy with me taking that car back. It's solid gold. I can imagine it probably sells for a lot of money. Well, at least I got away in one piece, Franklin. Oh, that was horrible. Hey, Simeon, look what I got for you. Your car. Now, you better give me my car back. A deal's a deal. Now, look at the windscreen. Look at the side. Dude, there's so many bullet holes. That's not my fault, Simeon. That came with the package. It's a mess, but a deal's a deal. Here, take the keys. It's all yours. Wow, you make it sound like it's a congratulations. That car was mine in the first place. You can't just steal something and give it back to me, dude. Oh, my days. All right, thanks, Simeon, anyway. All right, Franklin, we got our car back. Whew, that's a lot of drama for the day. I mean, I plan to do golf and do tennis and all those things, but quite frankly, all I want to do now is sleep and wait till tomorrow until the house is done. I'm gonna rest here until the morning, but tomorrow, trillionaire base, trillionaire house upgrades, trillionaire everything. It is gonna be the biggest base we've ever seen, Franklin, and I can't wait. Get some rest, and I will see you in the morning. Guys, it's done. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Oh my days. Yo, look at that helipad. That's like bigger than my house. So you see this tunnel thing and this runaway thing over there? And you know, there's so many things. There's like a cargo bob over there. You see all those things? It's connected. This is a trillion dollar mansion, everybody. Look, I even got a boat going out there. That connects to my house. All right, I have the craziest bunker. Dude, it's even got helicopters on top, sentry guns. This is exactly how I imagined in the blueprints. Dude, I can't wait to explore this thing. I'm so excited. I have never done an upgrade this epic to Franklin's house. Trust me, I've done a lot of upgrades. Billionaire, millionaire, quadrillionaire, tons of things. Nothing is gonna compare to what I have done now. Dude, these blueprints I've been planning over for ages. Can't believe it's actually happened. So there's one helipad. All of those colorful circles, they take you down somewhere. They take you someplace. So this is the rooftop. I got a bunch of cargo bobs, sentry guns, snipers, you know, things ready to take away enemies and Michael basically. A telescope up here to look for those enemies. <laughs> hey Michael, can I see you? I better not be able to see you, buddy. If I see you, you're going down. I got a telescope. This is so cool. I can stargaze all night. And this is my mass destruction bunker. <laughs> One of many. <laughs> I keep a few missiles just on the roof, just in case. You never know what could happen. Zombies, tsunami, 
Chinese army takeover, million stars. You know, you never know what could happen, Franklin. So I got this prepared just in case. But I haven't shown you guys downstairs yet because trust me, downstairs is where the money's been spent. Up here, there's barely anything. Downstairs is where it gets crazy. I'm gonna jump back in my car because I could walk down into the underground bunker via that thing, but there's an even better way getting down. Max clearance, everybody. Franklin's driving through. Let me in. Oh my days. <laughs> this is gonna be such a cool video. Guys, I feel like James Bond. I'm leaving my car there. So there's an elevator, which... Uh, what, should I go through the elevator? I kind of want to go through that. No, let's take a look through this garage first. So I got a bunch of supercars, you know, some nice cars. We got some Zerusos, some Adders, Zentornos. This? Hello? Where am I? <laughs> Where have I gone? Oh my days, dude, there's a tunnel system. So this is connected to the garage in case I come in and my car has been damaged. I don't know, a tank's fired at it or whatever. It's cool. I can repair it using my entire workshop. This is bigger than Franklin's house. Just the workshop. And there's a door there. There's a door there. There's a door there. There's doors everywhere, dude. <laughs> We're not even going to be able to explore the entire place. It is that big, this base. Oh my days, I really want to know where these teleports take me to. Like, they could take us anywhere. Okay, so there's a blue one there. There's a red one behind me. Wait, hold up. I think there was a red one on the helipad. Maybe this is where the helipad goes to? Oh, where am I? Where is... Oh, okay. Now I'm really confused. So this has taken me to another garage. <laughs> where on earth am I now? What? I'm so lost. Whoa. Oh my days. Dude, look at this. So this is elevator number two. That's number three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one. Okay, there's eight different elevators I can go through. Eight options. This is too much to think about. You know you build a good base when even your enemies can't find you. They would get lost in here. Here, dude. Elevator number one. Let's see. Oh, there's no teleporter in here. It just... Oh, it's a double elevator. Oh, my days. It's got a sentry gun hanging from the roof. <laughs> Imagine this. Right, you're a bad guy. You come in my base. All you gotta do is go through that elevator door and bye-bye. <laughs> you're going down, my friend. These guys have outdone themselves. I gotta say, they really have. So, that takes me somewhere. But first, look at my base. Guys, come on. Look at my base, okay? This is a mastermind base. No DLC could beat this. Seriously. I don't think any DLC could. Look at this. This is my lounge area, and then through this door in the Humane Labs is a prison. Guys, I have got my own prison. Yes. If Franklin doesn't like you, you could end up in here. Games room can't beat a game of snooker, but what else you can't beat is a nice pile of gold. That's right. Franklin got himself his own vault down here. You know, I gotta keep somewhere safe for my money, so let me show you inside. Et voila. Two sentry guns this time. You ain't getting out of here. <laughs> and look at all of my cash. Gold, gold, money, money. So much money. So much much gold. So I have like jewelry down here. Look at all the watches. Franklin, where do you get this many watches from? There's a lot of watches here. Is that from the Los Santos Customs, Franklin? Are you allowed that watch? Just in case you get locked inside, I can press a few buttons and go out this way, which takes me to... This is a money printing room. Franklin, I had no idea you had this. Okay, you can take as much cash as you want because I am printing unlimited cash. Now this is the way to go, Franklin. Congratulations. What? <laughs> like this is insane. Yo, I'm printing my own cash through this little keypad door. Make a guess. What do you think it is? That's right, guys. It is my planning room right next to my vault. You know, I can see where my cash is. I can do some planning. A lot of TVs. Nine different TVs, Franklin. Why do you need that many TVs? There's a lot of TVs. <laughs> yeah. This is where I train everybody who wants to do a heist with me. It's mandatory. A lot of people want to do heist. You know, after the money we've made, everyone wants in. I know what you're thinking. Hey, what's upstairs? Let me show you what's upstairs. Through this door is lots of money. We're just counting the money we printed today. And a spectacular view of everything I've just shown you already. And this is where where the masterminds work. We can see everything from here, from Life Invader to even the weather maps, to even more Life Invader, to more Life Invader, <laughs> to more weather maps. I can see everything. What's through here is another level. All right, say it's a zombie apocalypse and you really need to hide. Don't worry, Franklin's got you covered with Franklin's armory. And then through here, <laughs> all right, this thing opens and bam, check it out. My own shooting course. Look at this. Don't worry, guys. They're just mannequins. They're just dolls. <laughs> hey, clean up an aisle six. <laughs> this is so much fun. Hang on. No, no, no. I left some legs up. No, I gotta get the legs. Gotta get them off. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yo, this is crazy, dude. Yo, Franklin, what's up with these supermarket doors? You know, I would have loved some, like, high-tech, you know, FIB security doors, but we got supermarket ones now. <laughs> I'm in my own cafeteria. I got ice cream machines.
machines. I got plenty of tuna. This is a proper doomsday supply now. Like, let's say the world's gonna end. I've got food. I'm covered for weeks and weeks and months, maybe. I'm covered for a long time. I even got hot dog machines, dude. I got hot dog machines. And then through here is where we stock up on everything else. I got trash cans. I got fuel. I got boxes with supplies. Dude, I got everything. Generators, even an ice machine, dude. I can't believe I'm doing all of this under his house. Oh, my days. Franklin, what? Dude, the amount of helipads. Dude, I could get so many choppers down here. Like, let's think about it. Military base, they're going inside. Dude, I could get so many helicopters down here. From cargo bobs, to buzzards, to annihilators, to Valkyries. Dude, I could get so many things down here. They have, like, several helipads. And I suppose this takes us back upstairs to the helipad. Oh, interesting. I'm gonna park one of the helicopters on top and see what happens. I love how my neighbor's down there just like, uh... <laughs> Franklin, what have you done with your house? <laughs> hey, this is my bunker. Stop looking at it. Dude, I don't think anywhere is as big as this in Los Santos. This is the craziest build I've ever done in Franklin's house. Can we just land it on the helipad? Is that how it works? Oh my days. That is so cool. I can now land this on any of the helipads. And I think we're like right underneath the reservoir, actually, if I had to make a guess of where we are. Okay, this helicopter's going. No! <laughs> No, no, no. We're landing it here. Here, here. Land it. Land it, Franklin. Just keep it landed on the helipad. Thank you. Thank you, Franklin. <laughs> Jeez. All right, let's keep moving. Welcome to my airport hangar. Every single plane Franklin owns. And yeah, there's a lot of planes. They're all strike force. These fire missiles, which I crafted in my own underground bunker. How amazing is that? Now, in order to get out of here, we got to be slow and careful. You know, after all, I am underground. We got to go into this and then follow the runway down. <laughs> Are you ready for this? I'm already on the runway. And guess where I am, guys? Do you remember earlier in the video? I'm over the reservoir, ladies and gentlemen. Check it out. I have just taken off over the reservoir. And I'm going to Michael's house. I have not forgotten about him. Michael, I'm coming for you. Here he is. <laughs> Screw you, Michael. 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 Where's your house? <laughs> Dude, I'm just waiting for that text. Stop firing rockets at my house. Everything you can imagine is free for one day and one day only. The plants, the lamp, the desk, the paintings, literally anything. But something tells me your taste is a little bit better than that. So don't worry, guys. You can also get the sofa for free. <laughs> no, I'm joking, actually, because if you load up this, check this out, dude. Travel and transport, a legendary motorsport. You can literally buy all of these cars for free. Every single one of them. <laughs> Let's grab this one, buy it, Michael. All right, Truffa Z site. There we go. Free. All right, beautiful. I'm going to go with a nice blue. Yeah, we're going to go Michael's blue. And let's buy it. Hold on a second. I've just ordered my first car, and now every single one of these is locked. That's so weird, dude. It says, speak to Simeon. What? I was not told this. Dude, I've only got 24 hours to buy everything for free. Why is everything locked right now? Oh, my days. I don't believe it. Every single one of these just say, speak to Simeon. Are you kidding me? Oh, my days. Simeon, what have you done? Okay, there's no time to waste, Michael. <laughs> I buy one car and suddenly everything is locked. Dude, I got 24 hours and it started at 6 a.m. Okay, Michael, we better get to see me on quickly because I want to buy like literally everything. And right now he is not letting me do that. If we wait another day, then we're going to pay full price for those things. I want to be at least a billionaire by the end of the day, guys. This is so strange. I need to find answers. Simeon, what have you done to every single website? Time is running out, buddy. It took me an hour to get here as well. Why can't I buy anything? Literally everything is free. And what is going on in here? Oh my days. Yo, Simeon is like trapped in this car. That's a beautiful car as well. Hey, I can't even get to it, guys. That's so annoying. Simeon, tell me what's going on. Why can't I get to this car? And why can't I buy anything else online? You don't actually think I'm gonna give you everything for free, do you? You gotta do something for me first. This is my money, my stuff, and my business. Complete the quest for me, and I will let you buy whatever you want. <sighs> on a usual day, I would do something. You know, make sure Simeon just lets me do what I want. But on today of all days, I'm running out of time. I don't have time to do that. So Simeon, you got yourself a deal. I'll do the quest. And when I'm back, I'm going to buy everything in the GTA universe, including that beautiful car over there. <laughs> it's amazing. Let's go and carry on with this quest and see what Simeon wants me to do. Somewhere in this multi-story car park is Simeon's rival. I know, he's got a rival. And instead of like saying, oh, hey, friendly competition and all, he wants me to take out the rival. So, <laughs> I mean, I'm doing this in spirit of being able to buy everything for free. And there is the rival. Oh my days, dude. Look at all of those beautiful cars. Hey, that must be him in the middle. Okay, right, Michael. I think we'll be all right. Let's just walk over here. I'm gonna hide behind this. Oh no, dude. There's so many guards around him. What? Okay, I'm gonna try and just shoot this guy right in the center. Three, two, one, and... 
Uh oh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh, my days are shooting me. Him, him as well. Get him, get him. Yes. Okay, rival down. Michael, go, 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 go. They're shooting us, dude. They're shooting us. <laughs> oh my days. They had mini guns. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what kind of rival is this, dude? Oh my days. Okay, well, it's fine. I think I took them all out. There's the mini guns. I'll just pick up that thing in my bob. Oh my goodness. There were so many of them. Did anyone escape? No, I think we're good. I think I got all of them. Well, in that case, I mean, I'm surrounded by a bunch of lovely supercars. I think I'll just take one of them for myself. Since everything is free and Simeon won't let me buy anything. Come on, Michael, grab the car and let's go. Once Simeon finds out I've taken out the rifle, he will let me buy anything I want to for free. Who would have thought Simeon owns like everything in the entire world? I have no idea. Since when did he do this? <laughs> what has he and Franklin been up to? Oh boy, dude, I'm already a quarter of the way in and I've only bought one car. Are you kidding me? There's so many more things I can do. Okay, Simeon, check it out. I got your rival's car, the rival's down. You don't have to worry about a single thing anymore. All you need to worry about is letting me have access to everything in the world. Congratulations. Feel free to buy whatever you want to, but don't get too greedy. Okay, Simeon, that sounded a little bit cryptic, but it doesn't matter because I think I can buy like anything I want to. <laughs> Ah, oh, man, what do I get, guys? The Enos Windsor? Do I get the... Oh, the Turismo? Ah, oh, oh, my days, dude. There's too many things to choose from. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna get the whole page. Dude, I just love reading it in the corner. I think I'll go for the Golden Jet. These things are worth, like, $10 million, and I'm getting it for free. Wait, it's done it again. Speak to Simeon. Are you having a joke? Speak to Simeon. Oh, my days, dude. Speak to... What have I done now, Simeon? You've locked everything again. Simeon, this is not funny. And what are you doing here? Come on, man. Seriously, you... You told me I could buy anything. Hey, I wasn't lying. I let you buy anything you want. You just can't buy everything. I own it all. And I'm not giving everything for free. Not unless you do another favor for me. If I do this favor for you, Simeon, you better let me buy anything and everything for free. You got yourself a deal. Now, somebody stole a car from me and I need it returning. Grab the car and bring it back. Hey, guys, check it out. Simeon sent me to Franklin's house. <laughs> Franklin, this is a crazy party. So somewhere in the house is the car, and it doesn't look like it's any of these. They look like boring cars, stuff which Simeon wouldn't care about. He specifically told me it was gold. I don't see one around here, so I'm guessing it's in the garage. The garage door is locked. Oh, my days. I'm going to have to find the keys elsewhere. Oh, yes, of course. My name is Michael DeSanta. What do you mean? Sir, what? Yeah. Okay. You know what, buddy? I'm getting in the party, all right? <laughs> I'm going in, okay? <laughs> this is an amazing party. Check it out. There's so much music playing. This is so loud. Guys, there's Franklin and there's Jimmy. I'm offended. I'm deeply offended right now, Franklin. But you know what? I've got bigger priorities. Everything is free. And by the end of this video, I'm going to be so rich that you're going to be jealous, Franklin. You're going to wish to come to my parties. <laughs> so I got to find out where the garage keys are. Franklin, I left something of mine in your garage. Can you give me the key? Wait, what do you mean, no chance, Franklin? Come on. Let me have the key. I left something in the garage. <sighs> Man, old oh, man, are you really? Franklin, you've got to call me old man. Oh, okay, you know what, Franklin? I've had enough with you. <laughs> I am not an old man. See, I just took out Lamar like it was nothing. Now give me the key. This is how serious I am. Yeah, Jimmy, go home. This is big boy stuff. I'm closing down the party, Franklin. Yes, I gotta be such a buzzkill. You don't give me the key. Oh, my days. People are like running. <laughs> Run away, everyone. Run. See what's happened to your party, Franklin. Now it's a mess. Even Tr Tracy's here as well. Oh, my days. All right, Franklin, I just have to keep the garage, please. Important stuff's going on. Thank you, Franklin. Jeez, that wasn't so hard. It was just next to his front door. Oh, there it is. Yes. Simeon has no choice but to let me buy anything I want to for free now. Once I return this car to him, we're going to be home running, Michael. This is awesome. <laughs> okay, check it out. This is Franklin's car he stole from Simeon. It's solid gold. It's Zeno. It's pretty beautiful. And I got to return this back home now. Hey, Franklin, next time you steal a car from Simeon, do it more on the sly, okay? I have literally wasted 12 hours just working for Simeon right now, dude. I have so many more things I want to buy. So far, I've only got like seven different items. Simeon, I've got your car. Check it out. It is the solid gold Zeno. I hope this is the car you wanted because there was no other car around. <laughs> hey, Simeon. A deal's a deal. You can buy my special car and everything you want to online. <gasps> Oh my day. Simeon is letting me buy this car. So I'm just going to grab it. Check it out, guys. It is now mine. 
Yes, dude. I got Simeon special car. It's the Tesseract. I love the paint job on this. Oh, sorry, Simeon. Is he dead? Simeon? Oh, boy. Okay, one second. Is everything still free? I'm really sorry, Simeon. Oh, my days, dude. It is. But Simeon isn't letting me buy it because he's dead. Simeon! It was an accident. It was literally... Oh, my days. Oh, man. I was expecting to be able to buy everything once I did that job for him. Well, at least I got this beautiful car. I gotta say, it's lovely. I'll take it, you know? It could have been worse. It could... Oh, Dave's calling me. Hey, Dave. Dave, what do you want? Dave! Hey, Michael. Heard you're having trouble buying things. Meet me at the observatory. We can work something out. Well, I'm at the observatory, so Dave's meant to be here somewhere. Dave? Dave? Oh, he must be around the back. All right, leave the car, and let's go and find him. Dave, it's me. I'm here. Can you let me buy everything? I'm sure we can work something out. There's really not long left, Dave. It's, uh, more than halfway in. Okay, we've got nine hours left, Dave. Oh, yeah, don't make it a rush, why don't you, Dave? Oh, my days. Everyone's so relaxed about this, apart from Michael. I don't understand. I know. I know what you want, and I know what I want. I want to see this video get to 50,000 likes, and if it does, I'll let you buy everything for free. Really? Is that the only thing you wanted, Dave? Well, you heard the man. Guys, get the video to 50,000 likes. If you're still watching now, you have a duty to like the video. Amazing. Now on to phase two. I want you to steal a truck full of gold. Don't ask any questions. Some thieves stole it from the bank earlier. We need it returning without any questions being asked. So remember, don't ask any questions. Just do it. The number plate spells out B A N. Get me the bank. Whoa, guys, are you seeing this? There's so many police cars out at the Pacific Standard Bank. Ooh, I think there's a heist going on. This is really exciting. Okay, don't worry, guys. I was sent by Dave. Oh boy, there's a lot of police officers around. <laughs> Da, 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 da. Oh, I see it. Oh, my days. They go all the way down there. Jeez. All right, so there's the van. I got to somehow persuade them to let me drive it. It spells out van on the number plate. Okay, let's go inside, Michael. Let's find the robbers. Hello? Dude, there's literally guns out here. What have you done? There's hostages on the ground as well. Hello, guys. <gasps> Oh boy. Okay, he's right there. Hey, buddy. Uh, it's it's only it's only me. Look, I, I'm I'm here. I'm I'm helping you out. He's literally not letting go. <laughs> Don't shoot. Come on. I'm with you. I've done a million of these heists. There's like 50 officers outside. If you want to survive this, you gotta listen to me. Okay. I got a gun too. We can both point guns at each other, or we can actually work together. See, look, I'm on your side. I can scare hostages more than you. And oh, oh, oh got your foot. Sorry, gonna take the van now. <laughs> they weren't giving in, guys. There was no way I was getting that van. Okay. Officer. Oh my days. This shooting me. Dave, you didn't tell me they wouldn't shoot me. Jeez, get in the van. Get in the van, Michael. Why is he in the van? What? Oh, my days. Okay, go. Just go. Just go. But Michael, just go. Just get out of here. Go, 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 go. Move it. Oh, my goodness. That was insane. Hey, Dave, I got the van. Now, can you please let me buy, like, anything I want to for free? There's only four hours left of the day. Dude, I spent literally all day trying to get everything for free. Please, Dave, don't let me down now. Well, that's everything for now. Have fun and enjoy your free life. <gasps> yes, everything online is now free again. Okay, buy it, buy it, buy it, buy everything. Buy literally everything. I can still buy more things. Tank, barracks truck, cargo bob, I don't care. I'm buying it. This is amazing, dude. I just bought like a hundred different supercars and like every single plane, tank, anything out there. Everything online. It's all mine now, but I want to do even better. I'm going to go and see if I can find myself a luxury yacht. Maybe do some house upgrades as well. <laughs> Come on, Michael. We better get going. So I bought a couple of things. I got a few hydras. I got a big jet. I got a ton of golden jets as well. <laughs> Check it out, guys. I am now literally bowling. What you're seeing right here is worth at least $100 million. And check it out, guys. It gets even better because right over there is my brand new luxury yacht. This one is so exclusive that no one can buy this apart from me. And that's how you park the helicopter on top. Don't worry. I can buy another one of those. It's okay. This is where you eat. A nice little four-seater table. There's a giant TV. Up here is all the way to the seating area with a swimming pool as well. And right over here is one of the beautiful beautiful bedrooms. And right down here is my own very own gym. It's a shame because Michael doesn't actually gym. So yeah, this is just one of my many yachts. I could personally buy a million more of these, but I want to do even more stuff. So let's go back to Michael's house and see what we can do over there. Oh, just in time. Guys, look at this. I managed to upgrade the house. What do you think? I think it looks amazing, but I want to know what you guys think. Let me know in the comments. <laughs> but since the house looks nice, there's just one last thing I want to do. And now we're running out of time. I got to do it right now. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I got 
five minutes left. Quick, 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 Michael. Get in the driveway. Four minutes, three minutes. Oh, gee, two minutes. All right, I'm in. I'm buying this house. This is mine. This is mine. It's officially done. Oh, this is like the biggest house in the entire GTA 5. It's got the most amazing view. Look at this swimming pool. I can't believe it, dude. It is now mine. I can store all of my cars here. Now, let's go inside. Okay, check it out, guys. This is now the inside. <laughs> I've never been in here before. This is amazing. Wow. So there's the driveway. That's the kitchen. Can we go downstairs? I can go downstairs. This house has a basement. Are you kidding me? So this must be one of the bedrooms, right? Wow. Okay. They got the blinds down, but I'm in the basement right now. And let's go down even further. This is crazy. Ba -ba -da, ba -ba -ba -da, ba -ba -ba -ba. Check it out, guys. I even got another room down here. I'm collecting cars from the poorest, the richest, and the ultra rich in GTA 5. All right, Franklin, stop dancing and let's go and find some cars. <laughs> I wonder what the poorest cars look like. I honestly have no idea what to expect. But according to my map, they're literally all the way in the desert. That's really far away. They're owned by people who don't even have houses. So how on earth do they even have a car? Oh no, if I have to kick people out of that car, I'm not gonna be very happy. Let's just go there now and see what we have. I've arrived at the first location, and this is owned by the poorest family in the entire of Los Santos. Well, clearly not so poor because they have a car. But let's go and see what this car is. So is is it like in that trailer? Oh no, guys. I think they literally live in this thing here. That must be their car? What? How do you even call that thing a car? No way is this what I gotta collect, guys. This thing is literally a pile of trash. It's got pillows from old sofas as your seat. All right, there's the trunk. And then this is the engine, I think. This is such an old vehicle. But hey, let's not waste any time. Jump inside. There's a cola in there, which is kind of cool. And these are actually kind of comfortable pillows. Scrap unknown. That's what the car is. Cool. It is literally just called an unknown scrap car. But check this out. It actually drives. It actually goes pretty fast. I, I mean, I don't really know how fast these cars go, but this one actually goes pretty fast, guys. Reverse isn't great, and brake isn't too good, and acceleration's pretty terrible. Other than that, though, it's it's all right. All right, let's see first person. There's like no windscreen. I got a cola, though. Now, now the question is, does the radio work? Of course it doesn't work because there's no radio. What about the horn? There we go. It does have a horn. Congratulations. Oh my days, there's electricity. The light, aka the light. <laughs> <laughs> the one and only works. Fantastic. Look at me go, by the way, guys. We are speeding down the highway right now. This might be a pile of junk, but it's a pile of fast junk. So now I've got the poorest car. Does that mean I can get the richest car next? <laughs> Come on, Franklin. Let's go to the next location, dude. Ooh, I'm so excited, guys. The richest car is meant to be, like, somewhere in this building. I think at Pacific Bluffs. How do I get inside? Well, according to my map, it was somewhere around here. So let's take a look. How do we get inside this building? Maybe I gotta go around the back. I mean, after all, that's where the waypoint's telling me to go to. Okay, I think I found the way around the back. Okay, Franklin, go through here. I'm on this, buddy. Let's see. Where is this car? Now, according to this, it's on the beach Some. Oh, no. No, I thought I was getting the richest car. This is still a poor car. What do I have to do to get the richest car, huh? Wow, he's still smiling. He's still loving life. So let's take a look at this car, guys. This looks like a van currently owned by that guy. There's a mattress in the back. Oh, that doesn't look very nice. And there's flies on top of the tent. Oh, boy, this person's even poorer than the last one. There's some crates as your seats. At least they have proper seats this time. Let's just jump inside and it does work as a scrap burrito. This was once an actual van and oh, my God days. The amount of smoke which came out of that when I started the engine, this is gonna blow up like at any second, dude. I'm, I'm just saying it is not a reliable car. Whoa. It's barely even got working tires. How on earth is this even road safe, dude? It is such an old car and it's barely even working, but I'm still rinsing that guy on the highway. <laughs> and this guy, hey buddy, <laughs> screw you. I'm faster than you. <laughs> this might be the poorest car, but I don't care, guys. It's still a very fast car. Hey, bam. <laughs> And it's a pretty good one at ramming into other cars. Safe and sound. Right, Franklin, let's go and get the next car. This time, it better be the richest one. I've got two cars from the poorest. It's gotta be the richest next. Are you ready for this? The next car is somewhere in this neighborhood. And once I get this car, we might cause a little bit of drama. So we've gotta be careful we don't do anything like that, Franklin. <laughs> Get out of here as fast as you can. So the next car is still from one of the poorest families. When are we gonna get the richest ones? This is the third one. It's rusty, dude. Well, at least the front isn't too rusty, but come on, man. <laughs> what kind of cars are you giving me? Let's see if we can do some customizations to this, actually. I mean, it might be rusty, but I think this car could actually look pretty nice.
nice. They're gonna miss it, I know for sure. I mean, it's one of the upper end poor cars. Let's be honest, guys. It, oh, jeez. Oh, no, 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 not on the tracks. Not on the train tracks. Go back. So as I was saying, it's one of the upper end cars. You know, it's it's got like a nice front to it, and I can see a lot of potential in this car. You know what I'm thinking? I'm gonna take this to the customs and see if we can actually restore this car. Well, in we go to the Los Santos Customs. Hey, Mr. Mechanic, can you do something for me? Just, you know, fix up the car. Let's see what he can do. And now it is an actual nice car. I can't believe the restoration we have done, Franklin. This is so nice. Now I can confidently drive this around the city without worrying about wheels coming off or like people judging me or the car falling apart or even dissolving next time it rains. This is a really nice car. I'm impressed, dude. And considering this came from one of the poorest families in the world, they're going to be so amazed when they see this car in my driveway and realize they're not getting it back. Whoa, jeez. Did I scratch this? Ah, oh, just a little scratch on the side. You wouldn't believe this came from the poorest family when you look at those two. I mean, those two are not even cars, basically. Let's go and get the next one. If the next one is another poor car, I'm gonna be so annoyed. I've got a really good feeling about this. I'm in a really nice neighborhood. I think the next car is gonna be from the richest people. And this is the house, and there is the car. What? Check that beast out, guys. All right, we are now collecting cars from the richest people in GTA 5, and the owner is literally standing in the driveway. Um, lovely house you got here, man. Bop. <laughs> Yeah, don't worry. You'll be fine, guys. You'll wake up in the morning. Anyway, let's jump inside this car. It looks so nice. Check this beast out. Hold on a second. Is that a speaker system? Yo, guys, it has subwoofer base, like, in, in the actual doors of this car. And check out the inside. Dude, this looks amazing. It's got fog lights on top, six of them, even a tow chain and two fog lights around the front. Those tires are so thick. Wow. Wow. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm impressed. This is such a nice car. Okay, let's put on those lights. They're so bright. They're so bright, dude. <laughs> It's a Mercedes, which doesn't even exist in this world, by the way. This is like a completely different car. It's so rare. I can't believe I am driving this right now. All right, let's test out the radio. Pretty good radio. <laughs> That is a really nice radio. There is even a skylight ceiling, so you can get a tan as you drive. That is so nice. You know what I like about this? Are all of the different features around this vehicle. You know, it's got vent systems. It's got tons of windows. It's got really thick tires. I can't wait to compare this one against the other ones. I mean, guys, come on. This is like a proper car, and then the ones up there. <laughs> I mean, what even are they, huh? What, e what even are you guys? Uh, yeah, yeah, you just chill there in my driveway. Dude, I could charge more money by literally selling them for parts. You know, I could charge more money selling them as, like, ornaments. Dude, this they're, they're not they're, they're, they're worthless. <laughs> anyway, let's just park this car here. And uh, yeah, richest car, guys. It is so so beautiful. Check this out. And I can't even believe this car's better than this. I recognize this place. I take chop here for walks like every single day. Hey, nice house you got there, buddy. All right, the next car is pink, and it is in that driveway. Oh, beautiful. Right, one second, take out the owners. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, now they're dealt with. Let's jump inside this before someone stops me. Oh wow, it's a Six seater. Guys, this is a Dodge Durango SRT from 2018. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven seats, baby. All right, so this got seven different seats. That's pretty nice. It's got really cool livery design. These rich people really love these cars, by the way, guys. I mean, this is literally so beautiful. It's an SUV, four by four. You could probably drive this anywhere you wanted to. And because it's part of the Dodge family, there is really no road it can't go down. It's got pretty strong lights. Oh, wait, hold on. I got to test out the radio system, right? Just whack on the radio. Oh, I can't even hear it. I think that's so loud, dude. 0 to 60 in less than two seconds. That's what you want. For a 4x4 SUV, like, it literally doesn't get better than this. It is all of the high gadgets, high tech, everything like that. And you can fit two families in here. Anyway, I'm parking this one up right next to the old scrap car. What, do I even keep these ones? This is definitely an upgrade on the last car, by the way. But I really want to know which one's your favorite. Like, we're going to get some really crazy cars soon. And uh, if you like this one the most, I need you to tell me in the comments. I'm interested. I really am. So the next car is right over there in the car park. And we're at the observatory, by the way. We're not even at anyone's house. It looks really nice from the back. I have a feeling this is the first car from the ultra rich. Ooh, then again. I mean, it kind of looks a bit basic. I mean, the ultra rich are men own the best cars in the world. But it's still pretty nice. Hey, guys, let's see if we can, like, find out what this is. It is a Ford. Okay, guys, I think this might be the Ford GT from 2017. Yeah, it's a GT Ford supercar. It's a nice car. Is it one of the richest ones in the world? No, it's not. 
No, the door's locked. I gotta find the owner, guys. The owner could be any one of them over there. Okay, Franklin, let's see if we can do this. We don't have too long before, you know, we alert the police. I'm gonna start hitting people, and hopefully one of them has the key. You! Ah, oh, no, he didn't have the key! This guy, he was walking over towards the car. Come here, buddy! Come on, I saw you! I think it was this guy. Oh, no, he didn't have the key either! All right, let's take a look around. Anyone else looking a bit suspicious? This guy, he's the one. <laughs> You! Give me the key! All right, Franklin, let's go and open up that car. I can't believe it, dude. I got the car, and no one knows! All right, that was so easy. Oh, my days. It is really fast. Dude, this is the fastest car I have driven today. Screw it! All right, guys, I'm convinced this does not belong to the ultra-rich. I think there's still a few more cars to go. But as far as performance goes, this is the most powerful car I have driven today. I feel like a racing car driver from the inside. I'm not even gonna bother with the radio. I'm so glad we got your ability, Franklin. We would be dead if you didn't have that ability. I've collected a lot of cars already. The next one has to be the ultra rich. Let's go and get it right now and see what it is. So the next car is somewhere around that building. Can you imagine owning a house like that? That's right, Franklin. Put your helmet on. This could get messy. <laughs> so there's the car. Ooh, very nice. I love the style. You don't see many cars like these on the streets. What is that, a Hummer? Like, what kind of vehicle is this, dude? It looks very, very nice. The number plate says top car and there's some text on the side which says Brabus. Brabus? Brabus? I have no idea what that means. It's an off-road vehicle. It's kitted out for like every situation, dude. <laughs> Check this beast out. They're solar panels. I think they're solar panels. It's got solar panels on the roof. That's what you need, guys. That is so nice. Check out the display, dude. There is so much technology going on. It's a five-seater. There's even stars on the ceiling. Wow, they know what they're doing with this beast. They know what they're doing. <laughs> wow, I actually feel like I have so much control driving this, dude. This is really nice. And then quick around the corner. Ooh, guys, this is a really heavy car because braking is not as forte. I'm getting disappointed now, guys. I've collected so many cars. Some of them nice, some of them terrible. But where are the cars from the ultra rich? Franklin, this next one has to be from the ultra rich. We've collected four cars already. Yes, it looks like the next car is coming from the ultra rich in GTA 5. <laughs> guys, check out this neighborhood. The mansions here are worth more than anything I'm ever going to get in my lifetime. This is so nice. They have a big gate at the front. No other ways in, I don't think. Let's just go inside. This place is a palace. All right, let's just follow this driveway down. After all, I'm just after a car. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's see if we can grab this car, Franklin. Oh my days, hide, hide, hide. Guys, you won't believe this. It is the ultra rich car, but right next to it is The Rock. Dwayne Johnson, The Rock. Oh no, he must have heard I'm trying to overtake him in subscribers, which by the way, we're still trying to do. Help us overtake him by subscribing to the channel now. Okay, Dwayne, it's on, buddy. I'm taking you out and I'm getting that car. Yeah. Okay, go for the car, go for the car. Quick, get him, get him, get him, Franklin, get him. Screw you, Dwayne Johnson. I will overtake you in subscribers one day. Check out this ride. Wow. So these are the cars the ultra rich use in GTA 5. These are very nice cars, guys. It's somehow a Lamborghini. I don't understand it. How is this a Lamborghini? I, it's so nice, dude. This is amazing. Okay, check it out, guys. It, it drives pretty well. The handling is very, very smooth. Straight out of the gates. I think I've scared the neighbors. Hey, guys, chill out. It's... <laughs> <laughs> this is so fast. Well, I have just stolen a car from the ultra rich in GTA 5, and there's still more cars to steal. Believe it or not, they're somehow going to get better than this. I don't understand how. <laughs> this is already amazing. Let's look at the interior. So this is what the interior looks like. There are windows everywhere. Curved glass to venting systems. Feels like I'm a bee, and I'm not even a bee. <laughs> This is amazing. You won't believe what I've just discovered about this car. Check this out, guys. All right, so far, looks pretty normal, right? And then suddenly, the wheels go in, and now we're flying around. Wow! I had no idea you could do this! All right, this is the best car I've collected so far. I don't know about you guys, but this one's going down in my recommended at the end of this video. This is insane! I can fly this car back home. How amazing is that? Hey, Franklin, is that your house down there? Let's take this in for a steady landing, and that's about a steady as it's gonna get. And I'm gonna park this one up right next to here. <laughs> yeah, just crash it a million times so I don't yet. Check out this castle, guys. I didn't even realize this place exists, but it does. Oh boy, there's the owner. Watch out, buddy. Watch out. I'm just trying to land my helicopter. I don't know how to fly. Let's just dump it. <laughs> That will cause enough of a distraction. Don't worry. Right, so my car was like just down here. All right, perfect landing, Franklin. Wait, what? What is going on? Franklin, we gotta... 
Okay, I'm stuck, guys. Now I'm out of that predicament. Check out this ride. All right, guys. I know exactly what car this is. I've seen it a million times over. It is a Lycan Hypersport, and I think it's all electric. Yeah, this is definitely all electric. I am already gonna crash this down the drive. <laughs> All right, let's see how fast we can go just down this road, guys. Check it out. Three, two, one. <laughs> Look at me go. Guys, what did I say? It was a fast car. If you're driving this, you better have a will. You're not going to last a couple of days in this car. Crashing is suddenly so much easier to do. Have you seen the collection? <laughs> This is the best collection ever. Apart from the, the poorest cars, of course. They're not so great. But the comparison, guys. I mean, take the poorest cars and the richest car. I mean, doesn't even compare. Anyway, there's one more car left to get. I have a feeling this is the best one in the entire collection. Let's go and see what it is and grab it before they take it away. Come on, Franklin. Let's go. I recognize this neighborhood. This is where Dwayne Johnson lived. <laughs> no longer anymore, guys. If you need a house, move straight in. But I'm going to his neighbor's house because the next car, the last Last car is meant to be over there. Is this how we get inside? Is this the right one? It's so confusing figuring out which drive takes you to which house. I think this is the right one. It's a palace at the end of the day. Right, where would this car be? Oh my days, they have a giant chessboard? What? So I don't know what year this is from, but hey, it actually looks amazing. It's a Morgan, which means it's very classic. It's solid gold. It's got to have a pretty nice engine. Let's just get inside this car. It's going to cost several million bucks. Oh boy, this guy doesn't want me to go. I'm the one in the car, so I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> go, go, go. Wow, he really did not want me driving away. Don't blame him when you're taking a car like this. But bro, how could I not? It's so irresistible. How many cars do you see like that? It's kind of like they pressed in the back, you know, and then like pinched it back out. So let's take a look at the inside. This is so classic that it's completely different. There's all of these notches and buttons and wooden frames on the inside and a little bit of leather. It's only two seats. Hey guys, let's see what happens when I open up all of the doors. So now the doors are open. We got a trunk, two doors around the side and the engine one just opened opens down. Okay, that's that's really interesting. As for the speed and performance, let's test this out. 0 to 60, pretty slow, but can it go faster? Da -da 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 -da. Well, I will admit, guys, this is no like in Hypersport. I can tell you that much. We can actually drive this and not worry about crashing. Oh, we're skidding a little bit. We're skidding to the side of... <laughs> And I've already spun this baby out. Well, I'm taking this car back home. I've had tons of fun. As far as cars go, the ultra rich have some pretty amazing rides. I've had an awesome day, and now I'm going to sell every single one of these off, except for the poorest ones. They're probably going to go in the bin. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, slap a like on it, and don't forget to subscribe. Help us get to 6 million subscribers, and hopefully overtake the rock. And thanks for watching. My name is Nort, and until next time, stay awesome.